Hello friends and welcome! Thanks for tuning in! We are back with more Baldur's Gate 3! Here we are! Back in the city! Oh, we should probably um, heal up, rest ourselves. Uh, we've used a lot of spell slots. So, we're gonna do that. We're gonna have a little snooze, a little long rest. And then... Oh wait, sorry. We're gonna go in this building first where the murder target was. That's the one, we just haven't explored that building. That's the one thing left that we haven't explored in this area. And then maybe we could just check out, no, we've definitely been around here. Yeah, we'll just go look in this little general area. And then all we have left to do is uh, go see what's up in this side of the map, up here. Which, um, there's Kazador's palace here. Although apparently we can break into it from here, which maybe uh, I should do that access route. Although I'd also like to just maybe quickly explore this garden at some point too. We'll see. We'll see. We'll take th one thing at a time. But yeah, then I don't know how far the map goes up here, but then we do have that tombstone place. Although we're not going to do that this stream. And then, yeah, the Diabolist is over here, too. I don't know if we could talk to the Diabolist and then not do the rest of the quest right away for Raphael. But yeah, and then there's just the, um, the Steel Watch Foundry and then finding Minsk. And I think that's pretty much it for our quests. Like, we're... This used to be so many. There used to be so many of these quests. And now... Not too bad. Not too bad. Some of these are just, uh... Things that are gonna... We're gonna get to when we get to. But... Yeah, these are like the same quest, pretty much. Oh, Dribbles! We still have to find Dribbles body parts. I'm assuming we're gonna find this gruesome art piece at some point as we go along here, hopefully. But yeah, and then I'll oh, we have to do the dragon too, I forgot. We have to go back and fight Ensor again because we reloaded when we did it the first time. Well, we have to do that at some point, I can't forget. But uh, yeah, Castor's palace. We might go do that. So yeah, maybe I actually won't even need to really go, maybe we'll just explore this area uh, with the murder target, Frank, and then we'll go actually just right here and, and break into Castor's Palace this way. Maybe that's what we'll do. And then we'll just see exploring all this other area afterwards. We might as well, if we know that this is the way to do it. Sounds good, guys? <laughs> Dame Aelin, that's true. Hi, Aqua! Thanks for lurking, much appreciated. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Okay, so, yeah, I think that this is it. This is the entrance to the Pear Tree household, which is where our murder target, Frank, is. Good old Frank. It looks like we can also kind of go down this little pathway here. Is this all part of the same house? It might be. Maybe I can enter from that angle. That might be two separate houses, though. We'll take a look, see? But we've already been in this... Have we been in this house? We've been under... Okay, we're gonna look in all these houses. I'll try to be fast for me. For me. Being fast is basically other people's slow, but we'll try our best here. Okay, but first we're going to go to the beds. We're going to go to our bedrooms. We're going to snooze. And then we'll take it from there. Any recommendations, guys, of uh, people to bring to Castor other than um, Astarian? Do you think we're good with who we've got here? That's not what I meant to do. Because i just like to see who's got the fun dialogue. My team looks good. Shadowheart? Okay, we got we got Shadowheart on the team, so... Cool. Sweet. We're, we're ready. We are prepared. So what if we can cast a defense? Shadowheart's good at keeping us. Some garlic! I just ate some garlic. Or... Yeah, that was garlic. I just pressed, right? Hi, Johnny. How you doing? My team solid? Awesome. I pretty much always have Astarian and Shadowheart with me. I neglected Astarian for pretty much all of Act 2, but there's just so many things to lockpick in this in this city. I have to have him with me all the time. He's my little lockpick. Okay, we're ready. We're ready. A steak? Yeah, I should bring some steaks. How do you fight vampires? I'm hoping that we can like convince his um, brothers and sisters to fight with us, but if he wants to murder them, then maybe that won't work so well. 
And you overprepared for Castor. Interesting. So maybe it's not as hard. Okay, Sir Gerada Hoyt, what's up? We're not lost. Just taking in the view before continuing on our way. Somehow I don't believe you. I assure you, I know exactly where I am. No assistance needed. Mm. Okay. <laughs> the lower cities are bloody Warren. I'm surprised anyone can find their way around. It is actually very big and winding. But we're, we're making our way. You again? He must be as lost as we are. I've just been standing here the whole time. Okay. I show you. Okay, sure. I like how he's like, yeah, we're straight up lost. And she's like, we're not lost. What do you mean? Lost, schmosh. So this is where the dead people, the dead, the, the, the dead man is. Area under investigation. Right. Maintain your distance. Area under active investigation. By order of the flaming fist. You can't tell me what to do. I do what I want to do. Is full of criminals. The humble home of Frank Pear Tree. Frank Pear Tree. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to change my stream title to just Casador. Because I wasn't sure what we're going to do, and now I'm sure what we're going to do. And I want people to... Uh, let's. The people need to know. We're going to go Casador. That's it. We're gonna do it eventually. We're gonna make our way to Castor. We'll get him done. Get him done? Wait, did I just steal this mailbox and not even notice? Was there nothing in the mailbox? Oh, okay. Scribbled note. I've read that one before already. Okay. I just am not paying attention. Should I break this? It says that I will not be breaking the law to break it, so... Not that that would stop me. Just like that, guys. Kazor's hard to beat? Uh, we'll see how we do. A statement about his lockpick. I, I was gonna say I've never experienced a Starian's lockpick, but I guess we did with the Drow Twins. Although I didn't get to see it, unfortunately, so. I mean, I could take his clothes off and see it right now, but it wouldn't be in its full glory. Oh, what's that? Oh my. Yep, that's a dead man. That's a dead man. Okay, so I perceived one thing that one, but I did not perceive something else. What did I miss? Someone else? Oh, sorry, can you perceive this? I'm gonna just have Shadow Hearts bless guide you. Me. I mean, guide it's you. That's not the right one. Guide my man here. A friendly, family, friendly vampire. Perceive something. Yes. Nice. The things have been perceived. Okay, this man is straight up murdered. Okay, wait, I'm gonna close these doors so no one watches me as I loot the body. Hmm, I wonder who did it. Except it wasn't really the absolute. It was the ball lists. Although, I guess same, same. Same, same. You beat Kazor at level 9, Dino? Shit. Okay, so maybe he's not that part? <laughs> Lockpick the Kazador. Ayo. <laughs> we'll try our best. We'll try our best. Oh, Aqua, yeah, we don't want to spoil you, but thank you for hanging out. We, we understand. We understand. The spoilers need to be avoided. It might not be too much longer before I'll be on to a, ga a different game, so then you can watch without worries. Okay, what abides below? We are getting closer, guys, to the end. To the end of this game. Didn't perceive the corpse laying in the middle of the floor. <laughs> it wasn't the corpse. It was a... It was like some... Some... Uh... Planks, I think. I'm gonna click it in a second. We'll see. <laughs> you ate a lot today? Yum. Yum, yum, yum. I basically just ate breakfast for dinner. Okay, Plam on Dawn. I follow a girl on uh, Instagram with this username. She does art. Plam on Dawn tells us that Grey Harbor was a small coast. I feel like I've read this before, though. Yeah, I did. Because I remember seeing that name and thinking the same thing. I'm like, hey, I follow her on Instagram. Okay, pear trees hatch key. There's a hatch in here. Okay, we've read that book a million times. A million, I say. Where's his hatch? Oh, it's under the chest. Okay, fuck yeah. What's in here? I love how many hatches there are in this city. They give me more things to loot. Okay, let's read this note. Bloodstained parchment. We've read all these already. This was also in um, Alexander's house, I believe. 
when we found Alexander's dead body. Yep. Yep. But we've already killed the murderer, so it's okay. No one else will die. Okay, um... Okay, Frank, let me loot your body. Bloodied notes. Uh, this scrap of bloody paper is scrawled in an erratic, excitable hand. You've been picking where you shouldn't, Pear Tree. Placing the Lordlings' fire spitters throughout my city. Disgusting. They leave no blood, there's no art to it at all. Just burnt ash and corpse cinder. I walk through your basement here as I pen this. It's rather large, roomy. They'd never find all the bits of you if I spread them out here properly. Is that from Orin, I guess? That crazy bitch? Lordlings' fire spitters. Are those the steel watch? Orin's upset that they don't give pretty murders for her. Okay. Oh. Chest key! Okay, I'm assuming that's downstairs. Because uh, that chest did not require a key. Okay, let's see what's down the hatch, guys. Down the hatch! Batten down the hatches! Okay, um... Yes, we did, in fact, use that key. What do we have here? What do we have in this little home? What's through the metal door? Traps? Are there traps waiting for me? Oh, strong box. Is there a key for that? Oh, I have the key. Okay. Cool. Sexy. Sexy, sexy. Um, hmm. My gratitude. Dear Mr. Pear Tree, our business proceeds without fault and with lucrative profit. You will find this this meh 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 words are words. This success reflects in the upcoming deposit to your personal account. Should you continue to be such a willing tool, I can see many more deposits of similar magnitude making their way into your coffers in future. Um, did I already like rob all this money away? Maybe if they were in the bank, we did we, we did rob the bank. Um, I saw you spent the last payment with exceptional wisdom. Your new abode in the lower city is rather lovely. Men of both means and taste are exceedingly rare these days, and I would be so distraught were you to lose this beautiful home to a terrible accident of fate. So he's like complimenting him and kind of threatening him at the same time. Uh, discretion is a key pillar of continued home ownership, after all. You need not respond to this letter. I will write if you are needed further. Yours in faith, Enver Gortash. Interesting. So Orin was going after Gortash's lackey here. Okay, enhanced weapons sales ledger. This ledger records acquisitions and sales in Gortash's infernal weapons trade. Infernal iron acquired from diabolic sources use thereof in forging enhanced arms and armor and sales and distribution through Gortash's network and to other wholesalers such as the Zentrum and the Knights of the Shield. The final entry is as follows. Notes for Gortash. The Knights organization appears to be collapsing and sales to them are in steep decline. However, this is more than made up for by shipments to our new contacts in Ammon and the Athkatla receipts next month should make everyone happy. Pear tree. Except for you, Pear Tree, you're dead. You are not happy any longer. Look at all his weapons in here. I don't want to take them all, though, because they are heavy. Um, hmm. Oh, this chest, I will see what's in your chesticles, though. Mm, 46 gold, I'll take it. Oh, is this a lever? No, it's just a hook, okay. Best be on my way. Blood everywhere. Oh my. Oh. Who is this? Courageous little Kimabeth. Courageous little Kimabeth is dead. Oh my god. That corpse is huge. And is that a burning heart? What the frick has happened down here? This corpse is huge. Courageous little Kimabeth doesn't look so little. Yes! 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 Guys, we got another dribbles part! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! Is that the last part that we need? Is this the art? The art? 
display that we were looking for. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Hi, Peppermint. Oh my gosh. Oh, I've been looking for you for a long time. You darn severed arm. Oh, finally. <laughs> finally, that feels good. This basement is very large. This looks like your bedroom, blood and all, runner. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, Squish, I'm really looking forward to the next Fable game. I'm really looking forward to Paralives. I just saw they released um, the gameplay trailer of that recently. And then I'm also looking forward to um, the next Dragon Age game. And I'm looking forward to the next Mass Effect game, whenever that comes out. And I want to play that other like Life by You game. Okay, Yagashura the second. Lots of games. Uh, the effigy of Yagashura who burned his mortality. What use his heart? He thought himself a titan, but died whispering for his mother. Below is an exaggerated signature written in blood. Or in the red. Or in is so weird. She just like leaves little poems on dead bodies. What use his heart? He thought himself a titan, but died whispering for his mother. That's sad. So this guy, this big man, died whispering for his mom. A clown's arm. Dribbles, no doubt. Yeah, fuck yeah. Okay, is that all my dribbles parts? No. I still need to find another part. Okay, so that wasn't the gruesome art piece one. I wonder when I'm going to find that one. But we have um, his arm, his foot, his hand. Based on how Dribbles has been cut up, it looks like we found about half. We've only found half of it. Oh my gosh. Okay, we got a ways to go. I don't know where I'm going to find all this stuff. Okay. Okie dokie. Well, we're going to keep on looking. We still, I feel like we might find some of his body parts in, they all seem to be linked to these ballist murders. So, I don't know. We found his last body part was on one of Oren's victims as well. Maybe Oren's just having a lot of fun making me go on a wild juice, juice, juice chase, goose chase around the city to find all these parts. Sounds like something Oren would do, that son of a bitch. Okay, I'm just going to take this burning heart. It's not burning anymore. Okay. Just a casual heart. Sometimes you just need to wear your heart in your bag. Coagulating blood, guys. Fun stuff. Fun stuff. Dribbles is coming home. I'm, I hope so. I hope so. We gotta bring... We have to find all the Dribbles parts so we can reanimate his body. Is, is the goal. Okay, um, Infernal Contracts and Bargains. I think we've read this before. Okay, an offer. Dear Mr. Pear Tree, you come highly recommended by a select few, not merely for your business acumen, but also for your ambition. That is why I am writing to you a question of ambition. I have in my possession a tremendous quantity of infernal iron. Its acquisition is immaterial. What matters is this. I shall need assistance distributing the weapons forged from this exquisite iron. I shall need someone ambitious. Someone with, with less than scrupulous connections. Someone, Mr. Pear Tree, like yourself. That, Mr. Pear Tree, was the carrot. I often find it makes an excellent bedfellow to the stick. Consider your position. A less than scrupulous set of connections doesn't just make you valuable to me, it would also make you invaluable to any number of upstart city watchmen or flaming fists ready to make rank. It would really be a terrible tragedy for such bright potential to be extinguished in this way. I eagerly await your correspondence. Yours in faith, Ember Gortash. So he basically just blackmailed him into it. Oh, Gortash, I cannot wait to kill you. It's going to feel so good. It's going to be really nice when you're dead. I know Carlac's gonna enjoy it. <laughs> There's so many dribbles parts, I know. Saracen, yeah, me, me too. I am also finding this quest a little painful. Okay, Cassie, nothing in your body. It's, yikes, she's not looking so good, is she? I don't know who that lady is, but okay. I don't know why these people are hanging out. Maybe they worked for Pear Tree? Oh wait, what was that? Uh, Sword Coast exposed? Side of the Swords. Societies of the Sword Coast. The Watch of the Steel Watch, read that before. Um, okay. Have I read the. I think I've read that other one that I just picked up too. Secret Societies of the Sword Coast. Yeah. It's like talks about the guild and stuff. Harpers. Yeah, we read this. Um, 
think it doesn't talk about the guild. It talks about, oh yeah, but, but, but we did. We did, in fact, read that before, so <clears throat> the floor needs to be clean. Should I summon some water? Should I make it rain in here? <laughs> uh, there, that's true, there probably are juices in Orin's, in Orin's work too. Many bodily fluids. Okay, the hell's unleashed. Uh, have we read this before? I think we have. Indeed. Runner, hydrate, thank you! Send the maid, yeah. Yeah, Squish, I'm gonna explore every inch, so I hope I will also find all of the, um, the pieces and not be missing any after we've explored, because we still have places that we haven't explored yet, so... Okay, I got to Avernus, Avernus, one hellish holiday. We've read that before, I believe. Um, <laughs> okay, I think that's it in here. There was just um, a couple more houses in this row to look at. And then we're gonna go say hi to Cazador. And by say hi, I mean we're gonna kill him. And hopefully stop him from killing all of his children and hopefully stop Astarian also from killing those children and rescue the other children <laughs> lots of children <laughs> you heard the word water ah and we did we did hydrate we did the water the water the water water okay make it drip Hamilton <laughs> make it rain okay so I guess these are other houses. This is a cute little uh, little area. It's like little archways. There's a little uh, scraps of. Oh, this is where we were. We entered this before, I think, didn't we? No, we didn't. I thought that. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, this looks like an area of some suspicious individuals. Oh, this was the one, Baron's Coop. This is the one that we've been in before. Yes. No? Maybe so? No? Oh, well, we've looted that. But I haven't looted that. I've looted some of these things. Anti-hag. Okay, yeah, this is the one with the This is the one I'm thinking of. So we have been in this area to go into that home briefly when I was doing that hag quest and trying to do it lickety-split. But yeah, we have not actually chatted with these people, I think. Um, and I didn't loot all the things in that house. Let me just quickly... Click on these sacks. Yeah, we're gonna try and kick Kazdor's butt. We're gonna try our best. There we go. Important things. And look, garlic! <laughs> we might need garlic when we're going to face face the, the, the vampire man. Okay. Yeah, we read all that stuff before. Okay. So, um, let's see, we can go in that home and this home and read their mail. I love reading people's mail. This is the brew, brew. Spattered with rust, you can just make out the words, Tina Turkey's Good Time Bazaar. Tina Turkey, good time, here for a good time, not a long time. This also says Bruck, Bruck and Fishes Emporium? Is this a shop? You're supposed to be looking out for us. Out of ashes. Oh, I've got an overactive imagination. Try and imagine doing your job properly then. <laughs> so these look like they, they work for the guild for Nine Fingers. Is there someone on the roof? Is that who they're talking to? Oh, they okay, yeah. I was like, where is that coming from? Look at these are people's bodies burnt to a crisp. Is this from the Steel Watch? Okay, um Yeah, we're gonna check that all out. I don't know what they're they're doing here. Oh my god, this guy's name is Don't Call Me Runt. <laughs> okay, let's talk to you first, Tuz Grunt. Stop! What are you doing? Are you trying to sneak past Tuz Grunt? Do not worry. <laughs> Guild's friends are Tuz Grunt's friends. I'm a guild friend. And I don't hurt my friends. Unless they deserve it. <laughs> Hi, Cloven! Happy Lunar New Year! Hi, Mr. Waste Your Time. I think it's good to have a powerful imagination. Okay, so he recognized me as a friend of the guild. Cool. 
Um, which one do I want to go in first? Does he have anything else to say? Do not what? Okay. And I don't hurt my. Don't hurt your friends unless they deserve it, guys. Wall slot. He goes nothing. What does that do? I can insert an item into this wall slot. Not my dream. I don't know what to put in the wall slot. Maybe we'll find out. Let's read some stuff. Let's read this mail. Uh, big delivery. Mankey, Glitterbeard says we have a really, really heavy chest coming in today at the on the back docks. Make sure you've got a full six cash guards ready to help carry it inside when it arrives. Oh, and Old Glitter says make sure they're fully armored up. I don't know why. Take care of them, all right? I'll be out the rest of the day. Is that the one that Minsk was inside of? <laughs> okay, my safe deposit box. Stop banging on my door after midnight, you blasted near scared my pug out of its wrinkles. <laughs> Look, I already sent you the key to my safe deposit box box at the counting house. That's all I've got. Take it and leave me alone. You can't get blood from a moldy spud, all right? Just ask Nine Fingers. I'm sure she'll say it's fine. From X Scuttermore. Okay, but I've already stolen all this stuff. Do I have the key to this? Okay, I want to go in this house first, I think. The one up here. With don't call me runt. <laughs> Tina Turkey, so Hi. funny. Here's one. Bringing Jahara? Okay. Mess with us, and that'll be the last thing I'll do. I mean you do. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> the last thing I do. Okay. I'll bring Jahara again. We do know that she's friends with Nine Fingers. Okay, Karlak, I'm gonna say farewell to you just for, for now. Jahara can hold all this heavy stuff, though. We'll give some of that. I think we can send that to camp. And maybe we'll give some of this to our dear Shatterheart. I don't know if Jahara can hold all that. Let's see. Can you hold all this stuff, old lady? Not my camp supply, the heck it is. We just have too much money, what can I say? Okay, uh, will you hold our money, Astarian? Just like that. <laughs> That's all you need to do. Maybe this too. I think Dribble's body part's kind of uh, heavy as well. But, okay. Uh, Karlak, sorry, you're gonna have to stay here and eat some dirt. And then we will bring our dear friend, our dear old lady out with us. You think I should put a sword in the slot? Maybe sword in the stone? What's on your mind? Sorry, Carl. Oh, come on. <laughs> you don't mean that. Oh, fine. I'll be here eating dirt. That's always what you do. You're always eating dirt. Oh. Okay, Jahara, come hang out with me, please. Come on, Private old lady. Would be nice. There's a lot of things that it's good to have Jahara for in the city here. Yes? Come hang out with me. As you wish. Thanks, girl. She's encumbered. You're encumbered. I thought I got rid of your stuff. She's a, a tad encumbered still. Maybe um, Shadowheart can hold dribbles. There we go. Dribbles' torso is heavy. At least things have stayed interesting. Hmm. <laughs> the L song staff, yeah. They take care of her. Our dear Carlac. Okay. Um, anything else to say, Runt? I'm watching you. I called him Runt. <laughs> Don't cause any trouble, or, or, or there'll be trouble. He's so precious. He's so cute. Oh, what a delightfully secluded alley. I would have been in my element here once. But you can sort with a better class of people now, right? A different class of person. And a different type of consorting. Spoil small. Let's just stop this conversation right here, shall we? <laughs> just keep being, saying dirty jokes. I like how this guy is uh, singing songs up there. Okay, uh, counting house key, which we already have broken into. Night shift report. Last night went all right, I guess, but I had a bad feeling about it at the time, and I still do. There were some odd shadows lurking about. Never saw one in the light clear like, but what I did see through the gloom looked like it was changing shape. Sounds like Orin. And no, I didn't drink nothing. Keep an eye out tonight. 
Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, my. I don't think that there's much to see in here. What happened to this house? Okay, I don't think I can even go in here. Let's, yep, a whole lot of nothing. Okay, well. <laughs> not what I was expecting. Let's go into the other one. The other, the other, other one. In here. I still want to know what I'm supposed to put in that freaking wall slot. Usually they give you some sort of hint. I don't know. I could try a Harper pin? Any chance that this could be related to the Harpers? That's the, the thing that I put. Uh, there was a similar slot, right? That I had to. Not Harper key, her pin. Pin? There we go. Harp shaped pin. That one? No, but I have two pins. I have also engraved pin. I tried. We'll, we'll see what we can figure out here. Um, I don't know if I should go in here first or go down here. Maybe we'll talk to these guys first. Before we break and enter. Although it seems like I'm not going to get in trouble for breaking and entering, so that's good. I like it when I can do illegal things without re repercussions. Okay, hi Sparks, must gravel. Here's the nine fingers. Good luck. I've already seen nine fingers. She's not here, she's... She's down below. Who let you through? Tuskrunt? Bloody idiot. Tuskrunt's awesome. Don't be mean to Tuskrunt. Hi, Digital. How's it going? Better you than me. I'd take an empty alley over the guild hall these days. Hmm. I'd go inside if I were you. Before we change our minds. So this is another way to get down there, maybe? I've already been there, though. I've already made my way downtown, walking fast, faces past. Just another crate. Oh no, I love hmm. it. It fills me with purpose. Nah, it's great getting painted in nothing but scratch my ass. Dream job this is. <laughs> oh, the day was, would go by so slow though. When you're a busy bee, your days go by faster. You don't have to be like watching the clock for your full eight hours. Oh my gosh, these people are not looking so good. Okay. Uh, parchment. Miss Caldwell, I glean from your rather imaginatively written note that you wish to make contact with a former business partner. You're quite right in assuming that the circumstances of her death might make this rather challenging. Decapitation! Oh, I was about to say, this is from Mr. Carrion, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, decapitation has a habit of making such conversations rather one-sided, but I assure you my spirits and I will have no great difficulty overcoming such an obstacle. Given your afflictions, I would be delighted to offer a discount of, say, 10%, in the hope that the guild might see the value of such collaborations in future. I will be expecting you at my mansion near the seafront, and, of course, my discretion is assured. Yours in spirit, Mr. Carrion. I'm sure one of your ilk will be familiar with the security measures I am required to take. Secreta Mortuorum will grant you passage. Oh, so I could have maybe um, had a secret passageway to open that door that I just opened with my brute force. Oh well, my nose is leaking again. Right. Just another Here's entrance, one. hey? Okay. Hmm. Well, we'll go. We'll check it out. You am I homebound? Yeah, Dreams. debatable. I mean, Baldur's Gate is my home. Lyric. The whole Any city is my home, guys. So maybe I don't need your hair if I Not have already met nine fingers. Okay. Can we Common sense go talk to this man up here? Wait, did I talk to all those three, three of them? I don't know if I talked to all three of them. Hi, Terse. This ain't a public rooftop. It's mine, so piss off. Sharing is caring, sir. Clear off, for I'll push you off. I kind of want to push him off, but I will I will resist the urge. Clear off. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to go up here. I get the higher rooftop. I'm the cooler cat. Should I actually go do anything from here? I don't know what the point is of hanging on these rooftops. Is there anything to see? No? Okay. 
Just for fun. Just for shits and giggles. Okay, we're gonna go break into that uh, door. Now. Which I guess is maybe just another way to enter the guild. I, just, I don't know what to put in that slot. Circus poster. Should I put a dribble's body part in there? <laughs> Okay, sorry, can you open this door for us? Do your thing here, With sir. Pleasure. Toss the tosser, yeah. <laughs> I'm refraining. I'm going to be a good person. Something's gonna tell me what to put in that hole. Ayo. Okay, uh, register of goods received. An inventory of goods passing through the guild hall, ranging from basic food items to exotic alchemical blends of indeterminate purpose. Entries from the past 10 day grow increasingly thin, underscored by a note scrawled in the margins. Stone Lord hitting supply depots. Advise winding down most entertainment enterprises until he's been dealt with. Happy in apple, treacle chart, heart, I'll take him. Concerning my debt. Sir Akhtar, with the greatest respect, it is impossible for me to continue making repayments at the rate you require. No matter how many thugs you send around to the bakery, our terms were set well before the city's lockdown when I could still move materials freely between districts. To settle matters this 10 day, your representative agreed to take payment in the form of Kalimshan knots. Look for the half orc with the sticky fingers. Hmm. Clerk's letter. A report issued from the counting house where the writer appears to work as a lowly clerk. Head banker Glitterbeard is brutal, conniving, and entirely envious of the guildmaster station, but I think this is perhaps just his genuine personality rather than any indication of true descent. He will remain loyal, and he did. P.S. I believe he is aware that he is being watched and also that that is the entire point. <laughs> Caldwell's pouch. Wait, business proposal? Guildmaster, it has been my honor to provide you with the finest steel this side of the inner sea over the past ten years. You've always paid fairly, and your appreciation for small blades and their many methods of concealment has pushed me to improve my craft. In respect, I come with a request. Ten thousand gold to finance the next step in that craft. You've seen the clanking monstrosities lining our streets. The steel watch is a travesty, but the engineering behind them cannot be denied. The alloy in their construction is unique and completely wasted on metal men. It could do so much more fashioned into arms and armor for flesh and blood fighters. And yours would have the first pick of my stock. Interesting. Sounds like a decent enough proposal. Okay, yeah, it looks like there's another hatch in here. Guys, I want to know what I'm supposed to stick in that hole. Okay, Patriarch's letter. A series of letters issued from the personal desk of a city patriarch, apologetically outlining that it would not look proper for a member of the government to attend the guild hall in person. Each letter grows more obsequious before the final entry changes tack entirely. It would, of course, please me to attend the guildmaster in person. We need speak no more of my debts. Hmm. Suspicious. Suspicious. Rusty dagger, should I stick that in the hole? Uh, Lineker's... Lineker's pouch. Gold. Rope. Some clothing. Oberon's pouch. Gold, uh, I'm just taking all their money. Chest, locked. Hatch. I really don't know what I'm supposed to put in that in that hole. Okay, let's uh, lockpick this one first. Perfection. Raven, hi! No, we're going to go see Casador after this. We're just exploring this area, and then we're gonna go straight to go say hi to that evil, evil man. I'm curious what he looks like. Guild ring. Oh, maybe that's what I'm supposed to put in there. Okay. 
We'll try the guild ring in the hole. Uh, maybe before I go down the hatch, let's try that. How about this? How about this indeed? Okay. Guild ring. Sexy! That's so sexy! Okay, we'll go down there, but first let's check out the hatch. I think that's just gonna bring us to where we've already been, but let's see what's down the hatch first. Cassadora, yes. I'm gonna go see Cass and his ass. Does he have a juicy booty? I don't know. Only time will tell, guys. a lot of letters okay uh, pleading letter Guildmaster, I hope you remember me I knew you when you were still little Estelle I helped your parents search for you in those dark days when you were missing and celebrated with them when you found your way back these new guild rates are strangling business I've sought an audience with your bursar already he tells me it's wartime and city needs a well-provisioned guild I tell him, and you, that the city will still need its cobblers when all of this is done. Please don't forget where you came from, Custom Mean. Yeah, sounds like, um, she's, uh, being a little, maybe, extreme here. Hmm. Um, a field report indicating the status of the guild's war against upstart new rival, the Stone Lord. I guess that's why she's asking for more money, because the Stone Lord's stealing all her shit. Uh, Oscar Fetcher Halorn, unknown. Fetcher's brats taken into Guildhall. Goblin Benny driven to ground. Workshop in Bloomridge destroyed. Uh, sewer keepers slain, hideout burned. Body of Kingpin Genemine Copali not recovered. Hmm. Bellbreakers unknown. Frewer the Nail investigating. Children of Horror pursued Stone Lord alone. Dozens of bent iron coins. Crew's holy symbol found bloodying a fountain in steeps. Yeah, I really would like to go see Minsk again, too. Okay, eyes and ears report. Boss! <laughs> the comma is down here. Been watching over the Harper's house like you asked. They're definitely a soft bunch. Took me for an orphan more than once and invited me in for supper. Aw. They're talking about Jahara's house, I guess. Uh, I don't think they need guild protection, mind. The half-orc and the elf go armed, and even the little girl looks like she knows how to use that wooden sword she carries around. I can linger around a while longer if you're worried, though. That orc can cook. Aw, cute. She was making sure that Jahara's family stayed safe. Okay, seeking letter of credit. Esteemed Bursar Akhtar, while I entirely understand the guild's newfound need for funds and their role in protecting us from this dreadful stone lord, I simply cannot countenance the removal of your guards from my store. Our favorite patriarchs rely on my business to keep them properly attired, to face the many complexities that come with governing our city, particularly in times such as these. I suggest a compromise. Rather than paying your new and perfectly reasonable tithes outright, <laughs> perfectly reasonable, uh, I would be happy to receive a letter of credit for same, just as I extend to my own valued customers in times of trouble. In addition, I would be happy to offer a 20% discount to your guild soldiers so that they might be properly outfitted when watching over my establishment, as well as a 50% discount to your own esteemed guildmaster. Is she not, after all, the city's fifth and unforgotten duke? I trust this will be satisfactory. Yours, Gerard Denson, proprietor of Fine Fabrics, Upper City. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, uh, my gosh, so there's a lot of letters here. Uh, note from Kingpin Rilsa. Boss, better you hear it from me first. I broke peace with the Pashas last night. Their headman appeared in my court talking about how your day was done. He kept saying he knows how you think, how you haven't got the taste for this fight with the Stone Lord. I've enclosed his finger. Sorry for the mess, but he knows your mind a little better this morning. Little Kalisham stands with you still, all of it. Real Sarayal. Okay, Mutiny Loves Company. Keen. Nothing so sad as an old wolf who doesn't know her time leading the pack is done. So consider this your notice. The Stone Lord's got you running scared, and now you're hiding behind the Zentrum to keep him from your door. My crew and I won't cower in the guild hall along with you. If you can't beat the Stone Lord, then I suppose we'll just have to join them. Uh-oh. So they left. 
Okay. Da, da, da. Which ones have we not read? I don't think. Did we read the status report one? Nail status well, report? Hello. It's not letting me click it, so I have to pick it up. And then I can read it. Where did you put it? Sorry, in. There. A letter signed by one Fruward the Nail, who appears to address the recipient with a mix of deference and familiarity. Boss, the bell breakers are gone. The belfry they were nesting in was nearly torn clear off the temple down on Heapside. Definitely the Stone Lord. Investigating another line of weapons and warriors to wield them, we won't have you leaning on the Zentrum any longer than you need to. Fruward the Nail. But didn't this other thing say that Fruward the Nail, like, died? Uh, this one? Oh no. For the nail investigating, okay. Did we read this little apothecary one? Uh, no. Master of the Guild, it will not have escaped your notice that I have doubled my latest batch. Consider this my parting token, free of charge, as I regretfully inform you that I will be leaving your employ. You've long appreciated the craft of alchemy without moral functions, and it appears our Archduke-to-be feels the same. Oh, Siding with Gortash. Oh, my nose is so itchy, guys. Oh my goodness. Um, he's an old acquaintance, and he has offered an opportunity I simply cannot refuse. It is my understanding that market pressures have caused your own operations to shrink considerably in recent times. So let us call this serendipity and part amicably. Yours, the apothecary. Hmm. Okay, and then the other one we have not read is... Letter from the Dockers Guild. A letter from the chairwoman of the Dockers Guild. Nine fingers, from my esteemed organi organization to yours. The Fist and their Steel Watch still insist on searching every shipment that comes in. Trading vessels are trying their luck further up the coast, which means less work for my membership. If there aren't any shipments for your people to protect, then they aren't, there aren't any protection fees for my people to pay. That would be a sad day for commerce. Don't you agree? Oh gosh, this is a lot of stuff. Wooden crate, burlap sack. Okay. Mutiny loves company. What else have we got in here? Oh. Hmm. What's that? A hatch? Are there multiple ways? Get into this place. Rosie Moore and Fire Wine. Oh, a lemon. Oh, he's encumbered. That lemon was too much for him. <laughs> much too much. Um, okay, he's just got too much gold. Let's do that. I still don't know when I'm going to use that bomb because I'm definitely not going to blow up all the Gondians. Maybe I can use it on the Elder Brain or something. In the end. I mean, I'm still just assuming that I get to fight the Elder Rain, but hopefully, hopefully I do. Hmm. A quick rummage. Okay, we've uh, read this inroads one. Upcoming knife fights. Tethered knife fights are back. Next ten day, it's a revenge bout between baby jowls and three piece. Plus a newcomer matchup between Magpie Davis and Hands Leather Feather. First blood only. Place your bets in advance with Berser Uktar. Then um, file under Diabolus. We are gonna go meet a Diabolus, I believe. Hmm. Kingpins, take note of the Diabolus Helsic at the Devil's Fee. A person valuable to know if you need information on infernal matters. I'm gonna go meet this hel this uh, this this. Diabolus tells sick at some point. For example, when blackmailing a target with a fear of devils and the diabolic, the rumor is that this diabolist has even opened a transplanar portal to the hells for Gortash back in his organized crime days. Useful knowledge if you want to terrorize someone by threatening to send them to Avernus. That's what he did to Karlak. So little time. Okay. Okay. Um, I think that's it. We're gonna now just go. Oh, wait.
wait. Oops, I didn't look at the thing that I discovered. <laughs> the hatch. Oh. Oh, hello. I thought it was a hatch. It was not. It was a button. Traps. Oh. How considerate. Very considerate of you for noticing those for me, Astarian. Thank you. I appreciate it. You are a very skilled man. We will reward you by going and killing your fake daddy in a second here. Oh, another guild ring. Good thing I already found one. Cool. Got the goodies. And now we are ready to... Go check out that entryway we found, and then go to the man himself. Kaz Adore, who we do not adore. Quite the opposite, actually. Rocky's being a cutie potato right now. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna save, and we're gonna go see where this leads. I think it's just gonna lead to where we have been already. Blood. No, never mind. I knew that's exactly where I expected this to lead. Okay. Okay, well, we've already been here. We can go talk to Nine Fingers again. But we'll maybe do that later. Should I just go tell her how? Maybe. Okay, fine. Maybe I'll go talk to her about Minsk quickly. And then we'll go back out and uh, go to Kazdor. I kind of want to talk to Maul again. Maul's just hanging out there. Oh well. What up? What's up for discussion? Lady. We haven't known each other for very long, so perhaps oh, I ought to clarify. She's going to tell me to stop talking to her again. When I say, don't interfere or else, most people avoid finding out what or else means. Oh. Oh, I mean, she is she asking about... Oh, okay. She's talking about Minsk. I thought she was just saying leave me alone again, but she is saying... Why did you go do that when I told you not to do that? <laughs> Hi, Paranoi. How's it going? Hello. Hi, Jamie. Thanks for joining us. Um... Nine fingers, yeah, she's got like one of her, uh, like her picky finger or something. I looked, it's like half chopped off. I don't know what happened, but, um, I suppose I was just curious. I told you to hair and I would handle it. Just let us. Your ambush was a complete failure and it would have been worse if it hadn't, if we hadn't been there. It's true. Um, I don't know what to say, guys. I mean, I kind of want to tell her three because it did, it was a failure. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I'm just gonna say I was curious. Curious by nature, are you? I'll be nice. Never wondered what it's like to have your skin peeled off. Mm, no, never no really No threats, wondered. Estelle. We are your allies, whether you want to see it or not. You're still the city's best chance of sending the absolute pack in. So, yes, I need you. I even like you. Really? But know that I do not need or like anyone so much that I will let them cross me twice. You want to handle Minsk? Then handle him before I do. I will. I will. Thank you. Okay, nothing else to say to me? Come to derail any other guild operations? Spit in my eye, perhaps? Maybe. Or do you just need something? Maybe I just want to chat. What can I do to help you? You have done plenty. Do any more, and the guild might have to take a special interest in you. Understood? Great. I thought you said you liked me. Any information? Knowing what I, I know, I usually already asked comes all this at stuff. a cost. But let's say we'll put it on your tab. I've asked her all this stuff already. Did I ask her this? I, about the Zentrum? I think I did. You don't. The Zentrum work for me. 
time was, I'd charge the bastards double if I let them into my hall at all, but... Times change. The Guild is many things, but it's not an army. If the Absolute keeps pushing in on our territory, then I need a little way to push back. Okay, we've already talked about these things. Okay, let's go back um, out. Anything you like? Let's talk price. See anything of yours? No, you didn't. We'll go back out here and to uh, Casador. To Casador's place we go. Will he try and eat me like grandmother? Maybe. Maybe. Okay. So we've already explored everything here. I believe. Twins! Oh my gosh, twins, thank you. Thank you for gifting that sub to Runner. That's very kind of you. That's very sweet. Thank you, Dwins. Okay, actually, we'll just go check out this area. Enjoy your sub runner. We'll just go walk up these stairs because we haven't done that before. Oh, yeah. We gotta talk to this geezer. And then I think we can go over to Castor. Bizarre Palace. Oops, I won't steal your stuff. Hi, geezer Loris. Do you know how hard it was to get those cabbages into the city? Cabbages? No, you're impossible. Are you my cabbage man? My poor sweet vegetables. They deserved better. Reminds me of Avatar with the cabbage guy. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Sass, uh, for joining us. Hi, how you doing? Oh, hello, hello. My beautiful cabbages. Some pocket change, yeah. <laughs> my cabbages, see? I think this might be an Avatar reference. My cabbages. My poor sweet vegetables. <laughs> they deserved better. This guy gets extra mad if you run a monk. Is that true? Because that would be hilarious. <laughs> My cabbages! I really hope that was a, pur a purposeful avatar reference. Okay, wait. Anything interesting around here? You gonna spot or perceive anything? No? Okay. I tried. Okay, and then just up these stairs. How are we to these people? No matter how many steel watches Lord Gortash tries have to we been in this home? Old Joel's, actually? We might have not been in this place. No, I don't think we have. Sorry, I keep this avoiding Castor. We're gonna house. go. No letters, no clerics, no herb sellers, no potion peddlers, and no steel watch. I'm gonna break in, though. I hope you don't mind. Um... Hmm. We don't have a friendly looking the key for this, I guess. Okay, uh, can you do this for us? Careful, I died. Do you know how we have some fire bending? Oh, over there. what did you just perceive? Something inside the home, probably? Yeah, there's something inside this house that he perceived. Okay, but first, very, very quiet. Let's. Lockpick this. Don't let anyone see you do it, okay? Scotty! Oh, we all have to take care of this. Okay. No one, no one. Look at us. When we go in here, we're not supposed to be in here, okay? I'm gonna save again. I'm scared. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Come on, friends. There we go. No one's ever gonna know that we were in here. Okay. Old Joel, where are you? Joel's chest key. Okay. Let's 
steal all your stuff, Joel? What did I just perceive? The key. That the key is probably what I perceived. Okay, but where's your chest, Joel? Oh, here it is. Oh. All's well, I hope. Didn't mean Aside to. Aside from the obvious. Sorry, Shadowheart. I just want a little look. Um, I'm pretty sure Trust I me. have the chest key. Sorry. Can you open that for me? What the F, man? I just picked up the key! It doesn't even work on his chest! Neither seen nor heard. That's strange. Huh. Weird. Okay, let's read this letter from S Sly. Father, I've heard about a, short, a risk of shortages in the city. I know you're absolutely unforgivable when it comes to shopping for yourself, so I've sent some victuals that could see you through a whole season if you pace yourself. Do it for me, hmm? I love you very much and will be home for a long visit before you know it. God's willing. All my love, Salai. Uh, P.S. Will you tell Kathora I say hello? I've already sent Uli your love a thousand times over. Hmm. I'm so confused at what this key is for. Is that just a bug that it's not opening that chest? We've opened all these things already. Okay, I guess I'll just lockpick it. A crooked touch. Easy peasy. Maybe there'll be a chest within the chest. and meditations of the sun soul i am the embodiment of radiant light shining forth with the power of the sun i walk the path of the sun soul radiating love and compassion to all beings i honor the sun as a symbol of life and creation embracing its energy as my own which eat with with each breath i draw in the sun's energy renewing my strength and resolve my inner fire burns bright, empowering me to overcome any obstacle. I embrace the brilliance of the sun, letting its rays guide my actions and decisions. Through selflessness and service, I bring the light of the sun to all to those in need. I am a vessel of divine radiance, channeling the sun's energy for the betterment of all. Oh, thank you, Runner. Thank you for leaving the lurk. I really appreciate it. It's helping me keep my averages up. Thank you, Sweet Dreams Runner. Thank you, thank you. Um, okay. Nobody That's get good. mad at me, please. Okay, I think now maybe we're ready to go towards Casador. I keep saying it. Let's just talk to these two. One day, even. Mama Felice. But not yet. The hostel's up that way. You won't oh, find better around before, here. I think. Unless you can pay for it. I've already spoken to you, I believe, Mama Felice. Gods. Oh, maybe not. Oops. Gods. I miss fresh air. Never dreamed I'd bring my family to a place like this. Halston would agree with you. Oh, wait. Oh, no, it's just because it's sorry and talking to them. That's why it's showing two. I don't want to do... Hazel, not... Work is so boring. I don't get why adults like it so much. Do they? Do they like it though? Yeah. Work. Okay. I think I had spoken to her, but just not as a Starian. Because this is the the hostel which we have been inside of up there. Okay. And then I think that we spoke to these people too. Lord Gortash has to make some tough decisions to keep this city safe. I hope this rabble understands that. Fuck Lord Gortash. Lord Gortash has to make yeah. some I think I spoke to all these people, right? I just wish it was as safe behind the walls as the Gazette says it is. Edgebard, I do some. I just wish okay. it was. Okay. 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 I think I chatted with you all, right? Why would they go to all that effort just to lie to us? I think so. It's obvious, isn't it? Yeah, I've gone Perhaps in those wide racks. Nice. Yeah. Okay. They don't like me. I think it's time to go towards, yeah, there's the wine festival. I would like to explore this area, but first we're going to go over here. Go to Castor. It is time, because I get paid hazelnut, yeah. 
Oh, don't live to work. We work to live. Okay, it's up here. This is the way we gotta go. Considering an army of cultists. We found our moment. We're gonna do some sneaky sneaking. The moment is upon us. Kazor, we're coming for you. We are coming for you. Sar Palace South Tower. Okay, um, how are we feeling? We've got, uh, spell slots what for all. Comes? Yeah. Oh, we don't have any luck. Sorry, doesn't have any luck. I don't know if that's worth it to, re to rest again. It'll probably be fine, right, guys? <laughs> okay, here we go. Sar Palace. No going back now. We're gonna sneak in. Sneaky, sneaky, like. Time to press ahead. Loot some more things. Climb some ladders. Break some glass ceilings. Stained towel, rib cage. Okay, sure. I also keep rib cages just hanging out in my basement. <laughs> it's definitely gonna be fine. What's gonna be fine? Uh, us fighting Casador. Let's have it's, a look. It's gonna, it's gonna be great. Okay, who's above us? Giant rat. Jared. Mer mm, giant rat. Giant rat. Giant rat. It says someone's name over here. Marini. Okay. Should I put my speak with animals on since there are giant rats above us? I'll just wait until they're in front of me. Or maybe. What if I? Okay. You never know. It could trigger a cutscene. We've got enough. We'll drink one. Okay, up and at him. <clears throat> Hello. This is the palace of Kazador Zar. Entry is forbidden. Leave now, citizen. What about Astarian, though? The guard's words are clear, but spoken without thought or intent. Oh. Behind her eyes, you see nothing. She must be one of the charmed thralls Astarian mentioned. Intimidation, another word from you and you'll fly out this tower. Deception, I am inspecting the security on your master's orders. I'm here to kill Kazador Sar. <laughs> um, let's just try, I'm inspecting the security. His favorite snacks, oh no, the rats. Yeah, poor guy. Poor guy. Hmm. Um, oh, Andromeda, thank you. I forgot to switch back out from Jahara. You're right. Um, thank you. I did want Karlak with me. Although I feel like... Uh, maybe Gale would do better damage than Karlak. Of course. Whatever the master desires. Nice. She believes me. Enter freely, and of your own will. I will. Key to the ramparts. Sweet. Jared. Recklin. Okay, yeah, we don't want Jahara anymore. I do like that um, Carla can carry better stuff, though. But maybe... My nose is itchy. Do I want Carla or do I want Gale? Because Gale or Will would do more damage. I feel like Carla used to be so good at doing damage, and now I'm just like... Karlak, you don't seem to do as much as you used to. At least just with that fight we did last time. Do I need to give her a better weapon? Is that why? Maybe. Okay, wait. At least we know that we're gonna say bye to Jahara. I guess I'll try Karlak. Hopefully I won't regret it. I feel like I might do more damage with Gale's spells, but oh well. Always at your side. Yes? You're sure? Sorry, Jahara. Later then. I tell you not to get in trouble, but I suspect it will find you whether you like it or not. Oh, you think I could have given her a weapon she's not proficient with? Maybe. I'll check. 
Sounds like something I would do. <laughs> Hi, Icarus. Hello. How's hey, it going? soldier. Thanks for joining us. Let's go, go, go. Okay, Carlac. Hey, good looking. Yeah, she can use it. But maybe I've got better options for her. Yo! Yo, girl! Okay, do I have any other um, good weapons? Little mace, short sword. Hmm. You think I should use an axe on her? Hello, Vess! Welcome in! Oh! Tavern Brawler! I don't know, maybe I do have that. Doing double bonus damage. Because <laughs> I feel like... But I also, maybe she's just doing more damage because we were fighting easier enemies before. I haven't used her in a while, so that could be it. Um, Halberd of Vigilance. Plus one bonus to shift rolls and advantage on perception ability checks. When you make an attack roll as a reaction, you make with advantage. What this one might be better than what she's got right now. Do I have any other good ones in my inventory, though? Why am I holding so many keys? Um, okay, where's my keychain? Let's just clear out some of that. There we go. Um, ba -ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Okay, I'm going to put some of these options in her inventory here. Um, Would I want her to hold the blood of Lathander? <laughs> I'm just gonna put a couple in here and see. Check them out. Um, Raven Guard Scourger, I don't know. What was the one I was just looking at? This axe, I think. Do 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 um, Foe Breaker, Hammer Half, okay, there's a lot, I like, these are sexy, I'm gonna look at them all, um, Exterminator's Axe, that might be pretty good, hmm. and then, yeah, this Halberd of Vigilance, she's got some options here, um, the Skin Burster, Worst conduit. Is that good? I don't know. Do I use that ever? Will that? Would I use that ever? <laughs> Any other options that might be good for me? Mm. Mm. I have a lot of weapons <laughs> that I don't know what to do with. <laughs> Okay, I think that's, I don't know, some of these are pretty sexy. Hmm, hard to choose, 99, thanks for the biddies, thank you. Um, <clears throat> why is who so small, Squish? <laughs> God bother, my weekend's going pretty good. Pretty good so far, basically just streamed, that's all I've done. <laughs> Hi Johnson, thanks for joining us. Um, sound like my ex, Ayo. <laughs> Hi, Leo. Hello. Corpse Grinder does sound pretty cool, right? Cannibal Corpse. Oh. Okay, um, let's take a look at some of these ones. Uh, gosh. Oh, why can't you just show me what's in my hand? Will it do that if I go not this, but this? Nope. Okay. Um... Well, it looks like this exterminator's axe is pretty good. Oh, it does uh, deals an additional one to six damage, but only to plants, insects, or small creatures. Uh, foe breaker uh, ignores bludgeoning resistance. Uh, when you miss an attack, you still deal bludgeoning damage. Halberd of vigilance. This one's pretty sexy. Plus one bonus to initiative, and advantage on perception and ability. Hammerhaft. 
When the wearer jumps, they deal thunder damage in a radius of... I do make her jump a lot. Um, and you also have tenacity. Infernal mace. I feel like I'm not going to use these infernal maces. Um, or I could give her the orphic hammer. Advantage on a plus three. Unshackling strike. Advantage on saving throws against spells. Raven Guard Scourger, Tenacity Commander Strike, um, probably not going to give her Sluna Spear, just a regular Short Sword, Staff, uh, the Skin Burster, when the wielder deals melee damage, they gain plus two, so what exactly is Force Conduit? Oh, okay. One to four damage in a six meter radius. Hmm. And then we've got Twist of Fortune. Reroll and take new results. That's pretty good. Zion. Zigzend. <laughs> Once per short rest, in case the target in Fairy Fire for two turns when you miss. Oh, these are hard. I don't know what to do. Hmm. I don't think I should use the Orphic Hammer. <laughs> Johnson broke your keyboard. Oh no, that sucks. Oh. But thanks for watching on mobile. <laughs> My character looks small. Oh. Well, she does. She, yeah, right here. She does. <laughs> She's just a little itty bitty baby. Little itty bitty baby. Um. Hi, Holiday. Interesting. Oh, at the grocery store, yeah. Mm-hmm. Gotta prep. Gotta prep. Okay, so you think that I should use the Exterminator's Axe or the Halberd of Vigilance, maybe? Mm. Hmm. The Exterminator? Let's try it. So that's plus nine, six to 17. What do I have before? Before I had that, the one I had before is better. Plus 10, eight to 18. This is plus 11, eight to 17. Mm, skin burster. 10, 7 to 16. I feel like um, 6 to 17. Maybe the Halberd of Vigilance? Hmm. Tomorrow's the Super Bowl. It is. But is that a high holiday? <laughs> it is. <laughs> but yeah, it makes sense that the uh, grocery stores would be busy before the Super Bowl. I will not be watching the Super Bowl, but I am interested who will who will win. Foster check. Okay, Squish, thank you. I don't think I have any stacking stuff. <clears throat> oh, yes, no, I'm definitely not going to get rid of the <laughs> Blood of Lathander. Or, um, I mean, the, the hammer. I'm not that dumb. <laughs> I mean, I can be dumb sometimes, but I'm not that much of an idiot. <laughs> to get rid of the Orphic Hammer, can you imagine? <laughs> that would be stupid. Um, hmm. I think I'm gonna try this Halberd of Vigilance, maybe? I don't know, though. Hmm. I do like the, the, the extra fire damage, but it's only for plants, insects, and small creatures, so. I don't know. Force damage. I know it is pretty good to have force damage. The extra force damage. I'm gonna try that one. I'm gonna give it a try. Okay. I think I can send all this stuff back to my inventory for now then. Into camp, I mean. Okay, we'll try that. Uh, sorry, and can I get rid of some of the stuff you're holding? Very 
heavy here. Oh wait, let's just sell some of this crap. Bolo, take my crap, right. please. Whatever happens next, be sure that I will document it all as accurately as possible. I believe in you, Bolo. I'm sure you will. Try your best. Okay, where are these? I thought he had some paintings. There. All the junk I've collected, Bolo. I know you love to take my junk. Honey. Okay, maybe I'll, now I'll get to give Chessa and Cass their practice sword that I've been holding on to this whole time. <laughs> In the hopes that maybe it'll be useful. But I don't know. We'll see. Never a dull moment. Okay, I love giving Bolo all my rotten food. He really enjoys it. He enjoys carrying it for me. Paying me for it. Um, I probably don't need all this crap. Hold uh, Maybe I want this staff of cherished necromancy at some point. I'll hold on to it for now. Oh, the weave. Maybe I should have given that to um, one of my friends here. Perhaps Gail. Oh yeah, I wanted to see if I could. Um, oh, he doesn't have any money. I wanted to see if I could um, have uh, this displayed somewhere. My hero of Baldur's Gate. Is there an easel that I could put this on? Let's In get going. Here. I want to display myself. This picture of me somewhere, please, please, can I display myself? Can I just like stick it on the wall? It's too far, go here. Go here and I'm gonna try and put it on the wall. <laughs> Target's too far. What, why? Should I just sell this? Is there a, really any point to having this other than selling it? <laughs> I don't know what to do with it. I could put it on that table. I think it weighs a decent amount. Hmm. Prop it up against the wall, yeah? Hmm. Oh, good night, Godbotherer. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you. Throw it at Oscar. Yeah, that's probably the best thing to do with it. I don't even know how to prop it against the wall. All my furniture is broken. Um, I think I should just sell it. I'll just hold it for now until I can sell it. I don't know. Okay, I guess we'll sell all this other stuff later. Wait, what is this? Psychic damage against me is doubled? Why? Why, I say? Why? Is it because I have a tadpole? Has that been there the whole time and I've never noticed that? Chuck a garlic bulb. That would be great. Wait, you can rotate stuff? I did not know that. How do I do that? Oh, yeah. Okay. Cool. Do -do 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 -do. That's fun. Is that why I have that? Oh yeah, I'm fine now. Okay, it's just from something in my chest. Catballs, hi! How you doing? Thanks for the applause. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Um, okay, I think we're ready. Back to Castle or we go. Hopefully Carlac will make some, some murder happen here. Okay, 
Should we talk to these thralls? What's up, thralls? Let's let's, let's talk to the rat first. Hi, giant rat. Another guest. Yes, yes. More bones to chew. More bodies to nibble. Yikes! Maybe Carlet can use her damage on this guy. Sometimes the guests here start to bite back. Yep. Not surprised. Enter freely. You are welcome. Thanks. I hope I don't have to kill you later. But I feel like I might. Be welcome, citizen. Be safe. Maybe I can uncharm them. Maybe I can free them. Seems like a good moment to talk. Tonight is a sacred night. Uh oh. We are all blessed to be here. Nope. We're not gonna complete that right. We are gonna interrupt it. You, 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 one of them? The fangy ones? Uh, I don't think so. Good. Don't like when they change. Get big, hairy, mean. They can change? Make sure you stay away. Oh, it's just you. <laughs> Mardi Gras. Oh my, Keppels. Have fun with that. Okay, can I have um, Shadow Heart heal them, maybe? There's no time to waste. I don't know if I ever um, did my posture check earlier, Squish, but... <laughs> okay, I'm gonna see if I can um, uncurse these guys, maybe. Target isn't cursed. Can I restore you? Let's try that maybe. And I might have to go to bed after. I just want them to be able to escape. They're charmed, but can I? How do I fix that? Can't attack spellcaster. But hmm. let me try this. Take you. Yeah, I freed her. Remember is wanting to serve him. Just being desperate to serve him. Gods, I need to go. I need to get home. Yeah, go. Run away. Run away, sweet, sweet, sweet thing. Take you. His voice. It's gone. And so am I. Yay! Okay, I can't cast it again. Oh, I cast. I'll cast it with my level six, and then I'll go to bed. So I can cast it again. <laughs> um, the other thralls, I'm assuming we're gonna. How long have I been here? God, my husband will be so worried. Go to him. Go give him kisses. Okay, let's just talk to the rats. And then we'll do a long rest. Shadowheart, you're so useful. Oh right, because it's Shadowheart talking to him. Never mind. I've got a long road ahead. Oops. Talk to the rats. Have a chat. I should speak up. Chat with the rat. Slim pickings up here, but safe. No one grabbing, no one biting. Where are people biting rats? In the guts oh. of the palace. We gotta feed, uh, free Hungry the people. Hungry mouths down there. We will free them. I swear it. We're gonna free the prisoners. Chessa and Cass, I think it was. Another visitor? Staying long? The others are. Maybe. Um. What others? Who are these visitors? Guests. Came for a party. Mm. Never left, though. Oh, why are you standing? Don't know what be. happened to them. Don't wanna know. But I'm sure you're different. I'm sure you'll be fine. Are you sure of that? Really? Really truly? All goes in, none comes out. Until me, until I rescue everybody. Safe up there! Oh, safe in the light! Very concerning. Very concerning. Okay, uh, let's just rest so Shadowheart can get her spell salutes back. She can restore more people. These boots have seen everything. I'm assuming there's going to be more people that I can save. I might end up using um, 
getting close to the end of my camp supplies at this rate. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day, but... Okay. I don't think there's anything else I need in here, right? Okay, let's go up. Don't know what's waiting for us up here, but... Oh, okay. Ah, a chest. A chest, you say? Thanks. I will take your healing potions. I will probably need them. Okay. A bada bun. I'm gonna take this bada bun. Bada ya bun. A bird's nest. Ah, I'll take that as well. Thank you. Okay, let's see what's through these doors. I'm gonna save. <laughs> Nobody get mad at me, please. Do your thing, sorry. Let's crack it open. Okay, I'm to go a little overboard with the <laughs> bonuses here. <laughs> the birds work for the bourgeoisie. They do. They've got um, fancy necklaces. It's not usually what you expect to find. Oh, a key. Is that to the chest I just opened? Maybe. Uh, Sara Palace Servant Etiquette. Memorize these rules and do not fail to follow them. Do your job silently. Do not speak unless spoken to. The master likes it quiet. Uh, if you're not busy, find something to do and look busy. The master likes diligence. If you encounter the master, stand still and cast down your eyes with deference. The master likes to be respected. No whistling. Good thing I can't whistle anyways. Chamberlain Dufay. Don't linger. Maybe this door is locked? No? Okay, Star Palace. This is it. Star Palace Ramparts. Oh. Damn, how big is this, is this place? Starian. Vampire dens. What should I expect? Vampires would be a safe bet. <laughs> Hilarious. You belong on stage. Perhaps the blood-stained sort, with a hooded man standing by, axe in hand. Okay. So long as there's a cheering crowd. As for vampire dens, I'd brace your nose. They can be very... organic. Good to know. Okay. Good night, Iron Toes. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you. I know the party banter is great. It is. I know I do that all the time, lock pick and then find the key right after. I have so many keys that I'm never gonna use. This is quite the pretty palace. If it wasn't the home of a maniac. Well. Oh. That's suspiciously welcoming. Uh oh, it just unlocked when we came close because obviously he wants a Starion to come because he needs a Starion to be here to complete his right. Is this what Kazador looks like? Is this a statue of you, Kazador? Hmm. I guess there's only one way to find out. Oh, pouch. Okay. Yep, that's a little concerning that that just unlocked for us. Okay. So much for sneaking in. He definitely knows we're coming. Oh, Prez, hi! User tips for the controls? Are you using a controller? Oh. What is this? Fargarella. It's a little gloomy in here. You're a human, but you're not charmed? Hmm. Okay. Oh, Vic 
Victoria's List. That's cool. I want that painting. Can't reach it. <laughs> Darn. I love stealing paintings. Okay. What did my what journal updates did I just get? Um, we entered Castor's Palace. We should look around for clues. Okay. Need to find the vampire man himself. Time for the horror mansion. Let's go. You're on PC, mouse, and keyboard. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. If there's any tips. I still feel like I struggle sometimes. <laughs> what is starting to come? Ayo. <laughs> okay, Victoria's List. Uh, there are 17 paintings, but sometimes some of them are the same painting, except that later sometimes they're different again. There are 17 candelabra. Sometimes I light them, but the candles don't burn down. There are 17 chairs, Everything which is almost be. always too many. Father says that if I go into the ballroom, I'll be bitten 17 times by 17 rats. What is the... Yeah, I was confused about the radials as well. Um, the, uh, 17, 17, what's the session with 17? Okay. Hmm. Canadian bacon is actually ham. Is it just bacon? Well, bacon is from a pig. <laughs> bacon, 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 bacon. Okay, let's talk to this lady. Just Margarola. The master is pure. His palace must be pure. No stain, no smudge, no taint. Pure. Hmm. Can I free you? Go away. I scrub for the master, as you see. Tell the master I scrub for him. Always. Okay, that's a little concerning. Hopefully I don't have to kill you at some point, lady. Oh my. Oh. There's someone Everything invisible? Must be Good boy. Everything must be perfect. I can hear someone saying no more. Um, where's Godoy? And I just swear I just saw someone. Someone lost their invisibility because of me? But where? There is so much to do. So Master Astarian, what are you doing here? Why aren't you downstairs? The doors have already been sealed. The ritual is about to begin. Um, take my advice, run, get out of here while you still can. So seal the doors and let me in. I'm here to kill Castor. Can I say run? Uh, abandon the master Please at his away. moment of triumph. What is wrong with you? Do you wish to spite him again? Oh uh, I'm wasting time talking to a damned man. There is too much to do, too much to prepare. So we can't help him. All right, what now? I didn't realize there that is I was so much to, to do, so much to make ready. I need a quick word. There is so much. To okay, Astorian. I want to talk to this other lady as you, also. If I must... I scrub for... Okay, she doesn't care. <laughs> well, it ends she doesn't care. It hmm. Yeah, I just eat regular bacon. Oh, I can take it. That's my painting. Thanks. Oh, my nose is so itchy today. Moving in. So, um... What is through here? Sinister door. Arcane lock. Does that mean I can lock it? Unlock it with knock? Maybe I should bring Gale with me. Um, I want to open this, please. The door oh. is covered in intricate text, but you can't see anywhere a key might fit. Only a small round hollow engraved with a family crest. Ah, uh, sorry. Do you have it? Do you have the hollow? The qu the crest? <laughs> uh, try to decipher the text on the door. Examine the hollow in the door. Let's try to decipher the text first. Nick, hey! Thank you so much for the sub. A second bucket in the dungeon? Maybe I can arrange it. Thank you for 15 months. Wow. And the 15 month streak. Thank you, Nick. Hope you're doing awesome. Oh, colloquial chaos. Uh, good idea. I will. I'll chat with him. Okay, try to decipher the text. I don't think that I am going to succeed at this. Yes. If it's 25 difficult.
difficulty. I don't know if I should use my inspiration. Who's good at history? Intelligence. Maybe I really should be doing it with what a Starian know? I don't know if I want to use my inspiration. Writing means nothing to you. You can't even recognize the script. There's writing like this all over the palace. Mm. Some old, probably dead language of Kazador's. Mm. We were strictly forbidden from learning it. Okay, so he doesn't know either. Um. Don't touch me. Isn't he better intelligence than me? I don't know if he's going to be able to do this, though. Door to Kazador's ballroom, where he hosted his most oh, hedonistic nights. You've never seen it closed, let alone locked before. The door is covered in intricate text. You can't see anywhere a key might fit. Let's Only a small it. round hollow well, engraved with the Sire family bonus. crest. There's no way. He's going to have to get a 20. <gasps> <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. You've been in hospital? Oh no. Nick, are you okay? Hopefully you're... um. On the mend. Hi, Funkers. Hello. You like my emote? Thank you. I need to get a whole bunch more emotes, too. <clears throat> okay. It's written in archaic Kozakuran, a rare version of an already obscure language. The palace is full of inscriptions like this. Casador always forbade you from learning the language, but you have picked up a few words. You can make out enough to recognize an incantation, but the specifics elude you. You can tell you're missing something, though. You spot a reference to the family signet. We gotta put the signet in the hole. Um, examine the hollow. Should we try that as well? I'm gonna save, because we succeeded at that first one. <laughs> okay. Welcome in, thank you for the follow. Oh, shite. Let's try it again. <laughs> Did it. The indentation seems to be the right size and shape to fit a signet ring That's bearing the, the ring. family crest. Only a few people wear such a ring. Oh, Casador and Godi, we saw your Godi. kennel master. We saw, we just saw invisibility of Godi. Welcome in, Dan. Are you a fan of this game? Okay, let's talk to. I guess we could talk to all our friends now. Hi, Astarian. So this is it. I'm home. Two centuries walking these halls, and I've never once seen the ballroom door locked. Casador doesn't want anything going wrong tonight. We're gonna go find Godi. Go find that ring. Um, what's it like being back? Are the servants charmed like the guards in the tower? I don't think they are. Uh, so what's the plan? Are you sure about this? You don't have to face him. I need to ask you something else. Okay, can we ask all these things? What's it like being back? It does feel strange. Breaking into your own home. Especially if murder's on your mind. Then again, this is hardly the strangest thing we've done together. <laughs> Got that Although right. it could be the most satisfying. Are the servants charmed? Oh no. It's much worse than that. They're fanatics. Here of their own free will and utterly devoted to Cazador. Each one came to our door and begged to be given his eternal gift. They're sure he'll turn them if they serve him well enough. He'd almost feel sorry for the poor, deluded souls. But they're idiots who brought this upon themselves, so don't. <laughs> okay, I think we might have to kill them. What's the plan? If my dear siblings were right, Cazador's hiding somewhere below the palace. After so many years, I would have spotted any secret tunnels out here. If Casador's hiding anywhere, it'll be behind the huge locked doors covered in secret writing. Our old kennel master, Godi, will have a key. But the writing... I've no idea how to read that. 
Um, are you sure about this? You don't have to face him. <laughs> I've never been less sure of anything. But if I don't face him now, I never will. I'll spend the rest of my life running, watching the shadows, never feeling safe. Yeah. No. This has to happen here and now. Also, there's a small matter of all that power I can steal from no. the bastard. So that'll be nice. We're not doing that. We are not doing that. Oh, Dan! 100k hours? Oh my god. What? 1,100. Okay. I was like, 100k. 1,100k. That's still a shit ton. Oh my gosh. Wow. Good. Yeah. Most played since, like, since Skyrim. It is such a good game. I'm so glad you're enjoying it. And you've, you found me on YouTube. Yay! Thank you so much for uh, checking out the YouTube. I really appreciate that. It's always fun to hear when someone has come from YouTube. Uh, thanks for coming to hang out. And thank you for your kind words. Okay, I don't think there's anything else then to ask, ask, right? Quickly. Mm, no. Okay. Hi, Cletus. Welcome Everything in. Be perfect. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, okay. Uh, let's talk to the others. Copper for your thoughts. I was gonna ask you your thoughts. Nothing to say. Carlac often is kind of annoying. She often doesn't have anything to comment on the things that our companions do. Almost pleasant traveling oh, with company. Apparently, if the Shadow Heart doesn't either right now, so that's okay. Okay, let's go find Goldie. He was being invisible, but we did find him. So, hmm. thanks, Fred Dev. Thank you. Forty-five days. That's impressive. That's a lot of Baldur's Gate. Tonight we shall see his true form. Creepy, creepy, creepy. These fanatics. Chamberlain's sweet. Okay. Let's go and see what's in here. Chamberlain Private. Okay, we'll check out, maybe there's the key in the office. We'll check out the office first. This looks like a hidden doorway. That elegant robe, hey? What does that look like? Elegant robe. Oh, that's the same one that uh, Shadowheart is wearing. I think. Yes, it is. We could be twins. Should I put it on Astaria? <laughs> what does it look like on him? Have I tried it on him? Or Karlak? I guess I'd look the same on Carlac, probably. Yeah, it looks the same on her. How does it look on you, sir? Oh my. Not really the vibe that I'm going for, I think, for him. Okay. That's nice, though. We have already paid for that earlier. <laughs> now we get it for free. Oh! Robe. Loving the open purple, winter gala. Okay, what's this? Queen of Kingpins. This is, we've read this before. Nine fingers. What does this robe look like? Oh, it's a uh, armor. Clothing? Oh, it's, oh. Well, I'm definitely not gonna wear that. Do, 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 do. I hate this, how this hat changes my hair. Okay, um, let's see what we've got waiting for us in here. Pre Provender ledger? A ledger listing a tracking inventory of goods in regular use at the Tsar Palace, with categories for food and drink for servants and guests, cleaning supplies including alchemical bloodstain remover from bone cloaks, opaque heavy curtains, candles of different sizes in yellow, tallow, and red, and black wax, Leather straps with buckles, bombs and oils, and regular deliveries of Baldur's Mouth broadsheets. Gotta stay up to date with the nudes. Sa uh, save your money. <laughs> save your money. <laughs> Welcome in. Thank you so much. Thanks for joining us. 
Thank you for the follow. <laughs> I got there in the end. <laughs> um, are you a fan of this game? Thanks for joining us. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Just one the <laughs> I was like, 100,000 hours. 100K. Oh, you like Rocky too? He's being very cute right now. I can see him. He's like this upside down on the chair beside me. Rocky, everyone loves you. I hope you know. You're very cute, my love. My little kitty baby. He's so precious. It's glorious. This game is glorious. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm, I love to encounter other fans of this wonderful... What is this mysterious elixir? Hmm. Interesting. What is this? Fading death. Interesting. Okay, uh, the mall room door. Oh, yes. This is what we're going to try and break into. Chamberlain Dufay. The Kazakuran dictionary we use to train new servants on how to operate the ballroom door. <gasps> Maybe we can find this dictionary. Has gone missing. Uh, and my signet ring alone won't do the job. Please have the servant sort this out. It shouldn't be my problem to solve. The note continues in different handwriting. Bodhi, the servants and I are thoroughly busy preparing for master celebration. Get your bones out of the kennel and search every chamber on the vampire spawn level and quickly find that book. Interesting. So maybe it's some of the spawn that we told them about what was going to happen to them? Although I feel like they didn't really believe us. Okay. Um, oops. We gotta find that book. Find that book. How do I open this secret door? Because this is definitely a secret door here, you can tell. How do I open you? Hmm. I'll take that. Can I, like, move this? Huh. <laughs> Maybe it, I can open it through here? Perhaps? We will see. Oh, I should not be locked by Kimax. Watch your back. Should be easy. Easy for you. I'm gonna try not to use up all my lockies now. Confidently walk forward, just through it. Just walk right through it. I wonder if that works actually. Yep, didn't need my luck for that one. Let's move. Oh, what the fuck? Still breathing, despite everything. Um, Mr. Dufay, were you always a dead corpse? Um, corpse too damaged. Well, shit. What happened to him? He has the Kama Sutra beside his bed. Ayo. Something over there. Oh, Dufay's diary. Diary of Antoine Dufay, Chamberlain of Kazdor's Palace. The final pages of the diary reads. Uh, sorry, the final page of the diary reads, uh, I know enough about what the master has in mind with his ritual that I refuse to be the stand-in for that missing brat Astarian. Even if Kazdor finds my body, the potion bone cloak sold me is promised to provide a convincing illusion of death, especially since I'll leave behind a look-alike potion of acid poison. I feel like he drank the wrong potion because I found the, uh, the feigned death potion. <laughs> Uh, my one regret is dear Luriana, but I simply cannot trust her with the secret of my one chance of escape. When the potion wears off, Castor will have ascended and will have need of my services, or he will be no more, and mastery of the palace will fall to me. I don't think so, sir. I think something, <laughs> something happened here. Uh, he was once a live corpse. Yeah, it sounds like he must have been another vampire. Very well. If he could have been used for the ritual. This is, um, he's got the Kama Sutra beside his bed. We've read this before. Look her chest. Okay, so how do I get into this other room? Can I actually walk through it? Oh my god. Apparently yes. That's all you need to do. You just need to walk confidently forward. Well, whose body is this? Oh, this is Luriana. She's also dead. My darling Defay. My darling Defay, despite all your promises that what that sorry, that when we went to the afterlife we'd go together, you went without me. Or did you? I found your body in the empty empty bottle. I know you took a potion, but was it poison or something else? Oh my god, they're like Romeo and Juliet. 
Here are two more identical bottles. I'm gonna drink one of them and then I'll join you one way or another. I love you for eternity, Luriana. Whatever killed this werewolf burned it up from the inside. Its throat and innards are more liquid than solid. I think that they um drink they both drank the wrong bottle. Empty potion bottle. They drank the wrong one. Oh, how Romeo and Juliet of them. Wow, okay. Could I have walked through this one too, maybe? Interesting. R.I.P. to the lovers. Romeo and Juliet. Okay. That was interesting. And we have to find that missing book. He ascends. Tonight we shall see his true form. I feel like I should like murder these guys now so I don't have to kill them later, but maybe we won't have to? I don't know. I'm just hoping. Okay, where's Mr. Invisible here? Can I steal these paintings? Nope. Well, darn. Bless us, Master. May we be worthy of you. Bunch of fanatics, man. Where's good oi? Good oi, da da Siren. Cossack energy. Best avoided. This is necrotic energy. Sinister steel. Can, uh, seal. Can I clear it? Guest room. You know that I'm not going to um, avoid this, though, right? <laughs> Dark and cursed. Okay, so remove curse, Shadowheart. I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Let the pain fade. Ta-da! Like brand new. What is saying I can... It's like showing this room somehow. Okay. Um, should I go in this guest room Just first, I guess? Don't stop cleaning. Just keep cleaning. Just keep Shouldn't cleaning. To live in more can interesting we convince times. her to leave, maybe? Hmm. The woman's eyes are alert, verging on manic as she bustles about. Everything's got to be right for the master. Everything's got to be perfect. Yep, a little manic, indeed. So much to do! So much to do! I wish we could free these poor souls. So much to do! But they're not cursed, Keep a so... Close. On my way. It's gotta be clean. The woman's eyes are alert. Okay, Everything's gotta be right! I'll give up now. Okay, let's see what's to in find here. A way forward. I'm just gonna save. I'm gonna save before I go in, like, oops. I go in like all of these doors because I'm scared of what's waiting for me. Guest room. Oh my god. Oh, there's Victoria. We read her note. Sapping curse. Okay, so we should um, uncurse her too. To go still. So I don't damage myself in here. Can't reach destination. Oh, because I'm blocking the way. No Get out rest. of the way, me! Sorry, now you're in the way. Move. What am I to do? I just love to block my way. Okay. There we Time go. Time to undo the damage. <sighs> Necrotic energy. It's sapping my strength. We're fine. All good. We don't need to be in turn base mode. We're fine. <laughs> ah, the bedrooms. Never once slept in. I'm so tired. This is where I took our guests. I'd entertain them here until Casador appeared and took them away. Yikes. No one ever died here, though. Something strange happened to that girl. No one back home will ever believe this. Yeah, because she was cursed with something. Can we talk to her? Can we talk to her corpse, maybe? We'll try it. Um, let's just look around first, see what there is to see. What's waiting for over, us? Then through. Oh, just sitting on a bench. Ooh. Okay, is there a key to this somewhere? We will open that in a second. Just a memento. Oh, Dal Delirious. 
journal. Scaramouche, Scaramouche, will you do the Fandango? Thunderbolts of lightning, very, very frightening. Galileo. Okay, Deliria's private diary. Before I was Deliria, vampire spawn slave to Casador Sar, I was Dr. Deliria, physician general to the parliament of Baldur's Gate. Spawner, no, I'm still Dr. Deliria. I will not submit to his lo to this lowly status. The others say vampirism is a curse, but in my educated opinion, it's a disease, and therefore must be vulnerable to medical treatment. Mm. I believe a massive infusion of fresh youthful blood may overwhelm the vampirism infection and enable my body to heal. There is one potential source of such blood here, Victoria, the as yet pure-blooded daughter of Leon Onofrio. Leon was a sorcerer before he was a vampiric slave and has warned us not to prey upon Victoria as he has imbued her with a counter curse in the event of attack. Made her body a necrotic booby trap, as it were. I think Neon Leon is bluffing. He was not bluffing. Poor Victoria. Oh. Ah, oh, nice. She's got the dictionary. The Kozakuran dictionary. Uh... The book is a dictionary of the ancient Kosokuran language from the distant land of Karatur. Flipping through the pages, you find certain words and phrases underlined. Open, enter, beware, forbidden, sealed. It's Kazakaran. Kazakaran, the sorry. symbols from that door. Kazakaran. That's how you say it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, my singing. I know. It's amazing. What can I say? Sorry to your ears. Okay, Victoria. Um, well, Victoria's note. Victoria, remember to read that ancient language book. You'll need to know some of the vocabulary to be able to move freely within the palace. Father. Okay, let's see if she has anything to say about her death. Although we already know who killed her. The corpse does not respond. I guess we were able to find out all by our lonesome. Um, let's open this chest. Did we get the key? What a day. What a day indeed. <laughs> Easy. Oh, helmet of grit. Oh, additional bonus action. Hmm. Extra psychic resistance, oil of accuracy, ruby ring. Huh. An extra bonus action sounds pretty nice. What is his helmet? Shrouded in shadow. I do use that sometimes. I'm gonna try it. We'll give it a try. It sounds useful. Have a lot on my mind. And well, in it. Okay, should we go back and With read haste. the door? See what it says? Do, 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 Galileo. Galileo. Galileo the Figaro Magnifico. Where, where did it go? Okay, here it is. I was like, where did it go? Here we go. The door remains sealed with naught to see but strange writing. Looking closer, you recognize the writing. It's the same Kozakuran script from the dictionary you found. Look at all the rats on the door. Um, read the inscription aloud, recalling what you learned from the book. Your voice echoes in the chamber. Okay, because we happens. need to put the um, seal in. The door remains resolutely shut. First, got it. Okay, gotta find the seal. Gotta find that invisible man, wherever he's hiding. He must be somewhere close by, because I saw him. I got that thing, but I was able to see him, apparently. Hmm. Behold! One of Cazador's cheapest tricks. An illusionary wall. Oh, I'm so Behind it is the kennel. It'll be over soon. A fetid little right. cell he throws us into when displeased. This? Is this the fake wall? Where's the fake wall? Oh, this one? Is this the fake wall? Where's the fake wall, Starion? I don't know what you're talking about. These are all doors. Door to the kennel. Oh, it was this one? Okay. Looks like an ambush. 
ambush. Oh, where's the ambush? Oh, there's Godoy. Godoy, go go can we talk to you, please, instead of you ambushing us, maybe? See how that goes. Cut your lip. Uh oh. It turned into door. I did not even notice. Godoy, don't ambush me. I know you're there, Godoy. Gotti. Stop skulking and show yourself. You always were sharp, little one. Sharp enough to cut yourself. It's taking everything I have not to grind your rotten carcass to dust. Don't be mad at Cody, child. Cody. I only did my job. Only kept you in line. You tortured us. For days at a time. Oh, yes. And you sang so sweetly for me. None of the others screamed like you did. Oh, my God. But you're home now, and you brought me a treat, eh? <laughs> a new friend for Godi. Just give us your seal, man. Um, deception. Kazdor hired me to capture Starry, and I'm here to deliver. Intimidation, lay a hand on me and lose it, Bones. I mean, I'm, redder, I'm better at deception, but I'd rather intimidate this asshole. I don't know. I'm way better at deceiving, but I kind of want to intimidate him. Only following orders, right? Freaking asshole. I think I'm going to try the intimidation, because sometimes you just really want to intimidate people. Sometimes they deserve it, even though I'm not very good at it. We're gonna try it. I hope that it's not a hard roll. I'm saving, so if we fuck up, we can... <laughs> we can fix it. It's only a 15. Come on. Yeah, we're good. Lay your hand on me and lose it, bones. You dick. Not very nice. Not very friendly. Why are you here then, little one, if not to see Godi? Isn't it obvious? I'm going to kill Casador. Yeah, we are. How dare you? As if you could lay a finger on the master, you ungrateful little brat. Godi will not let you get away with blasphemy. Godi will see you punished. Hey, Godi, I'm happy to kill you. I'm more than happy to end your life. That's just fine with me, sir. Oh God, just missed twice. Voice resistance, bludgeoning, vulnerability. Fuck up this. Under oh, that come hurt roses. him, please. Come give him the old smack or doodle. Should we try a branding smite? So once it's... Mm, let's try it. Oh. I didn't do that. Uh oh. I didn't select it. <laughs> My bad. Just do the regular attack. I missed. Okay, now let's try branding smite. Stop bullying Karlak. Why am I disadvantaged? Too close. Fuck you, Goaty. That felt good. What do we get here? Key to the kennel and the family ring. Okay, we can open the door now. There's an inscription on the ring. It looks like the same language as that book from earlier. Oh, I'm encumbered. Uh, this stuff is very heavy. I'll send all this. Okay. Okay, uh, so we got I'm the key the to the kennel. Are we not already in the kennel? Is there another um, thing to be opened over here? Okay. This one's not locked. Uh, stained 
towel certificate. Ugh. You could just torture or pour a starian in here. Oh, sweet thing. Poor little starian, baby starian. Okay, should we go into this dormitory wing before we go up back up there? I don't know. Always chittering. What are you all? But Master says no. Okay, we're gonna try it. We're gonna see what there is. Uh, I think for the main quest, it's supposed to go through that door, so let's we'll just see what's over here. Hi, Green Fern. I must be busy. Busy, busy, busy. Master might see me. Master might approve. Oh my god, these guys need a life. now busy 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 yeah Goaty sucks I'm glad we got to kill him he deserved that ten times over ledger blood donors do donors Casador's finest when you're on the hunt Take prey by preference from the city's lower classes. Patriarchs may smell better, but it will attract unwanted attention if too many aristocrats vanish when they're out slumming. In the last month, you already brought in a Dlusker, a Jasso, and an Othun, and now three wealthy families are up in arms. Watch it. Chamberlain DeFay. Maybe I'm okay with DeFay dying, too. Uh, Violet's Diary. Okay. This is where the spawn were kept. Oh. When we were getting neither the carrot nor the stick... I like to talk about the carrot and the stick. So does um, Gortash. Okay. Uh, hee hee. The garlic in Yusin's bed gave him a nasty rash. Serves him right for being such a whining runt. Now, if only I could get at that snob Leon and his brat of a daughter. But she's protected. Kazdor must have a fine plan for little Victoria. I wonder what it is. Well, Victoria's dead now, so. Deliria killed her. Diary. Okay. We're gonna meet all these stunning individuals at some point, I guess. They're all gonna be trapped by Kazdor. Maybe they do deserve to die. No, I'm gonna say maybe Astarian did at one point, but they can be redeemed, right? I don't think that I should let Astarian complete this right. I feel like it's just gonna turn him into a, an even bigger prick than he already is. <laughs> okay, what's through here? Did I talk to you twice already, Green Fern? I think I might have. Bring in the justice. We're gonna try. Not now. We're gonna try to bring the justice. The Justice League. Um. You think the lighting's messed up, 99? Hmm. Who is saying this stuff about be their alpha? a nicer bedroom. Who had this one? I'll take all your alcohol. Thank you. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, is this where Victoria's room was? Maybe? Or, uh, uh, Victoria? Is that the name of the kid? Whatever the kid's name was. Uh, favored spawn ledger. Oh, I thought I pressed read. <laughs> Where'd that go? Where are you, favored spawn? Guys, what the F? Did it just disappear? That note just disappeared on me. It just vanished into thin air. What the hell? I wanted to read that. That was a glitch. That was that was a little buggy. Where the heck did that go? That was weird, guys. Leon's diary. Oh, so this must be where Leon and Victoria lived, I guess. Um, diary of Leon Onofrio. Final page. Ever since the master turned me and forced me to bring Victoria along into the palace, I've had to be his best hunter just so I could stay in here with my daughter and keep her away from the other spawn. I don't like the way Violet looks at her, not at all. When I ask the master what he plans to do with Victoria, Casador just gives me that wicked smile. 
Next time I get out on the hunt, must talk to Figaro to finalize the deal for Victoria's escape disguise. If only there's enough time before this ritual the master talks about. Sad, because she died. Hmm. I don't have the right to read that. Some of these were Astarian's clothes that he would wear. Um, guys, is there a way to get that note without it bugging? Should I try and reload? Where was my last save? It was right before I opened this door, right? Let's try that. I don't know. I want to read that note. That was weird. <clears throat> Aki is looking so darn cute right now. He's looking so freaking cute. But, you know, as per usual. Waiting for Rocky to make an appearance. Well, maybe there'll be time for another treat redeem before too long. He's not being a menace. He's not going after my lights. Yeah, I think, okay. Yeah, favorite spawn. Path lies before me. So let's try that again. Was it in this one? Okay. Favorite spawn ledger. Take all. Maybe now it'll let me read it? Read. There we go. Okay. Favorite spawn. Kazdor's best prey hunters who are entitled to stay in the special bedchamber year to date. Leon, Leon, Violet, Leon, Leon, Leon. Oh my god. Okay, interesting. I want to meet Leon. I would like to meet you, Leon. I'm just going to read this again in case there's something about reading it. Leon. But Victoria still died. And Deliria is the one who killed her. Anything of use? I wonder. I was going to say, I wonder if Astaria never got to stay in here, but apparently not. He was never the favored spawn. Only Leon was. There's a lot of nice clothing in here, but I already have all this clothing, I think. Okay. Let me send some of this heavy stuff away, away. Look at all this clothing I'm just picking up. Ah! Okay. This giant dance. I do want to sell that. I do want to sell all these things. Okay. I think. Does that mean it's time to go back upstairs? I don't think there's anything else we can look at down here. Okay. Back up we go. Let's go put our ring in the slots. I can rest soon. Say the magic words. Go kill some assholes. Yeah. <laughs> I've never played Resident Evil. No, I have not. I'll be down at some point. Okay, we're going to save again. And moment of truth. The door remains sealed with naught to see but strange writing and a small hollow. Looking closer, you recognize the writing. Um, it's the same Kozakuran script from okay. the dictionary you found. Press the czar signet ring against the hollow and read the door's inscription aloud. The ring slots perfectly into place and the door swings open. What the frick? There is so much to do, so much to prepare. Oh my gosh, Blaze Hume, White Mist, we have to fight all these, Blood Fang, Dulver Rillin, some giant rats, you can't be here, no one in, no one out. You're new. 
Casador never kept guard dogs before. <sighs> the runaway spawn. <clears throat> you reek of the master's scent. Come with us. Come to master. I think I'd rather uh, kill you. Excuse me. I will not be ordered around my own house by some blowing mutt. <sighs> we bring you to him. We get his favor. No, we're gonna fight. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. Good thing that Carlock does have the the, the benefit against Everything rodents, I guess. Perfect. <laughs> Just in time to fight a bunch of giant rats. Oh look, I can talk to this dead body. Party guest. Just that one though, I think. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Can I use make him just cast like a fireball? Um, I don't have. I really don't have a scroll of fireball. Uh, fire, really? Fireball? I want him to cast like an area spell. They're all so close together. I could try cloud kill. Let me just look at what they: bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing immunity. Okay. I think it would be better to just do an area something or other here. Who's holding all my um, scrolls? Maybe they're in here? First try. Uh, let's see. Mm. Mm. That disintegrate one is pretty sexy. Uh, I could do Ice Storm from him, maybe. But that does bludgeoning as well. Uh, Sleet Storm? Mm, no. Wall of Fire, I'll try that one. What, how far should we make this go? From here to here, perhaps? Is blocks. What do you mean? We go. Oh, there we go. Let's try that. Dude, you didn't cast it. You didn't cast it, man. more than one surface maybe let's try to there uh lycanthropic fury what does that do do i even want to know okay and can i also get close enough to my nose is so itchy can i also get close enough to do a little bonus action action um maybe i should just misty step somewhere i don't know what to do that I'll smack a bat. Mm. Maybe I'm just gonna have Come you chillin' way. over here. White mist. Burn, baby, burn. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Pina colada. Do you like pina coladas? Okay, um, Carlac, should we have you uh, fight some little rodents? I don't know if it's worth it to use your attack, but you're real good at it, so okay. cry about it. Ooh, that's good. Okay. Cry about it, bitch. <laughs> How about you, garlic? I we have not. Should I actually try that? Oh look, they're all coming at him. Oh. Oh wait, rats. <laughs> Deal with your business here. Okay, um, shall I do a. I feel like I should save my chain lightning, but I can always do a long rest after this. I think. I could do another fireball. All you folks, you three there. Maybe? 
Should I do a... Ooh, I can do an arcane um, chain lightning. I'll try that. That chain lightning is pretty sexy. I love the chain lightning. <laughs> yeah, the, the wall fire is pretty sexy. Hmm. Yeah, lichen, like it, lycanthrope. Well, has that root word, Latin, I think, for wolf. Um, okay, let's do a quick skin spell, and what should I do? Fireball. Four. These two betches. <laughs> Sucks to suck. Sucks to suck so badly. Can't but you guys really, really suck a lot. Got to press on. Um, I could kill all these guys if I just do a spirit guardian. Maybe do an area attack though. Oh, this guy's fighting us too. Oh, I didn't even realize that. Of course. <laughs> Sorry, Wilhelm. I feel like. Oh, and you too. Oh gosh. These people. Whole campfire, yeah. <laughs> Oh, I didn't even notice you over there either. Yeah, come into my spirit guardian. Oh, Shiza, Manelli. Okay, attack. Sorry, I just really wish that you could do more damage than that. God, it's hot in here. Why are you complaining about it being hot, Carlac? <laughs> Look at that, I'm fully surrounded by rats. Okay, where's the one that cleave? I want to get three. I can only get two. Oh, okay. I can get three there. Nice. Can I cleave again? I can't. Okay, I'll just regularly attack um, one of these rats then. Critical hit, baby. Does she have any bonus sections? I can rage. But. Okay. That's why I'm thinking she's doing less damage because I'm not making her rage. I don't know. I feel like should I just knock these guys out instead of killing them? They're only temporarily hostile. I don't know what to do. Should I save these pathetic fools' lives? I feel like they suck, so they could die. You guys have been willingly, willingly, not even charmed to aid a murderer, so you're probably better off coming to Bye! Nice to meet ya! See you in the next life! Maybe I'll just firebolt this man. Decent. Can't give up. Not now. Decent. Oh, he's one, needs one damage done on him. Can I just smack him? Can I just give him an old smack? Don't miss. Yeah. Wow, she didn't miss for once in her life. Harsh but fair. You know. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes you have to face the consequences of your own actions. What can I say? Ready for another round. Okay. How delicious. Turn that off before someone walks into it accidentally. What to do? What to do? What to do? Okay, so I think that I wonder if I should do a long rest before I go any further so I can get my slots back. Let's just raid their bodies. Bodies. 
key to Rampart's door. We don't need that. What's inside? Oh, didn't mean to talk to you. Casador but... skulking somewhere beneath us. In this defiled chapel the others mentioned. We just have to find the entrance. Then he'll be mine. We'll do it. We'll try our best. Hi, Blue. Hello. How's it going? Hope you're having a great day. Thanks for joining us. Howdy, howdy. <laughs> fresh as possible, right? Okay. We will. We will. Hi, Arcadia. We will try to be fresh. Fresh. It's fresh. Fresh. Exciting. Okay. What's the plan? Well, I was thinking first we find Casador and then we kill Casador. <sighs> So That's sassy. about it, really. We can workshop the details as we go. You're so sassy. He's just sassing me all the live long day here. Sassy, sassy man. I was trying to loot this man. Wolf thing. Wolf man dog. Um, How much further can I go? Oh, there's a lever? I wonder what that does. We'll pull that at some point. Maybe it closes the door. A whole bunch of violins. Some more drums. Oh, I just got a shiver. I feel like none of these are going to have anything inside of them. Can I play the piano? No? Play some sweet, sweet music for us. Sheet music. Sheet music for General Sandro's death suite, a funerary celebration in three parts. It's like when they start playing the Reigns of Castamere. You know shit's going to hit the fan. Can't wait for House of Hope. That's the uh, Raphael one, right? We're gonna be doing that one soon, too. Not tonight, but soon. But soon. Hey, Blue! I'm glad you have, sounds like you had a good day. Do love a party. Do love a party. Do love a bit, a bit, a, a little, a little bit of alcoholic consumption. I can't talk to this, I can't. Okay, can I like move this body? White mist, your body's in the way. I can't loot this other man. Party guest. There we go. Okay, not that he has anything inside of him. Jeez Louise. But uh, yeah, if you need to fall asleep, Blue, that's totally fine. <laughs> that is totally fine. Arcadia is wise, save your money. Agreed, take a medium rest. <laughs> I want all my spell slots back though. I don't even think you can. You can only do sh short and long. They don't have medium. They say no medium for you. Fuck you, Goldilocks. You only get too hot or too cold. I'll get you in. Huh. San Severina. Oh, this is like, remember we actually found that lady who was waiting to go to a party with one of the vampires and we said, you should probably not do that. And I think we saved her life. I think we saved her life. Sing of the jams. Yeah, tried my best. <laughs> Edward, good night, Edward. Thank you so much for hanging out. Sweet dreams. Hopefully we'll see you next time. Castor has been fucked with almost every major patch. Oh, gosh. Great. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Gallagher, hi. I am going to speak to the dead body. I'm saving the best for last. Um, Sansi, I've been invited to play at a party at the Tsar Palace tonight in their ballroom. Show the Chamberlain at the door this note and I'll let you in to join me. Wear your best dress, Calera. Oh, and then she ended up dying. Well, shit. Sometimes your friends just get you killed. We sit on the throne, lavish chair. I am Casador now. Come at me, bro. Okay. This is like another door that we can walk through, potentially. We'll talk to our party guest first and pull the lever. Bronk. Is that somewhere we can go through as well? Nope. Oh, and there's a door here. Office hall. Hmm. Okay, we will go through there too. Okay, I have like something in my eyeball right now, I think. I don't know what it is. But it's bother bothering me. <laughs> new swell, yes, new swell. <laughs> Poor sorry, and he's a sassy boy, yeah. Defense mechanism. Marco Polo! Marco! Polo! Welcome in! Thanks for the follow! Are you a fan of this game? Um, separate torso, no clown parts though? Come on. Okay, um, 
Oh, this one more rat to look into. Okay. Can I loot your body before I talk to you? Maybe I'll do it after I talk to you. Saving. Hello, party guests. Tell us what happened here. Six hours? Wow, that's a fun the party. The regards you lifelessly. Who are you? What were you doing here? Who killed you? Who else was here? Um, let's say maybe who killed you? Wolves of course. arrived when our host left, slaughtered us. Okay, uh, where did your host go? West door took most beautiful people away. Oh, only the beautiful people. Never away. saw again. Yeah, lash in the eye. I think that's what it is. Um, who else was here? Or what were you doing here? What were you doing here? Enjoying party, drinking, talking. <laughs> if you're ugly, you get to live, but just kidding, you still die. You just, um, die by other means. Uh, okay, talking about what? Work, counting house, yeah, who controls that. what? Wanted names of oh. senior staff, oh. families, any scandals, secrets. Okay, who else was here? Politicians, minor nobles, fist officers, all sorts. The okay. spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. I don't know if I got the right information there, but... Okay, so he took the beautiful people. Nothing in your pockets. Okay, so... I don't know... That's probably where he went. Is that locked, though? I can't get through there. Oh, if I pull the lever, though, maybe it opens? I should maybe check out the office first, though. Seems simple enough. Closes this door, huh? Okay, let's go to the office area. I don't know if this would have been where they went. Oh, diet. Oh, do I want to step on that? I feel like this might be like an elevator. Let's, uh, before we go through there, let's see what's over here. A bit of sunlight streaming through. Dangerous for the vampires. Lower city, upper city. I wonder if we could like sign, shine some light on things. Because <laughs> I think Asarian's the only one who can withstand the light right now. Because of his friendly little tadpole. And our asshole guardian's assistance. Party planner. Uh, this seems to be the working notebook used by a certain Chamberlain de Fay to plan Kazdor's gatherings in the mansion ballroom. Functions are divided into two categories. Those for invited guests and those for involuntary guests. The entertainment for the latter category being considerably more sinister than the former. Uh, the final handwritten entry is below. Master has ordered a special party, a final feast, he said. This will be my ultimate test, but I am prepared. And I'm sure the guests, both invited and involuntary, will be thrilled to participate. Really? Really? I don't know. I don't know about that. Okay, silver glass. Be useful. I'll take that. Okay, nothing else in here? I guess we're gonna go step on the, da the dais? The dais? Dais? Over there? Vast world out there. Indeed. Indeed. Okay. Uh, maybe we'll do a rest first, though. Oh, just kidding. I cannot go to camp. So, fuck. <laughs> um, I guess we're just gonna go for it, then. No long rests for me! <laughs> oh, The special action from my staff? Topple? That one? Jedi! Hi! Thank you so much for the sub! 
Wow, Jedi, how you doing? Thank you. Thank you, thank you. 14 months. Thank you, my kind friend. That's very kind of you. Oh, is that this one? Koreska's favor? Okay, wait, what is my special action? It is this one, Koreska's favor. Should I try that? Imbue yourself with elemental energy. No, I haven't really used that one. I don't know if I should do a long rest first. Hmm. When did Blue start modding here? Last night. <laughs> Yesterday. <laughs> you left the mansion, re-entered. Yeah, maybe I should do that. If it's if they're not gonna get mad at me for doing that, I'll just do that quickly. No one needs to know. No one needs to know. Hi, Toby. Hello. Thank you for the hydrate. And the stretching. Hmm. <clears throat> Extra element powers. Okay, let's give that a try. Wow, very cold. Toby. I do not like the cold. I do not like the cold. <clears throat> okay, I'll try that power. No, I haven't tried it. Can I, um, long rest now? I'm cheating. Hopefully that's not gonna mess anything up. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> One's gonna die while I rest, right? <sighs> Limited power point. Okay, now we're ready to descend to the depths. The depths of the castle. The palace. The pal ass. Palace, palace, palace. Let's go down to the depths of the palace. I still like feel like I'm missing something with this door over here. It looks like that should lead somewhere. But maybe that will be like on my way back out or something. Okay, I'm gonna try this. I'm viewing myself with elemental energy. So it's gonna last until I, until I rest. Is that how that works? Thunder. Okay, if I did fire. Okay, wait. Um, gain resistance to acid. I'm gonna do flame because I use flame most often. The last until I long rest. Okay, I got the flame. Until I long rest. Cool. I can already cast fireball. Oh, but I couldn't cast wall of fire. I have wall of fire now. Nice. Okay, let's go down. I'm gonna save. Let's do it. <clears throat> Developers just got lazy with that door. Oh, well darn. You stand on a clean metal platform, a beautiful but antiquated elevator. There are some scuffs to show its age, signs of things dragged onto it over the years, but it seems to be in good working order. What in the hells? I never knew this was here. This was always Cazador's private quarters. Only he ever came in here. Well, him and the unfortunate souls we brought to feed him. Yep. Without spell slots. Oh, nice. Okay. Here we go. We'll see how this goes. Thanks for the biddies. Cazador's dungeon, here we are. Oh, we got a waypoint. Cool. A little concerning though. Why do we need a waypoint here? <laughs> we stood on a platform that took us deep down, deep below the palace to Cazador's dungeon. How big is this place? Uh, okay, we've yet to find what's hidden down here. Let's take a look. That's not what I meant to do. Okay. 
has some creeper. Where is that? Oh. What is it about this place? I know we shouldn't let down our guard, but I feel like I could drift off and never wake up. This is all so grand. To think, it was just sitting here, lurking under the floor. Um, do you think he built this dungeon just for the ritual? I don't know. It feels older than that. Who knows how old? The Cazador will want a grand space for his ascension. A venue like this feels perfect. Now we just need to see what lies at the heart of this place. Let's do it, baby. Anything else to say? Uh, you really know this is all... here. Uh, of course not. It's not like he boasted about his secret lift. <laughs> but it does make sense. He'd want somewhere grand yes. for his ascension. This seems perfect now we just need to see just stretching look at me i'm all fiery i like my i got flames coming from my fingers shadow heart a vampire nest you truly can find everything in the city <laughs> i'd better keep my throat protected okay yes of course he has a dungeon Crystal bars. What in the hells? I never knew any of this was here. Crypt gate. It's over here. We still need to find the children. The children are going to be here somewhere. Whoa. Holy moly. Look at this place. It's kind of pretty. Oh, there's another gate down there. Oh my gosh. Are there... What, did he used to keep people in these cages? Why? Why, Casador? Why are you like this? Entombing clot. What? I can't examine this? Okay. Um, lock makes me impossible. I feel like I can hear people's voices. Let's look over here first. Yep, that's just into nothingness. That's on this side. I'm definitely supposed to go there at some point. What the heck is entombing clot? I want to examine this. Darn. Okay, I hear voices. Are they through this one or the other one? This one also has is entombing. How? How do we get through it then? Are we supposed to use knock on it? Because I do not have that. Although I know Gale does. Um, let's try it on this one first. Let's just try it. Just like the door to the ballroom upstairs, this door features oh, no keyhole, okay. but does have an indentation for a signet ring. Got it. Press the ring into the hollow. Maybe we should do the one to the left first actually though. The ring slots perfectly into place, and the door opens, assailing you with pungent, musty air. Mm. Basic! Hi! Thank you! How's it going? Can we get a basic shout-out? Basic is also an amazing streamer, has played some Baldur's Gate. You... oh my. This definitely looks like might be the main area that we're supposed to go to. Oh, there's bodies in here! There's people! <gasps> Okay, we have to find those little children too, though. Oh my god. Blue, thank you. I don't know. Oh, I hear voices. Oh! I, I think these are the children. They're eternally bound. Oh gosh, how do I fix you? How do I fix you, children? Kazdor will not let this spawn die. Oh, it is immune to all damage. How do we save you? This is very concerning. 
I don't know what that means. For us. And who's on this side? Some of the nobles? Gondelmead, Hapdem, Wensleydale, and Sebastian. Hmm. Okay, I think I actually just want to check out what's over uh, this way first, quickly. My goodness, though. The Gale Girly, yeah. <laughs> Gale Girly. Gale is great. We did break up with him for a while, though. Sorry, Gale. <laughs> but so nice to see you, basic. Oh, treat for Rocky. Okay, before we go uh, any further, we're going to give the kitty baby a treat. Thanks, Paranoid. Time for the treaty for the little kitty kitty. Get to show some kitty action. <laughs> okay, kitty cat time. Defeating the head vampire. The Lost Boys, oh my god, I actually watched that I think in one of my um, classes in university. I took a class all about vampires where we watched some movies and then read some books. <laughs> maybe, yeah, maybe we'll have to defeat Castle or to release them. Hmm. Will is a Disney prince. He is. How is the city still standing? Good question, Ice Hawk. Come on, baby. Oh, he's sleepy. He's saying, why are you making me jump up here? I'm tired, mother. Come on, sweetheart. Don't you want a treat? Come on, sweet potato boy. Paranoid's giving you a treat. There he is. Here's the baby. Ready for his close-up. <laughs> 20 feet max. That's true, the Underdark does exist. Yay, we got a fly, Jackie. So thank you, so thank you. Aww. Twins, thank you for gifting us up to basic. That's so kind of you. Yeah, you want your treat, don't you? Oh, my sweet boy. The kitty kitty, cheers for the kitty kitty. Thanks, Andromeda. <laughs> thank you, twins. Okay, Rocky, can you come show us how cute you are? Please? Oh, basic white bread. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, I didn't even notice that. Basic white bread. Oh, that's funny. Okay, sorry. There's Rocky. Rocky, no, show us how you eat your treat. Show us. Yeah. <gasps> oh, there's the cute kitty boy. Say thank you. Oh, look, you've got a crumb here, Rocky. What's this? Eat it. Show everyone how cute you are when you eat it. Look, what's this? Rocky, wait here. Look here, tired boy. There it is. There. Oh, yeah. Everyone loves you, Rocky. Everyone loves you. <laughs> I guess Basic already has a sub. <laughs> but now Basic um, Red also has a sub. <laughs> That's funny. Thanks, twins. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. That's so funny. <laughs> okay, the Rocky baby. He is huge. He is a big kitty. Okay, should we show everyone how big you are? How cute you are, Rocky? Touch the baby. Touch the baby. He says, no, I refuse. I refuse. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye, Rocky. Yeah, he's half Maine Coon, so he's a big boy. He's got his drool all over my, all over my desk. Thanks for the treat for Rocky Paranoid. He loved it. He loved it. We just had to give him a little smushy smushy. Hi, Carol. Welcome in. Did I say that right? Thanks for joining us. Yeah, wizards. They're responsible for it all. <laughs> They're little mama's boy, yes. My little mama's boy, Rocky man. He's a he's very cute. He's very cool. He's a cute cool cum cool 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 as a cucumber. <laughs> what are words? What are words? <clears throat> Yeah, he's, he's a big boy. He's half Maine Coon, so he's a big old kitty cat. He just turned two in December. The sweet man. Hydrate. Thanks, Hamilton. Actually, maybe we'll just grab some more water right now, and then we'll dive back into the Cazador action. The Cazador adventure. Adventure. Yes, my water treat. It is good to stay hydrated. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back. Okay, 
water has been mm. yep refilled we're ready to go Rocky has been treated I have been treated chair stream <laughs> chair stream ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. chair stream were you counting my candles yeah I have all these little other mini ones that I haven't turned on they're just battery powered so but I have to like flip the switch on all of them so I've just been using the bigger ones <laughs> hydration it's very good for you you know okay here we are We're ready to continue the journey I guess I can just open the store by clicking on it fancy that just like the door to the ballroom upstairs this door features no keyhole but does have an indentation for a signet ring. The ring slots perfectly into place. And Hill Hydra. Opens, assailing you <laughs> with Thanks for lurching, no musty PM. air. Okay, so what's through here? Uh-oh, this looks concerning. Is that a skull? Holding a scroll? Hmm... Okay, hopefully I'm going to get some good information from this. Maybe someone could tell me some some tricks. Some um, skull scroll tricks. How to kill this man. Scroll of names. Field of chess. Let's look at it all. Meditations of a Vampire Lord. Oh my god, is Kazdor writing an autobiography? <laughs> the journal. The Journal of Cazador Czar. It records the movements and actions of his spawn with particular attention paid to Astarian. Why is he so obsessed? Why are you so obsessed with me? Scro scroll is lore. I love lore. I love lore. Um, every order, failure, and punishment is recorded with cold calculation. Only the most recent entries seem to betray any emotion. Uh, Astarian failed to return from his hunt this night. Godi informed he will have the pliers ready when the boy shows himself again. Still missing. I ought not to be surprised. The boy has always been troublesome. I hate how he calls him the boy. He's a grown man. Uh, but to disappear now when we are all but ready, it is unconscionable even for him. I have dispatched the brood. They will find him and bring him home. And when they do, I will make him scream for this. It has been days, and he is still missing. No amount of pain has motivated his brothers and sisters to find him. It seems Baldur's Gate has swallowed him whole. I am searching further afield, but my reach outside the city is limited. In the meantime, the hunt continues here. Deliria and Petrus returned from today's hunt, rushing to report that they had seen him in Worms Crossing. Their tale was fanciful, but they believe it to be true. Astarian, standing in the sun's light, Willing and able to disobey me? <gasps> Inconceivable. It seems he has become more than troublesome. He is now a liability, but he will be brought to heal. He will come home, take his place with the others, and complete his purpose. My, spawn, my spawns fail me. Astarian eludes me. I will have my due. <sighs> Kazador, I'm going to love ending your life. I'm going to really, really enjoy it. <laughs> What a dick. <laughs> okay, Velioth, huh. Okay, scroll of names. Uh, names, thousands of them. Many of the surnames would be familiar to a Baldurian, though some of those near the beginning of the list are for families, families now long disappeared. This is a list of names people date, of people dating back centuries, but continuing right up to the present day. So these are lists of everyone he's killed. Thousands of names. This couldn't be part of the ritual, could it? Maybe? I wonder. Because he's the prettiest. He likes the Starians the best because he's the prettiest. Well, apparently he does prefer the pretty people. He left all the ugly ones behind. <laughs> Live, laugh, lore. <laughs> I love that. Oh, I want to get that on like a poster. <laughs> Goaty definitely sucks. Yeah, I'm glad we killed him as well. Son of a bitch. Kazdor is the worst. I'm very excited to kill him. Mm hmm. Just gonna see what you got in your blood bank. Uh, eternal cruelty. Uh, for my sins, my soul was made ink and written onto this parchment. 
where its scroll crawls sleeplessly for eternity, unless you free it. Can I free it by burning it? I'm gonna try and free you, person. I free that? <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have burnt it. Should I have just shot it? Okay, wait, let's try that again. I don't know if that actually did anything. <laughs> a cross stitch, yeah. I don't know what I just did there, but... Mm, we're gonna try that again. <laughs> Okay, maybe I shouldn't have burned the paper, but maybe if I just like shoot it with a little uh, arrow or something? Smash it with something? Mm. I should break a curse. I should do curse breaking on it. That would be the right thing to do probably. <laughs> Not destroying it. I'm gonna try and have Shadowheart remove curse. Maybe that'll work. Thank goodness for reloading, right guys? Thank goodness for saves coming. I am master at it. Can't afford to stay idle. Target isn't cursed. Huh. I don't know. That doesn't work. It's not cursed thing. What? My soul was made ink and written onto this parchment. Unless you free it. How? How do I free you? Sir? No one stopped me yet. I can try and just hit you with my staff instead of burning you. You think I should try water on it? I can try that. Should I throw water at it? Um I can create water. Hmm. Okay, wait. Do, 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 create water. Eternal cruelty. I don't think that did anything. It's wet now. It's just, it's just wet. <laughs> no. Um, I could. I don't know what to do. Water kills ink, right? <laughs> we tried. We tried. Um, okay. Um, Let's get going. Maybe I could just smack it with an arrow. I don't know what to. I don't know what that does. I think maybe I freed him. Did I free him, guys? <laughs> Am I missing something? <laughs> <laughs> Loading saves, I know. I definitely take a lot of advantage of that. I don't know what to do, what I did. Let's pretend he's free. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I should have examined it? Okay. Let's try again. <laughs> if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. How if I had the option to examine it? Let me see. Maybe I did. Find out in Baldur's Gate 4, yeah. <laughs> so this is, none of you guys know of a way to do this that I'm doing it wrong. A better way to do this. It's all just kind of like, mm, maybe, maybe that's the thing that we could do. <laughs> Perhaps. Yeah, if at first you don't succeed, save scum again. And again, and again. And again, and again, and again. Examine. Fire vulnerability, radiant? We could try radiant. This is weird for a piece of paper that it has so much, um, like, resistances and stuff. Um, I really don't know. I really don't know. 
You were also shocked when I de-cursed the charm guards on the way in? Oh! Yeah, I, I almost didn't, I almost was just gonna walk past them and then I thought, oh, I might as well try and free them. And I was pretty glad that I could do it. Okay, um, hmm, I'm sure I've missed on, missed out on lots of stuff like that though, myself. I can try and do Radiant, maybe? I don't know, guys, I think that Probably not much to do here. I'm ready. Other than, I think his free his freedom might just be death, versus being stuck for as paper. Maybe that is freedom. When you're eternally stuck as a piece of paper, maybe you prefer to just be dead. I'm gonna try and guiding bolt it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Okay, I, I don't know. We're just gonna give up. That's we're gonna pretend that he's free now. <laughs> we're gonna pretend that he's free. Okay, let's see what else we can look what at in here. What now? I'll take this goblet. We're gonna click this one last. Um, can I not I take do. the goblets? <laughs> I want to sell your shite, Casador. So is this really where Casador sleeps? He doesn't have a very fancy bed. Okay, uh, let's see. The guild, letter to Morel Alcum? Morel Alcum! I suppose, as you say, that you have reason to be proud of the expansion of the vampire circle in your city. Of course, Athcatla is more homogenous than Baldur's Gate, and you face fewer challenges from other factions and law enforcement, but still, accept my kudos on your progress there. Enjoy your success while you can, Alcum, for I'm afraid that very soon it will be surpassed by my situation in Baldur's Gate. Definitively so. I am on the verge of a long-planned transformation that entirely changes the rules of the game. Too long have I been content to be merely a major city's vampire lord when I can be so, so much more, and I shall. But that's all I'll say about the matter at present, young Alcum. After all, we mustn't give away the surprise entirely. Casador, sorry. Okay, Casador. Just tooting your own horn there. Oh, holy water. I could have tried holy water. <laughs> oh doesn't appear to be fully implemented. Can anyone Google that for me and tell me if I, there's any way to do that? <laughs> or if I did the best that I could. Okay, uh, diseases of the blood. This is a journal handwritten by a vampire known only as Lady Incognita, in which she describes two different blood diseases that, if contracted by ingestion of infected blood, might inconvenience a vampire with a brief illness. The bulk of the text is descriptions of symptoms and diagnoses of red thrombosis and vandal's paroxysm. Lady Incognita notes that with a vampire's superior senses, it's possible to train oneself to recognize infected prey by scent before biting them. Red thrombosis is a is uh, sorry by a piquant gingery odor and the paroxysm by a sharp astringency. Okay, you did Google it. It's not fully implemented. Okay, thank you, Scotty. Now save me from reloading and trying a million other things. Got it. Maybe with another patch they'll be able to make that fully free. Free. Kudos. Yeah, it is a real word. 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 <laughs> Kudos. Kudos. Um, mortal view. Eyewitness accounts of the ball spawn. Okay, I think we've got this one. Okay, I think that that's all we can do in here other than uh, this last one. Right. Right, you chaps. Okay, let's. I'm scared to look at this one. I'm gonna save in case it like curses me or something. <laughs> okay, usually vampire curses end with the death of the master vampire. Oh, that might have been what freed the person. Oh, well, instead I just killed them instead. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> the tease for patch six. No, I have not seen it. Thanks for the hydrate, Jedi. I don't have um, any wine poured at the moment. I do have some in my fridge, but. Use are just wise if you want to feel more exotic. Indeed. Indeed. 
threads of theory crafting about it on Reddit. Oh, I love that. Good old Reddit. Good old Reddit. Okay, belly off. On the pillow rests a skull with a scroll clamped in its bony jaws. Vampire face? The skull's empty eye sockets flare with an eldritch gleam. You feel invited somehow to witness the skull's memories. It seems urgent. Reddit on Reddit, Ayo. <laughs> new kisses and camp idol animations. Cool. They already did new kisses and they're doing even more. Hey, I'm down. Uh, the skull's memories rise and unfold. Let them wash over you. This skull is all that remains of the vampire Velios. He turned Casador, gave him oh. the gift, and then taught him the rules of vampiric existence. Okay. Um, wisdom. Oh, I suck at wisdom. But let's try it. Concentrate on the memory. What is Velios' first lesson? Need a 15. I really want to know that lesson. <laughs> Wait, do I have inspiration? Can I try that again? Okay, we'll try it one more time. I refuse to fail at this. There we go. <laughs> nice roll. I know it. What was it, a two and a three? Valioth's first lesson is always to dominate. Allow none to be your equal. Valioth okay. recalls when Casador reached out to a former friend. His punishment was to watch as Valioth drained his friend dry. Yikes. No wonder he's such a... Casador's such a... Wow. That's sad, though. Casador was once not evil, and he was just turned evil by this dick. The cycle of abuse continues. Maddie, thanks for the stretch. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, the dice hate me sometimes. Oh. Yeah, they probably were dead if they were turned into ink, you're right. His former employer. I hate this guy already, belly off. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Guys, am I getting sweaty? Maybe? <laughs> okay, concentrate on the memory. What is Belly's second lesson? Come on. Yeah! Yay! Free Casador! I think he's too far gone at this point. Continue. Valioth's second lesson is that power comes from solitude. Mm. To share with others is to be weak. And to be weak is to fail and die. Valioth recalls when Casador rebelled against him. Casador suffered 11 years of impalement. Eleven years? Because he failed. Holy shit. No wonder Kazdor's so fucked. Oh my god. Oh. I mean, yeah, I feel like Kazdor, maybe there was a time when he was a good person. And maybe a Starian could eventually become as bad as Kazdor, but he's not that. He's not there yet. Hi, Giggles. How's it going? Um, okay. What's the third lesson? years. Can you imagine being impaled for 11 straight years? <laughs> you can fix Casador? I don't know. Uh, okay. Nice. Okay. Hi, Mufasa Max. Hi! Welcome in. Thanks for joining us. Valioth's third lesson is to act not in haste. Mm -hmm. A near immortal has time to plan, time to act only when others will pay the price of action. Valioth recalls Casador, his lessons learned, killing him in the rite of perfect slaughter. How they both laugh. What? Valioth recalls Casador boiling the flesh from his skull. And then, to mock him, clamping his schooling scroll in Velioth's jaws. The skull's eyes flash a final time, and its jaws sag open. The scroll with all of Casador's rituals is yours. Velioth 
is no more. Damn. Even his precious rules. He stole everything, even his precious rules. Holy fuck. So, wow. Nothing else I can do. Oh my god. Yeah, the narrator is really good. Roll for seduction. Hi, Karnam. Hello. Hello, hello. How's it going? <laughs> Yeah, this is a very dark quest. Oh my goodness. Yeah, wow. Um, how they both laugh, that was an interesting point. Part. Um, Black Mask Scroll. Unfurling the scroll reveals a list of foul rites and rituals detailing all the ways death can be turned to one's advantage or simply made more interesting. The Rite of Perfect Slaughter, the Liturgy of the Dead, the Sacrament of the Damned, and many more strange accursed rituals cover the parchment. The final entry, however, is familiar. The Rite of Profane Ascension. Here we go. Uh, oh, piteous dead. Oh, ravenous dead. Immortality is your gift, but darkness is your prison, and hunger its gaoler. That's, I don't know how to say that pro properly. It's like jailer, basically. Gaoler. Oh, Carol, yeah, you gotta come back and check this room out again. Mm-hmm. We've some Max. <laughs> you don't know what you just witnessed? Who knows what's going on? I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> I'm all sparkly. Yeah, I have, like, a fire... I have a, a fire buff that makes me sparkle, sparkle. Um, okay, uh... The right of profane ascension will release you. Walk in the sun. Suffer not from hunger. Grow your power beyond anything you imagined. A pact has been made with the Lord of Hellfire. Deliver unto him 7,000 souls. That's why there's a list of all the thousand souls going on. Okay. Each bearing an infernal mark, and you shall be free of your chains. You shall know true power. Deliver the souls. Speak the words. E e Ecce Ecce Dominus Has animus offero in sacrificio Nunc volo Ey volo <laughs> Potestatem quam Polititas es mihi Okay Well Oh we update oh uh oh that's gonna tell us how to do it For Astarian if he wants to do it No I don't want you to ascend Astarian we found a scroll describing the ritual Kazdar wants to perform. He plans to sacrifice thousands of souls, including Astarians, to ascend and gain incredible power. That son of a bitch. And we're gonna stop him. We're gonna stop him. Yeah. Yeah. Don't waste a step. We're gonna stop him. Okay. Mm hmm. Did we read the power structure of Baldur's Gate? We did, right? Maybe we did not. This is a journal of Kazra's thoughts and concerns about the power structure of Baldur's Gate and how the changing balance between the factions affects his own ability to operate in the city without interference or competition. The most recent notes at the end relate to the old problem of Nine Fingers and the Guild and the new concerns about the ambitious young Lord Gortash. Kassar's worries about the guild revolve around the rise of the brash new criminal kingpin known as the Stone Man, and what it might mean for the gate's underworld if Nine Fingers is replaced. Meanwhile, the upstart Gortash is fielding prototypes of his steel watchers in the city streets, and they uh, are they capable enough to detect and damage Kazdor's vampire swan spawn? Guilds, nobles, politicians. If he controlled even a fraction of these, the city could be his, and no one would ever know. Well, that's kind of what, um, that's kind of what, um, a star, not a star, what, um, Gortash is doing right now. Uh, yeah, my bae is, is, uh, Will. Although we did sleep with a star in with the drow twins. This is also I've already asked him about this. Grand. Just keep your eyes open. We could find anything down here. Amelia Tyler, that's the uh, narrator? Yeah, she, she kills it. Okay, here we go. We're gonna go talk to all his prisoners. Should I see what's, I don't think, if I fly over there, there's nothing really to see, right? I 
it's just some nothingness. Yeah. Oh, Carlac's like, I'll join you. Should I go here? Can, how do I get here? Is this like a, am I doing things in a really weird order if I go down here? Am I supposed to be down here? <laughs> I don't know if I'm supposed to come down here. But okay, we're here. Oh, but this is saying that this is the door. I'm okay, I don't know, guys. Oh, this leads to the city. I can't tell. Okay, I won't go down here then. Oh, there's a button. I do I do like to press buttons. I feel like I'm doing this not when I'm supposed to be doing it, but I'm gonna press a button. I don't know what that did, but I pressed it. Was that a bad idea? Maybe. Am I gonna end up like on the back side of this? Did I just uh, make a mistake? Something good here, I hope. So that would have been another way maybe to sneak into this area? I wonder. Chest. I'm gonna look at you as well. I do like a heavy chest. Ayo! I've made that joke before. <laughs> okay, the tourmaline depths. What does this say? Um, am I pressing the button to take all? I am. I'm pressing spacebar. And it takes all. Uh, the tourmaline depths by Lady Incognita. It was um, Master Vampire Donella Zar who reopened the vast blue-green halls beneath Baldur's Gate and brought them under our control. Vam Master Vampire Donella Zar. So that's related to Cazador Zar, right? Um, <clears throat> Sorry, it's the right choice for the twins. <sighs> he seemed to not like it. He seemed not happy at all. I don't think that he was... Hamilton, I didn't know either. I was only told recently. It saves so much time. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't very enthusiastic about our lovemaking. I felt like I had forced him into it afterwards, even though he was like, oh yeah, I'm down. But then afterwards he was like, scarred. It was not good. Um, it was the Master Vampire Donalazar who reopened the vast blue-green halls beneath Baldur's Gate and brought them under our control. But what is the history of this subterranean expanse, and how far back does it go? Not even Donella the architect knew for certain, but in her notebook she speculated that the depths were originally dwarven built by exiles from Berendin, though she admitted she was no scholar of dwarven history. Though deeply delved, the halls were certainly more of an outpost than a city, Donella wrote, though if it was established as a facility over a mine, what were the dwarves mining here? A larger question in this writer's mind is, how did these abandoned depths go undiscovered for so long under a great city like Baldur's Gate? Were they deliberately hidden by some kind of persistent glamour that finally wore off? We may never know. Hmm. I know I love discovering these secret places. And I love the lore. This is great. Okay, what's through here? Just like a level below, and all my friends are, I don't know, my friends are not with me. Where have I ended up? What have I done? What have I done? Maybe this just leads to the, the nothingness again? Oh yeah, okay, I think I saw this when I first came in. Okay, I'll just go fly back up to my friends then. What did I just fail to perceive? Um... Watch the shadows. Come perceive something, please, in here. You dig when that happens? But that's the serv- oh. oh! What's that? Never mind, there you go. I thought that's usually a survival check and not a perception check, but I guess this time it was. Indeed, a uh, oh, a casket. Um, am I disarming it right now? I hope so. Yeah. Okay. 
Um, hi, good viewer. Thanks for joining us. Oh, Plorsum Blade. Undead Bane. Attack rolls with this weapon have advantage against undead. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Do I want to swap out anything for... He wouldn't be able to use this two-handed though, would he? But I get advantage against undead. That sounds pretty good. Should I try it, guys? Should I have him try it? But then he can't do a bone. Can he still do a bonus action attack? I don't know. Should we try it with him? 50% of the time it says nothing there. Interesting. Yeah, um, I always thought that it was only survival checks we're digging, but I guess not. That's good to know. That's good to know. Hmm. You've never seen this? Oh, Chaos, I'm glad that we get to show you some new stuff. I don't know if I should do it. If I should put that in there. Because then he can't do a two-handed thing. I don't know if I should have him use that. We're gonna try it, maybe. Maybe. He wants, he's gonna he's gonna use it. Okay, I don't know if he's gonna be able to get back up now. Because <laughs> I used his busy step. Oh, I can short rest. That was maybe a, a waste, but whatevs. Whatever, whatever. Okay, can I actually see well enough to Misty step back up here? I don't even know if I can see it. Have I trapped you down here, Astarian, like a dum-dum? Um, I think I know how to get him back, actually. I think I know how to get all of us back. Oh, what? <gasps> oh, shit! That's what the button did. Never mind. I didn't even need to Misty step him. Still alive, so that's progress. Idiot. Okay. That's Light hilarious. Okay, sweet. That's what that button do. That's what that button do. Good Beaver, this is my very first time playing. Yep, I'm on my very first playthrough. So yes, spoiler, um, we're avoiding spoilers. Don't touch me. Hey, hurry, jump before it goes up. No! No one back home will okay, ever we'll believe this. we'll get you on the flip side. I could have just what blown now? up there, but okay. <laughs> Should have had him do it. He's being patient. He's being patient. I don't think you spoiled anything, Reaver. I don't think you spoiled anything. You're fine. I don't really care about like a uh, <laughs> a chest being spoiled, but any story stuff, I would be upset for sure. All in this together. Bow, 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 now, now. New, new, new. Okay, can they actually make this Still jump? Still breathing, though? despite everything. Yes, we'll see. Do, 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 do. Oh, Hamilton, thanks. <laughs> Come on, Starian, you can do it. Maybe I well, do have to sh um, short rest for him. As he step back, the strength is just not there. It's just not there. Although I kind of don't want to. Um, just a brief respite. Use his misty step. I'm going to actually just have him fly over. I have plenty of uh, flying. Oh, Shadow heart. <laughs> She just likes to show off that she can jump. No one stopped okay, me here. Yet. Can't slow down. <laughs> yeah, his eight strength. No, it's not not gonna fly. Ayo, <laughs> but he did fly literally. Okay, now we're ready to go in here. I'm going to save because I don't know what's coming for me. Let's see. Oh. <clears throat> Should I free these people? I'm just worried that they're going to attack Approaching me. the cells, you're met with hollow-eyed faces. There's an almost physical stink of decay and mm -hmm. neglect. 
If you accidentally spoil, do you get a permanent ban? No. If you accidentally spoil, hopefully my mods will catch it and just delete it before I see it. <laughs> but uh, if it's accidental, of course, the shit happens. But I think you guys are pretty good. I haven't had any accidental spoilers for the most part. So that's good. Um, okay. Gods, these poor people. Is this how you used to live, Astarian? Astarian, do you know who these prisoners are? Mm. Can we ask all these? Let's just say, do you know who these people are? I don't even know what this prison is. He hid all of this from me. And the others. If I had to guess, I'd say they're part of his ritual. But where in the hells do they come from? Well, you? Yeah, he's the one who got them. I know you. You're the one from the tavern. Mm -hmm. Knew it. You smiled and joked and got me drunk. You... No. You're dead. You called me so many sweet things. My name sounded like a lyric on your tongue. Sebastian. You remember me. You were handsome. Shy. Oh. You'd never been kissed. You taught me how. And then you destroyed me. It can't be. Fuck! Ah! Why did I fail that save? Oh no. Oh, that makes me very sad. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Mufasa. Oh my gosh. That is so depressing. But yeah, I already knew that these were going to be Astarian's victims because on the other side are those kids that we were sent to try and rescue. Oh, that makes me so bad that I missed that role. Ugh. Um, who is he? Is this how all your lovers end up? Whatever this is, we don't have time for it. Okay, who is he? It's not just him. I know so many of these faces. Oh my gosh. They're my... <sighs> conquests. I pursued them. Seduced them. And brought them to Casador. He told us he was feeding on them, but he turned them to spawn. He turned every last one so we'd have souls for this cursed ritual. How long? What? How long have I been down here? Mm -mm. Oh my gosh. Okay, thanks, Andromeda. It says the scars on their face is related to the ritual. That's the check. Okay. Um, let us try an answer. We'll set you free. Stop whining. The only thing that matters is killing Casador. He's responsible for all of this. Um, I guess we'll let us try an answer. One hundred and seventy years. You were one of my first. My family. My friends. Oh. They're gone. You took them from me. You took everything from me. Oh my gosh. I know the writing in this game is so good. It's already made me cry. I already cried on Shadow Hearts Quest, and now I, I I got I was getting teary eyed when he was talking about like the first kiss, never being kissed. Oh my god. Oh wow. Oh that's so sad. Max, I'm glad you're enjoying the ride. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is so sad. Okay, I'm gonna say we'll set you free, I guess. I don't know if, like, what kind of life can they live now? Are they dead? I don't even know if they're, they can have any semblance of a normal life. I know the Shadow Heart quest made me just, oh, it was so sad. Okay, we'll set you free. Free. 
will never be free while that monster lives. Ooh. That's why we're here. I think he's talking about Star Wars. To destroy Kazator. <laughs> you can't. We're talking about Kazator. It's not possible. We'll find a way. We will do it. Uh, we'll find a way. Where is he now? Where's the key to your cell? Sit tight, we'll be back. Um... I think, I don't know, I'm leaning between one and three. Should I ask where's the key? I feel like we can figure that out on our own, maybe. Gonna need a drink for this, I know. This is really hurting my heart. Yeah. Okay, we'll find a way, we will free you. And then, what happens to us? I don't know, I really don't know. Um, what do you want to happen? Like I said, we'll set you free. That depends on you. Can you control your hunger? What do you want to happen? On second thought, freeing a bunch of ravenous spawns seems like a bad idea. Um, I'm gonna say, what do you want to happen, I guess? I don't know. I, I just don't want to die. Whatever you do, oh, just skipped. do it quickly. I can't go and wait. We'll be back. You have my word. Oh. We're gonna save you, I promise. Okay, and then we have to talk to the kids over there too, but okay, let's see what a star you have to say about that. That is so sad. Oh yeah, can you imagine? Just so we'll just go play Baldur's Gate one and come come here. Come to Baldur's Gate and free them. Oh God's above. He kept Sebastian. I should have known what Casador was capable of. Ah, he's played us for such fools. And not just seven spawn to placate the devil. Seven spawn and seven thousand souls bound to them in blood. Holy shit. Everyone who ever trusted me enough to let down their guard, innocents, idiots, <laughs> and the unlucky. It doesn't matter. I will need to sacrifice them all if I want to perform the ritual. What the fuck, man? You're not sacrificing them. We're not performing the the ritual. Dude. What the fuck, Astorian? I thought you were gonna be a good person here. He's like, oh yeah, oh, sorry for these people. Wow, that sucks that I did this to them, but I'm just gonna kill them. Oh my god, Astorian, he better not perform this freaking ritual. <laughs> that was definitely a big 180. Holy crap, man. Okay, you can save them. It is Kazor's cruelty, not yours, to have them kept alive in this way. Don't think about them, focus on yourself. No, you're, you can save them. I'm gonna save before I say this. I need to convince him to do the right thing here. Oh. Oh my God, given rice and. <laughs> I have read those books, Mufasa. I've read the first three at least. Oh God, yeah. Um, interesting. Sarah, Sarah J. Mass, indeed. <laughs> I was, hi, Kamarok. I'm hoping that I can turn him into a good person. Wait for me in camp. Yeah, can you imagine? Okay, you can save them, Astarian. <laughs> What's the point? They're as good as dead. I thought they were dead. If they are unleashed, <laughs> they will cause incredible carnage. They will be ravenous. They must die. Fuck, man. Better they serve a purpose. No, you asshole. Um, uh, how do I convince him to do the right thing? Fidgety fools around, thank you so much for the follow. Much appreciated. Are you a fan of this game? <sighs> he has a bit of a point, Karnam. We don't want them to kill people, but we also... I, he's... He can be better, they can be better too. Come on. Reaver, hi. You had to redo the fight and find a way to force him to be good. Yeah, I'm trying. Uh, we'll try our best. I don't know what to do here. No, he's never really, but we're slowly, I am I can fix him. Guys, I can fix him. We're slowly wearing him down. We're making him into a good person. <laughs> Fidgety, oh my god, it's such a good game. You're gonna love it. It's so good. I'm really excited for you to play it. Uh, it's amazing. I can fix him, guys. I can fix him. 
Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks, Beaver, for the no spoilers. I'll try. I'll try it. And then we might have to reload because we're not going to let him be a bad guy. <laughs> we're not letting him. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, there's still hope for them. You got out. You got better. This isn't you, Astaria. Not really. In the moment they die, they will hate you as much as they hate him. You will never forget that. Don't you feel for them? Perhaps there isn't a point. Um, God, I don't know what to say. I don't know what's going to convince him. One? Three? I hate you as much as you as they hate him. That might get through to him. This isn't you, sorry, not really. I feel like he's gonna be like, you don't know who I am. There's still hope for them. You got out, you got better. I feel like I don't know if he's gonna be trying to decide between one and three. I miss your guys' votes. I wish you could vote. I wish this this thing wasn't broken. <laughs> I like having um <laughs> the moral support with my decisions sometimes <laughs> oh my god four hours to say is coming yep sounds about right for me <sighs> we can fix everybody saracen gail sorry and everybody mm -hmm. okay uh i kind of want to say three i don't know Right? Comparing him to Castor, I think that's something that will get through to him. I feel like he does not want to be just like Castor. I know a drama of the vote thing doesn't work. I still clicked it, but it's broken right now. Okay. Uh, I'm going to try three. It might be better to do one. I'm going to try. No, hate you as much as they hate him. You will never forget that. Let's see. This might be wrong. I know they will. He doesn't care. I know I won't. I'm kind of curious. My father will come soon. I kind of want to see other ways that that conversation can go, guys. I want to see if there's a way. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I'm curious. I'm just curious. What, and then I'll see, and then I'll pick which one I think is the best. I feel like he's gonna deny it and make me think that every single time that he's gonna do the worst thing. But I'll I'll listen to what might be the best one. Oh. Yeah, we'll see, guys. We'll see. My approval with him is shite. It's not good, so I'm worried about that. I don't know if there's a way that I can actually get him to do this properly if he doesn't have high approval with me. <clears throat> Johnny, yeah, we had our fun with Halson. <laughs> Pleb, hi! I, um, yes, I know. Sometimes I don't go with what you guys want, but I still like to know. Whoever trusted, it doesn't matter. I still like to know. I will need to sacrifice them all if I want to perform the ritual. Maybe I can say two here and we'll see. Hi, Kalixin! Did I say that right? Kalix? Kalix? Kalixon. Kalixison. Kalixison? Calix, can I call you Cal? Maybe? <laughs> uh, are you okay? Never. There's too many smooth criminals about. Too many smooth criminal cr criminals. I can't speak either, apparently. Welcome in, Cal. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Oh, yeah, can I show you? I don't know if I can show you my approval right now, but um, it's not great. It's like 25 or something. So it says like it could go either way. He doesn't hate me, but it says it's made up. Sure, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Playing with Romance Australian would be interesting. Mm hmm Yeah, I feel like no matter what, I'm not going to like how this conversation goes, but I'm just going to try and find, um, um, oh, I'm completely winging it, Pleb. I've never played this game before, so I'm winging it. Um, I'm going to say maybe it's Kazor's cruelty, not yours, to have kept them alive in this way? Thank you. No, okay. Yes. I don't like this that. This will all be over soon. I don't like that. I don't like that. I think it's better to call him out on his shit the first time. I know he's neutral with me, so I don't know how it's gonna go. Okay, I'm gonna stick with one for the first one. <clears throat> I mean, I'm gonna try my best to not have him do the ritual. That's about all of what I have planned. I don't know if I'm gonna succeed, but... Oh, Pleb, I'm not that skilled. I am too nice. I do all these nice things in front of him, so he hates me. 
He disapproved when I gave 50 gold to a beggar. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think it's best to say one for the first one. I would love to try romancing a story at some point. It would be interesting to see how his storyline goes. I would love to try romancing Shadowheart too. Everyone. Okay. It doesn't uh, matter. I think one is the best. You can save them. Uh, what's the point? If they are unleashed, blah, 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 blah. they will cause incredible carnage. Okay. They will be ravenous. Maybe four? Don't you they feel for them? They must die. Oh, okay. Better they serve a purpose. Two, one. I feel like I don't know him well enough to say this about him because our approval is not that high. I think maybe there's still hope for them. You got out, you got better. They're in a state far beyond anything that ever happened to me. Decades of hatred will have piled up inside of them. I, I want to know what he says. For I all can't these. even begin to imagine. We must find Casador. Mm. This must end. I'm gonna hear what he has to say about all of those, and then I'm gonna decide what's the best one. Okay, uh, let me show you uh, our approval. So with Ostarian, my approval is currently. Um, where does it say it? 21. Relationship is fair. Character's trust in me is variable. So, yeah. Resist Dirge? I would be down to try that. Do a Resist Dirge Romance Historian? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna try that one more time. Three more times. I mean, I know I'm not gonna do the last one, which was like, don't care or whatever, but... I'm gonna see what the maybe you don't you feel for them. Medium's fine. Okay, at least she doesn't hate me. <laughs> oh, we'll see. <laughs> it's, we're just all right. Yeah, it's gonna be fine, guys. This is fine. We're the dog in, sitting in the burning room, going, "This is fine. It's gonna be okay." I'm surprised that my, oh, Rocky's having a dream right now. He's like twitching. I'm surprised that he hasn't attacked my lights this stream. Because I was home all day today and so he felt like he got to have enough of my attention. <laughs> oh, okay. Everyone, whoever trusted, it doesn't matter. So you can save them. What's the, if they are unleashed, um, they will cause incredible carnage. Perhaps there isn't a point. I wonder ravenous. what he would say about that. Twitching on Twitch, they must yeah. Die. <laughs> Better Perhaps they serve a purpose. Mm, this isn't you. Okay, I feel like he's not going to react well to this one. Okay, this isn't you. Sorry, not really. It should be. I don't want to be like them. They're pathetic, horrible. Really? Oh, this is good. We get a follow up question. Oh, this is a good one. <gasps> Kellel! Kalexis and tipped ten dollars. I like oh. the dots, like Jadzia spots. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kel. I missed what the what was the like something spots? You like the dots? The dots? The dotty dots? I missed the the something spots. Um, Kel, look at how well she said that. Compared to how how much I struggled to say your name. <laughs> Thank you so much for the tip, Cal. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Um, 99, thank you for the biddies. Thank you. Oh, you guys are being so nice to me. Thank you so much. Oh, Shadow. Hi. Hello. Oh, yeah. We don't want to spoil you, Shadow, but thanks for coming to say hi. Much appreciated. Hello. 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 Um, one is spicy, so you will kill them all just because they remind you of yourself. Okay, I'm going to save here because I might want to ask these ones. But the fact that there's a follow-up question for that one, that's a good sign, perhaps. DS9. Oh, is that what that was a reference to? What is that? Deep space? <laughs> I don't know what that means. Hamilton! Thank you so much. Oh, you guys, you're making a hype train close. Thank you so much for gifting a sub to Chaos. Thank you, Hamilton. That's very kind of you. Oh, so sweet. Thank you, thank you, you guys. DS9. It, it, uh, is that what does that stand for? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Just going over my head. Eight balls of catnip. Yeah. <laughs> Rocky, just dreaming the good dreams. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, gosh. Okay. Wow. What to do? What to do? Star Trek Deep Space Nine. Okay, it is Deep Space Nine. But I didn't know that it was Star Trek. Okay. I've watched a bit of Star Trek, but um, not Deep Space Nine. Is that what the reference was that I did not get about the dots? Thank you. Thanks again, guys, for being so kind to me. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Okay. Um, so you'll kill them all just because they remind you of yourself. Jadzias. Okay, thank you. I will, I thought, I, I thought that's kind of what it sounded like, but I just didn't know the name. I'm taking a picture so I can Google that later. Um, you could also, if you want, um, if there, there, here's my Discord. You can share things with me on the Discord, then I don't forget to look at them. <laughs> okay, uh, you'll kill them all just because they remind you of yourself. It's your fault they're that way. Show them the kindness you never saw. No one deserves this fate. Uh, so this is kind of spicy, and I kind of want to say number one. Deep Space Nine AO, yeah. <laughs> Getting deep, guys. Deep, deep. Um, Germany, you wanna say three? Show I know I kinda wanna say three as well, but I'm curious about what will happen if I say one, then we'll re reload maybe and say three. <laughs> okay, you'll kill them all just cause they remind you of yourself. <laughs> He's gonna hate me. They do not. That weakness in me is dead. It's dead. Dude. The lady doth protest I have a higher purpose. Mm. Oh, that was definitely not a good way to go there. <laughs> Getting a bit defensive there, right? Okay. But, I don't know. That Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> that didn't seem to be too good. Valieth talking. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Sounds like it. Oh. You think it's okay to push him? He's defensive because it's true. Maybe it, maybe it is good, perhaps? Oh my gosh! Scotty, thank you so much. Thank you. Choo choo, yes! Thank you for gifting that sub to Cal. That's so kind of you. No more ads for Cal. Amazing. Thank you, Scotty. And thank you for starting the hype train. Check it, check it, check it, check it, choo choo. It I don't want to be like them. Reaver, thank you for the follow. They're pathetic. Oh, thank you Horrible. so much. Horrible. Freaking Astarian. I don't know. Maybe. I don't. Maybe it is good to say one. We might have to, like, we have to do this fight multiple times if we can't convince him. Oh, Cal, enjoy your ad-free viewing. Thank you, Scotty, again, for gifting that stuff to Cal. And Reaver, thank you for the follow. Thank you for the, the hype train, guys. <sighs> yeah, I feel like self-awareness can be hard hard to, to grasp sometimes. Mm. Okay, um, it's your fault they're that way. Should I say that? I want to say all these things to him to see what he says. <gasps> Cal! Oh my goodness, Kyle, you're being so kind to me. Thank you for the tip and now for five gifted subs. <laughs> Scarlet Moon, thank you for the follow. Holy moly, the hype is hyping. Thank you, Cal, that's so kind. Thank you for gifting those five subs. Pocket Ninja, LJ Hart, Cam, Pink Hater, and Ollie. Cal, you're amazing, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much, that's so kind. That's the shit we like to see. <laughs> Exactly, Scotty. We love to see the hype train hype in. Thank you, Cal. I really appreciate that. That's very sweet of you. Hype train level three. Check it, check it, choo choo. Thank you, guys. Thank you. That's so sweet. And welcome in, Scarlet Moon. Are you a fan of this game? It is wonderful and amazing. Uh, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna try all of these. I'm gonna try number two. And see what he says. It's your fault. They're that way. <laughs> Maybe he's gonna get not like that. Don't hate me. I just did what I had Don't to. Me. I swear, I did what I had to. Oh, that's interesting. It's an interesting response. Oh, I still don't know what's going to be the best one to do. I did what I had to, he says. He's sounding a little more, like, concerned about his actions there. Hmm. <laughs> Scotty, yeah. Hey, I'll take it. I appreciate it, Cal. Thank you. 
Um, <laughs> I know I have to try them all. Scarlet, you're a big fan of this game. It's so good, isn't it? Oh, it's such an amazing game. I'm, uh, this is my first playthrough still, so I don't know what's waiting for us, but this is a big moment. Oh, gosh. Um, okay. Yeah, we'll try those other options and see. Oh, this is really hard. Yeah, he's losing his cool on all the responses, so maybe it's like helping him reevaluate what he's doing, what he's planning to do. Oh, I really hope he's not going to send. I don't want to be like them. They're pathetic. Horrible. Okay, we'll try three. Show them the kindness you never saw. I feel like I've got hair, cat hair, something. Yeah, it's my first playthrough. Oh, I'm so excited to see what's in store for us. I know, I am uh, making him relive all his trauma. Okay, show them the kindness you never saw. No one deserves this fate. Don't hate me. Oh, I just did what answer. I had to. I swear. What? I did. Was that a glitch? Did I press what two I by had accident? To. Guys, did I press, I thought I pressed three. Did I press two by accident again? Does he say the same thing for those two and three? Um, it is the same dialogue for both? Okay. <laughs> is it? Did I definitely press three? It's, it is the same. Okay. Okay, okay. Sorry. I'm still reloading. <laughs> I guess I'll see what happens if I say nothing. But then I feel like I should actually maybe go back and say one? I don't know. Maybe it is better to say two or three. When he says don't hate me, I'm like... Okay, so he's realizing that... I don't know. It should be. I don't want to be like them. So if I say They're nothing, is he going to try and justify pathetic. himself more? Horrible. Okay, say nothing. We must find Kazador. Okay, no. My nose is, is itchy and this aching at the same time. must end. Mm -hmm. Okay, no. This is not the response that I want. Um, Maybe it's better to say... Say one and get him all mad at me. But then that stuff about his higher purpose is a little concerning. I know, I love that you guys both <laughs> were very uh, fast with your typing there. <clears throat> mm, this is so hard. <laughs> Milton, that sounds like a decent trade. Ugh, I wish my nose would not itch all the time. Oh, Cal, you want my computer specs? I was thinking that that could be um, a good thing to to include. I know some streamers do include that. Oh, thanks for the follow, Cal. Thank you. I could take a picture about it that. Be. I don't want to be like them. They're pathetic, horrible. I don't know if it's better. Guys, you think three was the best option, Scarlet? I don't know what to do. Thanks for the hype train, guys. I really appreciate that. Thank you. On an iPad, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. I, oh, I don't know. What do we think, guys? What should we do? One, two, or three? Kill them all just because they remind you of yourself. It's your fault they're that way. Show them the kindness you never saw. No one deserves this fate. I don't know. It's hard because sometimes, like, for anyone else, I feel like this would be the best answer. But Astarian, I don't know. Uh, I do like to know what you guys think. <laughs> okay, we. I want to do a poll since the poll's not working. I like to know what you think. It doesn't mean that I always go with what you guys say, but... Three, you guys think? Which choice? Um, one, two, three. Okay. Let's just do a quick poll. I'm just starting a poll, guys. I'm curious. <laughs> oh, this is so hard. I'm leaning, like, I feel like one definitely got him very riled up. But when he's like, don't hate me, like, he does sound like he's letting... Like he's realizing, maybe. The higher purpose thing is maybe a little concerning. You guys think I should go three, hey? Yeah. 
I mean, when he says, don't hate me, and then I'm not, like, being mean to him either. <laughs> I know my, thank you for satisfying my curiosity. <laughs> oh, I do like to know what you guys think. <clears throat> yeah. Don't hate me, I did what I have to do is maybe better than him saying, oh, I have a higher purpose. Like he got real mad about that. Both options seem like the mask dropping. One is just angry and the other is shame. Okay. Yeah, and it's maybe better for him to feel shame about it than to just get angry. Because if he's going in here angry, he's probably going to ascend. But if he's going in there ashamed, then maybe he'll realize he shouldn't be doing that, perhaps. It's very hard. I know, I usually just like to be a big teddy bear, too. But it's hard with Astarian. Sometimes you don't know. Am I sure I did two? Yeah, two and three had the same things. I can press two again to show you guys. It was the same. It's your fault there that way. Don't hate me. Yeah, he says the same thing. I just did what I had to. For two and for three. Um, but I think maybe we'll try three. <sighs> I'm in control of his ascension, but it sounds like people have failed to be able to stop him ascending and I don't know if his approval rate rating with me is not very high but we'll see <laughs> oh no Scarlet we still have to do it we still have to do the fight it's waiting for us through these doors I think we still haven't even talked to the other um, children in the other cell actually we have to do that too but it seems like you guys are voting for three so I think I might go with three is does seem like the most typically like nice person thing to say oh yo pm thank you so much for leaving a lurk i really appreciate that have wonderful sweet dreams my friend it should be i don't want to be like them They're oh yeah no worries always Horrible. always lovely to have you okay yes i think that we are going to do number three here <clears throat> Okay, show them the kindness you never saw. No one deserves this fate. Hopefully he can consider that. Okay, uh, no one deserves this fate. Don't hate me. I just did what I had to. I swear, I did what I had to. Like he's justifying it to himself. So maybe he'll think again about, uh, cause this time, if he chooses to ascend, he's not doing what he had to, he's doing what he wants to. Okay, I think that I agree. I think that's the best answer, guys. Okay, let's go talk to these One children too. To break. Hello, children. Hey. Hey, you. Come closer. Oh God. It can't be. It is you. I knew it. I'll kill you. Once I get out of here, I'll kill you. Um, you're the children from the Monster Hunters camp? Yeah, we talked to their parents. Oh, sorry, he's looking disgusted. Yeah, he's like, ew, children. <laughs> Save after the fight before I talk to him. Okay, I'll do that. Because that's when he really makes the decision. Uh, what's wrong with you? <laughs> You'll do nothing of the sort. Sorry, he's with me. I think I'll say one, I guess? I know, poor Chessa. I was hoping that I'd be able to save them and them not be turned into vampires, but I guess here we go. <laughs> Okay, you're the children from the Monster Hunters camp? Ha camp! Monster Hunters! Uh, the girl camp! Oh god! My parents' camp! Uh, Chessa, focus! Oh. Resist the beast in inside you! Oh. Uh, you promised! Uh, it's your fault! You did this to us! Didn't he tell you? He's the one that kidnapped us. He's the reason we're spawns. I know. Uh, I'll kill you! Uh, <laughs> yes. Now that you um, <laughs> mention it, I may have done that. Oh, don't look at me like that. Casador's orders. Quite the deviation from my usual routine, of course. Uh, capture, not lure. Uh, I didn't bring them in with sweet rolls or anything. 
I really forgot about them. Felt nothing the moment I handed them over to him. What the hell, Starian? Oh. You're kind of a horrible person, you know. Um, we promised their prayers we'd save them. If we eliminate Kazdor, will they be free? If Kazdor wants them, then Kazdor can have them! Let's go! Yikes! Okay, uh, we promised their parents we'd save them. Parents? Oh, I know, guys. I You've seen my parents? parents. Itching. Um, they're looking for you. They'll be fine so long as we free you from this place. Better off without you! Now that I've seen what you've become, yikes. Um, oh, guys, I feel like I've got, like, a cat hair or something, like, right in my nose that's itching me. I know, he was much more sympathetic in the other cell. How does he care less about turning children than he does about kissing that guy? Hamilton, I might be kind of allergic to Rocky. I might. I have to try um, taking some like antihistamines and see if that helps me, maybe. Locked in a tomb for a year. I can't remember. He might have told me that. Would that have been a while ago? Um, I think he has told me about some, like he told me he had to like eat rats and stuff. Um, okay, they're looking for you. They're looking for you. I miss them. I, I think. Oh. Or perhaps it's the hunger. Oh, I don't know. It's so hard to tell. You should go. Uh, leave us here. Oh. We shouldn't be out there. We'd hurt our families. Um, I'm going to help you. How do I free you? Never give up hope. Trust me. I know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry it had to end this way. Good luck to you. The world will be a safer place with you behind bars. Yeah. Yikes. Uh, I said yuck. Yikes. Oh, does it taste like M&M's? It does. Mm -hmm. It, it, um, it's like, tastes like chocolate. My, my lip trap. It does. <laughs> I should just cut off my nose. Oh, that's true. I guess he didn't like do as much action in the kids, but he did, he did kidnap them. So, um, hmm. Yeah. I don't know, me not remembering something. I do have the memory of a goldfish. Okay, I think I should say never give up hope. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. Behind the exhaustion, starvation, and fear, recognition stirs in her eyes. And with it, hope. Yay. You... You really mean it? Casador's uh, uh, got this stuff. Mm. It controls the doors. If you get it, okay. you can set everyone free. If you get it, I will. somehow. I will kill him. Uh, I've changed my mind. I think it's safe for you to stay right where you are. I can't promise anything, but I'll try. All right, I'll free you once I have the staff. I will free these children. I will. Good luck. Shadow Heart approves. If you fail, well, I suppose we'll be seeing you again in here. Hopefully not. I'm glad that Sarin didn't disapprove of that oh, because yeah. I don't need to lose They're any more approval with him here. Right. <sighs> okay, um, yeah, maybe Sarin is a little I numb. Hope. Was okay. numb by the time he did the kids. I this hope was, so. um, these, this side. Can I talk to these guys on any more? I just want to breathe free air. One last time. It's so sad. Okay, what about on this side? Better not be cursed. Uh, this, this doesn't feel good. Uh, I, I don't like this. Yes, his shaft. Um. Okay, sorry, child. Oh, I'm just laughing because I read your comment, Hamilton. Oh, gosh. Okay, this is it. I think the fight, the main fight is through here, judging by the looks of this room. This looks like the place for a big old fight. Look at, I think, are these people alive in these things? Apparently there's like 7,000 souls. This looks like a good stage for a gigantic fight. Okay, let's save. Oh, you think I should talk to Astarian again? Okay. <clears throat> well, you clearly want to say something. Yeah, you suck. 
I just want to know if you'll actually set those prisoners free. Will you save the children of Alma's tribe like you promised? You're brooding about the prisoners. Stop it. What's next? Um, what should we say? One or two? just want to know if you'll actually set the prisoners free. Will you save the children of Alma's tribe like you promised? I think I should say two. Because he did remind him of his promise. Oh, drama says one. <laughs> I think we should go with majority here. I feel like I either one or two could be fine. I do, yeah, he is funny when he's happy. <laughs> uh, Slater looking at Carlac. Look at her, she's a little uh, disapproving of Astarian. She's just a big puppy dog. I'm surprised she didn't approve like those Shadowheart did in the moment there. I'm sure she approves of all my nice things. Um. Okay, uh, this one sounds like a little more accusatory, maybe? If you'll actually set them free, so maybe I'll say two. Will you save the children of Almost Tribe like you promised? I'm not sure. I've been weighing my options. Okay. On the one hand, they're the key to my unlocking eternal power and freedom. On the other, well, it's my fault they're here. Yes, yes, it was Cazador's command. I had no choice, but... It seems now, I do. Yes. This is what I like to hear. Yeah. Okay. Oh, he says the same thing with one and two? Okay, that's good to know. Good to know. Okay, so, yes, that's what I like to hear. He's actually, like, realizing, oh, I do have a choice. I don't have to do the asshole thing. Yes, Starian. Look, guys, we can fix him. We can fix him. We can. He is growing. Okay, you should free them. You owe them that. All right, but what's best for you? Mm, I'm sure you'll make the right decision. Ooh. I mean, make the right decision. I mean, it is a little guilt trippy, but I kind of like it. Three or one. You should free them. You owe them that. Or I'm sure you'll make the right decision. I don't know. I do like to leave people up to, to make their own decisions. Kill him. No. No. <laughs> we'll kill Casador. <laughs> oh, guys, I don't know if I should do one or three now. This is so hard. Uh, you should free them. You owe them that. I'm sure you'll make... Okay, let's uh, maybe save and then see what he says to both of these things. I'll say one first and then I'll reload and try three. Um, let's see, you should free them, you owe them that, and then we'll try it, you'll make the right decision. You don't think that he's gonna make the right decision? <sighs> yeah, I know, it's a little worrying. Okay, you should free them, you owe them that. And what am I owed? See? What about the injustices I've suffered? I knew he wasn't gonna make... Am I not entitled to anything? Dude. All that matters now is killing Cazador. I've earned that, if nothing else. That's not a great response. We can deal with the prisoners when the time is right. After all, they're not going anywhere. I did not like that response. That was a, not how I wanted that to go. <laughs> oh God, sorry, Ian. Just when I thought you were improving. About what I'm owed. You are owed revenge, but revenge doesn't include killing children. Okay. I'm gonna say you're gonna make the right decision. Maybe. Maybe we can trust him. I think he might have a better reaction to that than me saying oh, you're owed, or you're owed, or whatever. Yeah, we're gonna save the children, hopefully. Hopefully. I'm not sure. Okay. On the well, yes, um, it, it seems now. Okay. I do. I'm gonna say maybe. I'm actually curious what two is. Oh, I feel like two. Okay, let's ask all three. We'll ask all three of those of these. Uh, we'll say what's best for you. I feel like he's gonna be like ascending, but you, you can surprise yourself. You know, he can surprise me. 
Uh, uh, what's best for you? That will very much depend on what happens once I face Cazador. But I have to find him before I can face him. So let's focus on that, shall we? I don't know if I want to say what's best for you, though, because that's getting him in a little selfish mode. Let's try... You'll make the best decision. Gotta save the women and the children. And the, the men. Save all the all the people. <laughs> all the other 6,000 plus people. Yes, we want to save everybody if we can. I don't know if we can, but... <sighs> We're gonna try to make him a better person. Maybe we should just let him make his own choices, but give him just a, the gentlest of nudge. <laughs> I'm not yeah, sure. the gloating screen, you get to see a lot of yes, that. It seems now. Okay. I do. I'm sure you'll make the right decision. I'm sure I will. <laughs> Whatever the hells that might be. Okay, I guess we'll leave it at that. I hope he makes the right decision. <laughs> uh, I'm glad you're enjoying enjoying my struggles. <laughs> Guys, okay. Hopefully that's okay. I didn't like his response to one. It was a little too like three, yeah. He'll make the right decision, hopefully. Okay, here we go. Do Shadow Heart or Carlac have anything to say? All's well, I hope. No. Aside from the obvious. Okay, uh. Should mind my step. Just procrastinating now. <laughs> Where is Kessler like in that coffin? Where is he? Where are the other spawn? I'm assuming that this is where the fight's taking place. Oh, I see them now. Thank you. Thank you, Scotty. <sighs> okay. There's Cazador. There's the spawn. Cazador. I have worked Son of a bitch. To have that brat spoil it. Calling a starting a brat. <laughs> He's so rude. He's so rude. Save before the fight. I um, just save before we open the door, but I'll save again right now. Wretched creature. You're the wretched creature, Cazador. You bitch. Okay, I'll save right here too. <sighs> the little mosquito. We're gonna squish him. We're gonna squish him. Okay. First in my heart. First in my heart. Copper for your thoughts. Carlock is first in your heart. <laughs> I just accidentally clicked her. Okay. Here we are. Hello, motherfucker. Child. Ooh. Jackpot. Hi. How's it going? Thanks for the biddies. How you doing? Oh gosh. Okay, I'm just like saving every five seconds. <laughs> Good luck, thanks guys. I'm scared. Should I um cast heroes uh What's next, feast on us? I'm gonna cast heroes feast on us before we do this fight. Wait, feast supplies? Is that a thing? When has that ever been a thing? I didn't know that that happened. I'll take it though. Okay, saving again. Oh my gosh. Okay, oh, something else I'm gonna cast. Never a dull moment. Is my ghouls. Ghouls, 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 ghouls. Hopefully 
hopefully that's not a bad idea, because sometimes when they explode, they hurt me. <laughs> okay, it always takes a second for them to, like, load into the game here. And for this to... Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. Saying again. <laughs> I am terrified. Okay. Oh, they're running ahead. Okay. That's fine. Um... Here we go. Moment of moment of truth, guys. Oh. oh yeah, I could summon us too. I have not used us for a long time. Where are you, us? Where are you? There he is. Summon us. Should I summon Scratch? Can he really help much? I don't even know if I have Scratch's ball on me right now. Shovel? <laughs> I should summon Scratch? You think so? Okay. I'll summon Scratch. If I can find him. Who's, who's got him? Someone there. Carlac has him. Okay. We got the whole party ready, again. guys. Scratch his ball. <laughs> I will summon everyone in chat to come help me. Yes. Please, guys. <laughs> you guys want to fight Kazuma, right? Okay, now we're ready for it. We got all our buddies. Garlic. I don't know what I can do with garlic. I mean, I have garlic. I think. I can throw it at him. <laughs> okay. Let's just go. Let's just fucking go for it. Oh, droid Cazador, hey! Okay, here Sweet we go. As my feet can carry we can me. throw garlic at him, maybe. <laughs> Scared. I'm gonna save again. I'm saving, like, every step that I go closer. Oh, he has ghouls, too? Okay, wait, let me take a look at who he's got over here. Catter teeth. Hollinger Hunter. Oh, shit. And then all of the... Okay. Petrus. Deliria. Fucking Deliria. I'd be down to kill you, Deliria, but... Okay. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Who stands before us? Is this truly our prodigal son? Hm? Do not slouch before me, boy! Have you no respect for yourself? Look at you. Crawling back after abandoning your family. You should be begging our forgiveness. Um. I guess I'll let him talk. Okay. Uh, we know all about the ritual. We're here to stop you. He doesn't owe you anything. Sorry, I was afraid of you. You're pathetic. His, his staff is pretty cool there. Um, okay. I'll let, I'll let, uh, I'll let us start and do the talking, I think. Keep back, do not intervene. Forgiveness? You've never forgiven anything. Every mistake, every slip was punished. I strove for perfection in all things, even those as imperfect as you. A pity you amounted to so little, despite my efforts. No! No. Fuck you. And fuck everything you've ever done to me! Yeah, fuck you, Casador! <laughs> you son of a bitch! Fuck you, you bastard! We're gonna murder you so good right now! I know, Casador's voice actor is killing it. He's got a good voice, he does. Even though he sucks balls. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're here for justice. You're gonna pay. We're here to stop the ritual. Careful, sorry, don't lose your head. Um, say nothing. Justice, maybe? I don't know if I should say anything here. Say nothing. We're here for justice. You're gonna pay. We're here to stop the ritual. 
The double fingers, he deserves it. <laughs> uh. here to stop the ritual yeah I don't know say nothing I do like saying nothing often but uh, I feel like oh sorry it's already said stuff so okay I'll say we're here to stop the ritual <laughs> the cattle know about things of which they know nothing this ritual is centuries in the making <laughs> nothing shall stop it now that's what you think you son of a bitch why would you just punch him you truly forgot my power you truly thought our bond as creator and creation was all that stopped you from killing me hmm? oh you are weak my child you are a small, pathetic little boy who never amounted to anything. Can't wait to <laughs> oh. Do you capture him too, like his siblings? But today, you will finally do something worthwhile. You will burn, and I will ascend. No, you're gonna die, Castor. Great, so I don't even have a Starion in this fight. Oh my god, they took off his clothes! I love that outfit. No! Stop him! Get me out of this! Witness the birth I lost a, of a the guy. Vampire Ascendant! Eke Dominus! Attack! Rufus of the Seven, so... Can I, um, call lightning? No. What is that? Level three? <laughs> Sucks to be counterspelled, doesn't it, Kazdor? He has 208 plus 70. Okay. Ugh. He's in... The heck, man. He has to use them to suck the power right out of those poor fuckers. The ruins. Okay. Uh, so... Examine you right now, Casador. Casador, examine. So, ritual source is seven. Can I, um, like remove his connection to them somehow? He is incorporeal. Sunlight hypersensitivity. So I should get sunshine on you if I can. Um, Pale Petrus, can I like help you somehow? Sacrificial lamb, incapacitated. If Kazdor draws power from all the spawns bound this way three times, he will ascend. So, can I use, um, Shadowheart to, like, free this person? Oh my god, this is- I don't know what to do! Scarlet Moon! Thank you for the biddies! No, I can't even control him at all. He's incapacitated, unfortunately. I don't want to kill- he can be helped down- oh, so I can go up to them and help them? Okay. Okay. Um, hmm. Should I do that over here first? Can I just help this guy down? Is that a bad idea? They're temporarily hostile, so does that mean he's gonna attack me if I let him down? Only a starion can be helped. Oh. Okay. Um. Look, they're showing their boobies. 
Damn, dude, you couldn't at least let them keep their tops on? Um, oh, sorry, and his clothes are back on. Okay, good. I was like, they're gonna destroy my, my armor. Okay, maybe I can fly over there and help him on my turn? I wish I had more, like, speed potions or something. Okay, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, Carlac. I can't- you can't reach any- you can't even- I don't know. I don't think I can hurt him right now when he's incorporeal, right? Ethereal. Can't be shoved, thrown, or used as an improvised weapon. Uh, okay, but maybe I can still... Um... Oh wait, misform. Immune to all non-magical damage. Okay. Remove my sunlight. So... Scroll of sunbeam. Let's try this. I don't know if you can really do this. Uh, Karlak, but we're gonna try our best. That's gonna go on him, right? Will that hit him? I think so. Hope so. Nice. Sucks to suck, Casador. What can I say? Um, hmm. Should I rage? Should I rage? Maybe. Let's try it. Ah! <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> okay. I wish I had like a speed potion, but I don't think I have any. Okay. Okay. Let's see how this goes. <sighs> Why are they making themselves smell so bad? There's a lot of turns <laughs> to be done here. There's a lot of people. What does this fume do? Okay, us. Uh, let's let's see. What can we do here? Um, devour intellect. I can reduce his his intelligence. Should I try that? Is he really intelligent? His 17 intelligence. Maybe that's a good idea. Um, or maybe I should just. Dash jump. I don't think that can he reach Castor though? I oh wait, devour intellect, it is melee. Um I my ghouls are in the way. I don't actually think he can get close to any of these people. Okay, maybe um I can just have him um synaptic discharge on these guys. go. Okay, so I have Sunbeam. I could use it. Even if I explode my ghouls, they will, um... Okay, wait. Is that gonna get him, though? It will, but it'll also... But if I my ghouls all explode on him, they will cause damage to him. 
Maybe I should have them explode. There's wall of fire as well. I kind of want to use sunbeam though. I just don't know if that's worth it. It's a level six spell slot. Okay, wait, I'm gonna do arcane battery sunbeam. I might kill all my ghouls, but they do damage when they die, so. This is a bad idea. Okay, wait, let me get a little bit closer. Go like right here, maybe. Then try sunbeam. Again. I I mean I really like chain lightning, but okay, we're gonna try sunbeaming you. Hasdor, I really hope this damages you. Oh, I fucking destroyed two of my ghouls. I thought that they were gonna do damage. Oh, there we go. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Sucks to suck, Kazador. Okay. <laughs> he got all the bursts as well. That was maybe a waste. They didn't do any damage. I probably should have done that. Oh well. Okay, I can also quicken spell um, the chain lightning, or I could do another sunbeam. I don't know. It does a decent amount of damage. Hmm. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Crept up behind Castor. Oh, damn! That's amazing. Arcania. <laughs> That's impressive. Okay, I don't know if I should do another- Oh, I can recast Sunbeam! Wait. Oh, wait. I forgot that I can recast it. Without having to use a spell slot. I can do that next time though, right? Heat Convergence. Maybe I'll use a quick spell flinger with my can trip on him. I don't know, I feel like I should try and just do a lot of damage. Maybe I should do um, a chain lightning. Let me uh, look at his defenses again here. Hi Dresden, welcome in. Thanks for joining us. He's not resistant to lightning. And then I could get a lot of damage done on these guys too, maybe? Don't you know if it's worth it? It's also disintegrating because I would be using a level six spell slot, and I only have one of those. I don't know if I should use it for my chain lightning or my disintegrate. That's tough. Would the spawn get hit by chain lightning? Maybe. They probably would, and maybe that's a bad idea. Maybe I don't want to hurt them. So, maybe I'll try disintegrating him? Oops. Because I don't think that it would kill him, but it would maybe do a decent amount of damage. Okay, I'm gonna try quick and spell disintegrate, I think. It says 50% though. Are all my, is everything 50%? I can also do wall of fire for all these people. That's 85% for this one. Try just the cantrip. I don't know. Maybe a bad idea. 85%. Critical miss. Well, oh, shit. <laughs> that makes me feel like a big dum dum. Oh. <clears throat> Chain lightning, you think, will be better, hey? Yeah, maybe I should have done that. Oh well, that's the end of my turn. Okay, scratch. Can you even do here? Oh, you can help! Oh, he can help! Okay. Um, where help our. I don't think he can reach. Maybe he can help a starion on his next turn. I'll just have him dash. And then, what's the farthest you can jump without having to use any movement? There. And then he'll go as far as he can. And next turn- oh shit! Well, that was fucking stupid. Oh my god, Annie. Why did I do that? Oh! Yep, that was stupid. He took a fucking opportunity attack. 
Why am I such a dingling? R.I.P. Scratch. I could try summoning him again. On Carlac's turn. Is it just a bonus action? I'll check. <laughs> it's okay, he can I can resurrect him again. Oh god. Okay, um hmm. Should I have her She does have some good uh radiant damage. I think that I'm gonna just make her walk in with some OP spare guardians. I'm going to do yeah, level five spirit guardians. I believe in you, Shadow Heart. On I go. Oh, I should have made her jump. Now she can't go very far. That was stupid. Sanctuary. Should I sanctuary somebody? I don't know what to do. Um. I can maybe. <laughs> yeah, poor Scratch. Mm. I could make someone vulnerable to damage. Spiritual weapon. Maybe I should summon a spiritual weapon. Maybe I'll do that. Um, what's the best one to use? Force damage, maybe? Force, force, force. Oh, they're all force. Um, I'm gonna summon a trident, maybe. Where is that in order? Nice, okay. So, smack that. All on the floor, smack that. Does something. Better than nothing. Frost. Okay, Shadowheart, your turn is over. You tried your best. Okay, Chatter Teeth, I'm a little worried about you. Um, you were trying to make her fall asleep? No, thank you, sir. Level six? Oh, shit. I cannot counteract that, can I? I can't counterspell it, right? I must roll to prevent it. Okay. I can try. I can maybe counteract it. I really don't want Carlac to fall asleep for 10 fucking turns. Oh, but it ends upon taking damage, which she's probably gonna take damage, so maybe I should not even bother. To, I'll do like a level three counter spell. Okay, she's saved, nice. I feel like there's like so many people surrounding her, she would definitely take damage. Our is near complete. Uh -oh. Can you feel its profane power? No, man, you suck. Where are you going? Oh, fuck you. Oh, he got rid of my, um, sunbeam? That way? Well, maybe I can just cast it again. Um, I'm going to, I think, cast another sunbeam, actually, with Carlac here. Oh wait, should I summon Scratch again? Casting spells is blocked, must- oh. Wait, casting spells is blocked? Why? Oh, I need to make her do damage with her rage, though. Casting spells is blocked. I don't know why. Okay, well, then I guess we will just do a... Um, do I have cleave? We're gonna cleave um, all these bitches. How are those bats not dead? Oh, I killed some of them. Never mind. <laughs> oh, she can't cast spells when she rages. Oh! I didn't realize that. Okay, it's okay. I'll have someone else cast that one. Um, hmm. Should I lacerate someone? Or just smack this guy? I'm just gonna smack this guy. Nice. That's pretty good. And then what can I do with her bonus action? Maybe I'll make her take a strength potion, actually. Mm. Cloud Giant is better than Hill Giant. Yes, okay. I should have done that before I attacked, but, you know, you live and you learn, guys. 
She's just gonna chill out there for now. Okay, let's see how this goes. Oh, she's gonna lose her uh, spirit guardians, isn't she? If they all attack her here. Uh oh. It is what it is. It is what it is. Yeah. Castor is a theater kid. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Uh, unstable backlash. Okay. I guess. Magic retribution. <laughs> that did something. I think I hurt myself too. Oops. Okay, us. Can you come devour his Castor's intellect? Or no? Because he's in this form. Us, I would like you to do something useful. Can you synaptic discharge this thing? Not miss this time? Yay! That was good! Good job, us! I'll just let you chill here, I guess. Oh, spirit guardians. Oh no, they are hurting us! They're hurting us! <laughs> okay, um... Hmm. I could cast a fireball, or should I cast sunbeam again? That's level 6 though. I don't know if I should do it. I kind of want to make some... I, I kind of want to have someone else use a scroll. Maybe. I could cast a fireball on these guys for... Um, just an action, but it's only level three. Should I just go for it with the chain lightning? But then I don't know if I'm gonna get Tazador. Um, hmm. I mean, I my fires, my fire is with my my good goodness right now. could get these three. I could maybe get Kazador too. I don't think I can get Kazador. I mean, I could get all of these people, <laughs> maybe. Including myself and Karlak if I did it careful. I cannot reach. What do you mean? I can't reach this one, though. Maybe I'll try this. His next turn, he ascends? I thought he had to drain from everyone, like, three times. Oh, does that mean that you only get three turns? Oh. Well. <laughs> if you first you don't succeed, try, try again. <laughs> oh, so I should sunbeam him, is what you're telling me. Okay, we'll try it. I'm gonna get you in this too, Karlak. Okay, I'll sun. Whatever. You'll be fine, Karlak. You have lots of health. How did that- what? Kazdor, you're still- how are you still this? What the fuck, man? Um... I don't understand how I didn't hit him with that. Why is he still in this form? Is that weird? Um, okay, well. <laughs> why, why did that happen? Um, okay. I guess, I think that's it for this turn. <clears throat> I should help a starion down? I did kind of forget about him. Well, if I fuck this up, then I can try again and send Scratch over there without dying. Okay. Um, oh yeah, I could fly over there as myself. I should have done that. Well, first you don't succeed, guys. Oh fuck, I didn't know that that was gonna happen. Um, hmm. Hazador, you suck. I think that we might have to try this. Yeah. I think that we might fuck this one up. I mean, 
mean, I could maybe get him with the, this. I'm gonna try. I broke my blade back, but my holy blade, baby, 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 baby blades are still here. How are you still alive, Casador? My God, man. Um. Hmm. to do to cause a uh, nice amount of damage to him. Like, will he take damage with this? I feel like I should be trying to get over to Sorry, I don't think I can reach him, though, as Shadowheart. So... I could do this one. I could try Sacred Flame. Can I actually... I can target him with this? Form, you suck, Casimir. Call you bad news. <laughs> Casador, he's got 72 health left. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> Good, we're gonna give him the business, Pat. We're gonna give him the business. Um, okay, I'm gonna just try and smack him again. Enough movement? I thought we could fly. I can't reach Castor. Oh. Ah, okay, I'll smack this guy then. Oh, he was charmed. Oh well. She's fine. She's fine. Oh, now he's back to this. Okay. Is about to die. Um. Guys, I think we can kill him this turn. I think we can get Kazdor this turn. Oh my god, leave Karlak alone! Okay, uh, Karlak. I would love for you to be able to use this. Because <laughs> it has radiant damage. Uh, she's still- is she still raging? She is, right? Let's just smack him. I think we're gonna kill him this turn. If Karlak can manage to do enough damage. I gave you a strength potion, Karlak. Come on. Should I try lacerating him? Oh, Karlak, you were so close. So close. So close. I'll just heal you a little bit, I guess. I don't know. She's got a bonus action. I don't know what to do with it. I can definitely kill him this turn, though. But then am I gonna have to attack all the other guys? Uh oh. Oh, they broke my spirit guardians. Quick, grab the staff! <laughs> Okay, Us, why don't you kill him? I would love this if Us is the one to kill Kazador. <laughs> Come on, Us. <laughs> I think he did it, right? Did he do it? Did Us just kill Kazador? <laughs> I think he's dead. <laughs> us killed Kazador. <laughs> I love it! <laughs> My good brain kitty! Oh, and here comes my kitty! Hi! Give me the toy, baby. He wants me to throw the toy, but he won't give it to me. Guys, it was us. We all did it together. Go us. Go us. But am I gonna be able to survive the rest of this fight? At least, I don't know why it's not stopped the ritual, though. Oh, my baby. Thanks, guys! We did it! And I didn't even help a uh, star hand down at any point. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, we're just gonna keep chilling here. Okay. Us is still alive. Us has a lot of health, actually. Okay, what should we do next? Um, I still have Sunbeam. I mean, it's. I could maybe. 
go craft it this way. I get I can get two of them with this. Can try it. It's only an action. That's a lightning bolt. I'm just gonna try it. I'm just gonna try it. Oh fuck! I got Carlac. Sorry, Carlac. I just moved my mouse just a titch there. Um, and then I'll quicken spell. Okay, these guys only have one and six health left. Come on, man. Should I just do one more sunbeam on them? <laughs> Not get Carlac this time. Keegan, welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. That was maybe a bit of overkill. It's fine. We're fine, guys. <laughs> Are you a fan of this game, Keegan? Thanks for joining us. Okay. Oh, I maybe should have healed myself. We'll be okay. Oh, I'm immune to difficult terrain. It's fine. That was not the best backlash, but okay. Um, hit this man again, please. Suck, trident. Doing more damage. Oh. These, were those bats there the whole time? Oh, hi, Lulu. Hi, how's it going? Thanks for joining us. Good morning. Oh, look, Astarian's normal. He's back. So why did it only re release Astarian when I killed Casador? That's weird. Um, I'll try this shield. Okay, Astarian, gl glad to have you back, friend. Glad to have you back. Who else can we hurt with our magic missile? That. That. Okay, and then should we Misty Step somewhere? To assist in some other murders? Maybe, maybe? Is Kazdor like inside of the sarcophagus? Is that where he went? Because there's a beam of light coming from it that I don't think was there before. I guess I'll like make you a step here. Friends of bats. Fuck yes. Fuck yes, Carlac. Kill some fuckers. Hurt these people. Oh yeah, that was close. Almost got all his health gone. Okay, and then we'll heal you again. They like to bully Carlac, you know. Hi, Rocky. How are you? Wait, do I want to do Supreme or Superior? Just do a Superior. How to co conserve our um, 3 30 in the morning Andromeda? Oh my goodness. Keegan, yes, this game is so good. I love that you were playing. Are you in Act 3 as well? Rocky, what's up, cutie pie? My little cutie kitty baby. He's in the esophagus. <laughs> The sarcophagus! <laughs> Having a little nappy nappy. Oh, the bat symbol. Does that mean Batman's coming to help us? I'm down for, I'm down to have your help, Batman. Hi, we got Catman here. Hi, little Catman. Hi. Okay. Um, yeah. Just doing our thing. I'm a little worried that we have to fight our uh, spawn after this. But we'll see. We will see, guys. Hmm. Okay, us. Keep on. Us has actually been a champ here. <gasps> Storybook, hi! Hello, how's it going? Thanks for joining us and thanks for the biddies. Hope you're doing awesome. Uh, yeah. Us has been a champ. Oh, wait. Can we just get you off the difficult trade a little bit? But us is the one that killed Kazor. He's, he's a good little brain. He's a good little brain. Okay, it's my turn to fuck some shit up. What should we do? Um, should I do a... I mean... I could get both of these guys. And, but then I'm gonna hurt all my friends. I could do careful spell. Uh, careful spell, although that's, uh, 
that uses one sorcery spell and I won't be able to do a quicken spell. Oops, so maybe I'd rather be able to do two. Should I do another summon? I'm also gonna hurt my friends. But I will kill three people. It'll, they'll be fine. They'll be fine. My friends will be fine. <laughs> okay, who do we have left? We've got um, two bats. The predator werewolf. That's it. Okay, I should go after this werewolf then. Unless I just use a magic missile and kill one bat, two bat, and then all the rest on this guy. Now all we have left is the werewolf. Pretty good. Oh, good night, Karnam. Thanks for hanging out. Sweet dreams. Oh, Tactician! You're on now, Keegan. Nice! Okay, I'm glad we're not giving you any spoilers then. I'm a little worried that we're going to have to fight these guys after, but we'll see, I guess. We shall see. Okay, Shadowheart, why don't you just um, give us a nice radiant damage on this guy. Okay. okay, so I should save right now, hey? Before I talk to- oh, wait. Why is it showing that Astarian's- oh wait, no, that's not Astarian. That's- <laughs> that's Yusen. Oh, all I do is win, 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 no matter what. Yeah, I don't always win, guys. We're trying our best here. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh, time to see what new horrors waiting for us. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna save again. I don't know what to do. Ooh. Okay, look, it's not showing that they're enemies anymore. That's good. What am I saving against right now? I am on fire. <coughs> I'm on fire. Um, okay, let's take a look. Uh, decide Kazdor's fate. We found Kazdor. He plans to perform a rite that will be blah. He must be stopped. Okay, we already did that. We defeated Kazdor. He retreated to his sarcophagus to heal. He's vulnerable now. All we have to do is open the sarcophagus, sarcophagus lid and finish him off. Okay, so I've saved. I don't want the easy path. I have saved. I'm gonna save. One more time here. So I can always reload if a story decides to be a, a dumb dumb. Should I loot all these bodies first? Maybe? What's Let's do some here? quick looting, guys. I'm just gonna do some quick looting because I'm scared and I'm procrastinating. <laughs> I'm procrastinating talking to Casador. None of these have anything in them. Bitch. I just wanna loot you. I just I just wanna I just I would I would just like to I'm just pressing all the wrong um buttons. Fucking hell. Okay. Well, I just want them all to say empty, so I at least know what's what's what here. Okay. They're all empty now. They're all empty now. Oh, just kidding. There's a few more over here. Okay. My cat is sitting on my... Oh, maybe Chattertooth will have something. Okay. These cats. I swear to God. Do you think it's... Oh, yeah. I did something. Okay. Saving again. We're ready for it. We are ready. Oh, good night, Saracen. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Thank you so much for hanging out. See you next time. False Vampire Lord, thank you! <laughs> okay. Yes, I am now the Vampire Lord. I'm just not a vampire, but that's fine. Not in this game, anyways. Hey, Rocky, what you doing, sweetheart? You sitting on my computer? You're not gonna turn it off while I'm playing this game, right? <laughs> Cleaners, you're wondering what time it is for me? It's 12.30 in the morning. Wow, last time I looked, it was like 9.30. Rocky, come on. Look at this creature. Wait, Rocky, is this like one of your treats right here? Guys, I found some of Rocky's treats. I was sitting on it. He's gonna get one right now. Look at this little spoiled boy. <laughs> is that good? A bonus treat for Rocky, because I somehow it was under my ass. Happy, happy? Are you happy with that, sir? Do you enjoy my butt treat? 
He doesn't usually hang out in my arms for this long. Are you over it? Okay. Bye, Rocky. <laughs> yeah, I know. I can't believe how much time just passed. That's crazy. I was just having fun. Time flies when your savings come. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed. Yeah, West Coast. We are on the West Coast calling PETA. <laughs> he loved it. He loved my butt treat. <laughs> Okay, guys, here it is. Moment of truth. We're gonna, I guess, decide if it's starting to sentence, which he better freaking not. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Um, oh, good night, Blue. Sweet dreams. Thanks for hanging out. Um, hopefully we'll see you on Monday. Bye, bye, bye. Hopefully you're not hungover tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, so here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Moment of truth, guys. Moment of truth. I clicked it. Why is nothing happening? There we go. No, no. No healing sleep for you. Wake up! Oh, my. Get your hands off me, worm! Worm? <laughs> I'm not the one in the dirt. Kill him. One last thrust. And I'll be free of you. Kill him, sorry. I'll never have to fear you again. But if I finish the ritual you started, I'll never have to fear anyone. Ever. You think me a fool? That I would allow anyone to usurp me, speak the words, and ascend in my place? Hm? The runes I carved into your flesh bind you and all 7,000 souls to the ritual. Complete it, and those bearing the scars will be sacrificed. You included. You are simply a means to an end. I made you to be consumed. I am so much more than what you made me. Get over here. We can do this. No, oh, man. Um... All right, what do you need? You can't finish the ritual, you'll kill all these people. Didn't you hear him? If you complete the ritual, you'll be consumed. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing, I'm not doing this, man. I can't help you with this. Um. This is really hard. Uh, luckily we can r reload if we fuck this up. Um. Yeah, I want to say too, but I feel like whenever I remind him of this, he just gets all freaking, uh... I'm kind of thinking that one might be good, just like go along with it until the end, but I don't know. <laughs> I'm getting all the different options from you guys. I don't know what to do. Um, get over here. We can do this. What do you need? You can't finish the ritual. You will kill all these people. Didn't you hear him? If you complete the ritual, you'll be consumed. I'm not doing this. Um. Okay. Fuck. This is so hard. I guess we'll get to try them all because we're probably gonna fuck it up the first try. So I kind of want to say four. I'm not doing this. Maybe he'll get mad at me. Four you think is bad, right? Four often is bad, but... Um, this is not very sympathetic. Okay, I'm gonna maybe say two. You can't finish the ritual, you'll kill all these people. If we release them, how many people will they kill? Tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. But if I complete the ritual, think of the power I'll have. With me by your side, we can, we can save the city. We can save ourselves. Um, 
All right, what do you need? Persuasion, if you want to live a life you're proud of, you uh, I want you to live a life you're proud of. You can't be proud of this. Insight, look into his eyes, try to see what's driving this. I can't, I'm sorry. Um, I would try persuasion, but someone already told me that it was an insight check, which was maybe a bit of a spoiler. Um, um, <clears throat> like, I would lean towards two, but I feel like someone already told me that it was three, basically. I think I got spoiled on that, that it was an insight check. Um, so I guess I'll just try it. Um, look into his eyes, try to see what's driving this. I mean, it is a good choice, too. I, I hate that I got spoiled on that, but that's okay. Um, I have no bonus, though. I have to get a 20? I think I'm gonna fail at this. <laughs> And it could be, it could be persuasion? Okay, that's good to know. So maybe I can, I should have done persuasion. <laughs> I could have done persuasion? Okay. All you can see are those eyes you've maybe seen so many times before pleading with you to help him. Oh. Can I try that persuasion again? <laughs> oh yeah, I can still do it. Okay, persuasion. Um, I want you to live a life you're proud of. You can't be proud of this. Okay, it's fine, good. It's uh, fine, guys. It's all good. It's all good. We can try persuasion still. Uh, you can't be proud of this. We'll be good. No, chaos, you're fine. You're, you're good. Don't worry about it. Okay, here we go. Well, this one will be fine. Yeah, I think we can hopefully do it with persuasion. Whew. You. Ah, oh, yes. You're right. Yes. We did it. Okay, good. I can be better than that. Okay, okay. Good, 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 good. But I'm not above enjoying this. Yeah, kill him. Enjoy that part. Come on. Oh, oh my god! Is... is it over? Is he... It's casual titties. Oh my god. <sighs> yes. He's gone. What does that mean for us? Oh my goodness, guys. <sighs> we fixed him. We did it. Yay, thank you. Yeah, that was crazy. He used to like crazy Stabbing. That was, oh wow. But then he cried after. Okay, it means you're free. You can do whatever you want. I don't know how I feel about this. It's just casual nudity at this point. It's a, kind of like ruins the seriousness. Um, what do you want it to mean? That depends. Can you keep your fangs to yourself? Say nothing. Um, I guess I'll say nothing. And see what Astarian says. It means you have a choice. You can hide here. Living in the shadows like parasites. Or you could be more than what he made us to be. You can choose differently, of course. But the consequences are on your head. And what does it mean for them? Now, that's a better question. 7,000 spawn from ancient conquests to stolen children. Casador's star controlled everything during the ritual. If it controls the cells too, you could decide their fate. We're obviously gonna free them. We will free them. 
Oh my goodness. I know he totally, I, there's a lot of times where I want to hug them. I wanted to free, I want to hug um, Shadowheart when she was crying too. And oh, when he started crying after that, poor historian. But literally me, whenever I get mad, I just like I'll immediately cry after. <laughs> I love boobies too, Andromeda. But I just feel like there's a time and a place. And this is like an emotional moment. I don't need casual titties. <laughs> but Lulu, I'm glad you enjoyed. <laughs> okay, they're too dangerous, they need to die. Let's release them, they deserve the same chance you got. Why not just leave them? They're not our responsibility. Let's release them, they deserve the same chance you got. Some sacrifices just aren't worth it. The poor wretches in the cells are innocent. They shouldn't have to suffer just because I... lured them here. They'll need someone to lead them. Take the tunnels into the Underdark. Find somewhere, well... Underdark, good idea. Not safe, but less perilous. What? No, we can't! Just try to keep them out of trouble. Okay, bye, ladies. Bye, titties. <laughs> I think we're done here. I'm proud of you, Astarian. Let's go. You made the right choice. Free the nipple, exactly. <laughs> I, I shouldn't judge. It just, you know. <laughs> I do love the titties, just not at every moment. Okay. Uh, the Gur people. I have them as allies now. Nice. The Gur people are my allies. And then uh, we defeated Kazador. We should tell Alma the good news. did it! Okay, I'm gonna save again. Wow! Good thing I am very persuasive. I have very high persuasion. I'm glad I was able to do the persuasion instead of the insight. <laughs> in love now! I hope you guys are in love now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, maybe I should just be thankful that they weren't just like hanging out with their- with the noodles out as well. <laughs> Gosh, okay. Kazador, can I loot your body? I should talk to Astarian. Rhapsody. And another Sar family ring. Maybe I should give this one? Ooh, I just shivered. To uh, Astarian? Okay, let's chat with him. That's it. He's gone. It's not bloody anymore. After all these years, these centuries. It's really over. Okay, oh, so you're totally fine. No, don't worry about it. It wasn't like you spoiled a story beat or anything. I just thought that I like had to do the insight, but I didn't even have to. So it's all okay. It's all good. <laughs> okay, how does it feel? I'm proud of you. You did the right thing. Uh, you don't regret giving up all that power. Um, I'm gonna say, how does it feel? I'm not sure. I feel a little uh, numb. What I've lost. <laughs> what I've gained. It's all so much. And God, all those spawn. Free in the Underdark. I need some time, I think. I. Just to let it all sink in. Underdark is gonna be cray cray. <laughs> let, let, let's just go. This place reeks of death, and I want to feel alive again. I wanna go visit the Underdark again. <laughs> See all the vampires hanging around. Okay, we will go, but I just would like to uh, loot all the other bodies. I think it's just a few more bats and they're all gonna have nothing in them, but... Oops, sorry. <laughs> Let's just go. I'm done. Yeah, fair. I'm proud of you, though. I am proud of you, Astarian. I'm very proud of you. I wonder what our approval rating is now, because he did approve of me when I persuaded him. I wonder how much that increased it. Um, 
three points <laughs> from 21 to 24. Well, yeah. Okay, I just think that there was maybe like one other bat or something. Yeah, two bats over here. But guys, we did it. We did it! Bard persuasion bonus there. Yeah, I think do bards use charisma too? Because, um, yeah, because I'm a sorcerer and I use my charisma. It's, it's yeah, I'm very persuasive. I'm a very persuasive lady. Mm -hmm. Only just altered the trajectory of his entire life. You don't think he could approve of me a little bit more? <laughs> Come on. What's this? Gazador is saying that I still have something to do with Gazador? No. Maybe until I leave here. Okay, well, uh, let's just see if uh, Karlak or Astarian, I mean, or Shadowheart have something to say. So Astarian didn't fulfill his master's ambitions for himself. At least that means he's his own man. Though, I'm a little surprised he didn't covet those powers. Oh, he definitely did. <laughs> he definitely did. Two parts use charisma. I'm not a bard, but... <laughs> I've never, I don't, I, I haven't got to play as a bard at all. I kind of wanted to play as a bard at some point. Have a bard companion, but nope. Nope. Um, okay. Uh, Karlak. <sighs> He'd hate to hear Max, me say hello. this, but I'm so fucking proud of Astarian. He could have had it all, but he kept his soul instead. I'm so proud of him too. I wasn't sure he had it in him, but he's changed so much overcome so much darkness oh i could smooch that pointy little face oh carlock you're so freaking cute she's so cute could smooch that pointy little face <laughs> how you doing mr fx thanks for joining us oh my goodness i'm so proud of astarian he made the right choice oh wait what's over here if i go over here go into these doors? Are there just nothingness? Into the nothingness. Da -da 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 do Oh yeah, maybe this is another way that I can Oh no, just kidding. <laughs> this is just rubble. I cannot leave this way. Oh, but there's some things over here. Oh, vampires before Velioth. Oh, oh wait. That's a charred goblin. <laughs> Key to Kazor's dungeon. Huh. This goblin not having a good day. There's a few charred goblins in there. Interesting. Hmm. <clears throat> Bard dirge. Oh, that does sound interesting. Um. Oh, that sounds fun. Oh, Mr. FX. Oh, wow. Yeah, late for you. Um. But glad you had a fun D&D session. We're gonna read about vampires for four belly off. Sounds like he's a fucked up dude. And Castor kind of ended up just treating his spawn like belly off treated him. Uh, oh, what's this? Marble plate. Oh, let's uh... Trust no. Disarm it. I don't know how we haven't triggered that already. Oops. Fine. Hmm. Okay, we're okay. Vampires before belly off. Oh, it's just a list of them. I thought it was like gonna talk about like, oh yeah, vampires were so much better until this other like this like crazy fuckhead came along and ruined everybody. <laughs> <clears throat> Whoa, wait, Arcania, if in your first playthrough where you offered Casador, oh, you sorry, you offed Casador before he even got to the act, Astarian told you he, he hoped that you'd die screaming and left your party forever? Oh my god. <gasps> That's insane. Because <laughs> he didn't even have the chance to make the decision himself, I guess. He got a little butthurt about that. Yikes. That happened to you too, Reaver? Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, I think I'd love to play as a bard at some point. Okay, sorry. Our illustrious predecessors, brief notes on the succession of Master Vampires in Baldur's Gate by Lady Incognita. Uh, all dates, Dale Reckoning. 
Okay, uh, Aravask the Forebear, Zoltan Far the Eviscerator. Guys, what is Zoltan from? I've played another game with a Zoltan and I can't remember which game that is. Was that Dragon Age? Zoltan? Madam Talon the Preser the Well Preserved, the Interregnum, Temporary Suppression by Lathandarians. Lathandarians? Uh, Diablo 3, I have not ever played Diablo, so I don't think that that would be it. Zoltan. What would I be thinking of Sultan? Hmm. Trepania, he left your party your first playthrough? Oh no. You had to redo Casador? Yeah. <laughs> I know, I could never let him leave me. Sultan is a dwarf from The Witcher! Okay, I'm thinking of The Witcher. That must be it. Thank you, Jacka. It must have been from The Witcher, yeah. Because I have played all The Witcher games, so. Not Dragon Age. Got it. Um, Blaise. Blaiseus, the Corf Corfi? <laughs> Who led her spawn in ecstatic blood dances? Dixon Nightbinder, Fabler the Fleeting. Oh, 1019 to 1019. I should look at some of these. 998 to 1018. 95, 55 to 98, 88 to. Oh, this is 1019 to 1019. The Fleeting. No wonder his name is the Fleeting. That's funny. <laughs> um, hideous Ga Gathwick, who knew not satiety. Uh, Don Nellisar, the architect who opened the Tourmaline Depths. Are we in the Tourmaline Depths? Is that where we are right now? Veliath, the Marchnet, and then Casador Sar, the Avid. The Avid. Wow, I think Casador's lived a lot longer than Veliath did. Only 1204 to 1276. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, us, you did great. Good job. Thanks for killing Casador, us. You're a good little brain. Okie dokes. Okay, we're going to exit. I don't think I can go through any of these doors over here. Even if I were to fly, fly away over there. Maybe we can... Oh. I love it when that happens. They're all just dying again. <laughs> um, maybe we can go out that other doorway now? The one that we saw before. Oh. I guess all these guys are gone. Nothing to see inside of the prisons. The prisons! Nope, nope, okay. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, Ulmer, you're here! I thought I was like, gonna have to go. I was just thinking about that, about how I was gonna have to go back and talk to her. You killed one vampire, but released 7,000 of his spawn. Have you lost all sense? Don't they were me. innocence. To kill them would have been an even greater crime. It includes your own children. Uh, but if you do decide to go hunting them, know they include your children. They... Oh, they survived? Well, that depends on how you define survived, really. Undead. But they are free. They're making their way into the Underdark as we speak. This is... difficult news. We will need to decide what it means. Thank you for what you have done. Slaying Cazador was a great justice. As for the rest, well, time will tell. I think they'll be better people than Cazador, because they experienced Cazador's assholery. Woo the poo! Yes, we managed to avoid him ascending, thankfully. Thankfully, he is not a bad boy. <laughs> oh, diva! Oh, that's hilarious. Cazador the diva. Yep. <clears throat> oh, wait! Loot in the coffin? Did I miss that? Okay, wait, let me go see. Thank you. Might have missed some coffin loot. Can't have that. Let's take a look. And then we'll go chat to Alma a little bit more. Yeah, yeah I mean, his personality's not going to change completely. He's still going to be a bit of a sass man. Is there something? Can I click this coffin? Oh, yeah! How did What's I miss that? Here? Thank you. My goodness. Okay, oh, it's just a key, his vault key. Well, I already broken that. Okay, I think I got that other stuff. 
Woe and his dagger? Woe? I definitely got his dagger. Oh yeah, I got woe. That's the staff that he used. Oh, would I want to use this for myself? Looking ahead. Um, I do like the arcane battery though. Light, chapel, maybe I'll give that to someone else. Pretty sexy though. On my way. Curse to put my hands on everything. Yeah, I hope they fix the extension soon. Why is Carlac almost naked? That's just how I like her to be dressed. <laughs> She's just wearing a backless outfit. She's looking fine. I just wanted to show off her fiery heart. And, um, she's got clothes on. <laughs> there was actual naked free the nipple happening earlier with the vampire swap, the vampire spawn. Okay, let's talk to Alma. I pray the spawn will stay in the Underdark. We will show no mercy if they return here. Even your own children? All that matters now is the... Okay, we can rebuild. Sorry, I just cut her off. All I read that it matters fast, now but then sometimes the I don't future. listen to it. There are few of us left, but we can rebuild. We can be strong again. Yes, you just have to have more babies. You could have killed them all. You could have ended Zar's legacy today. Why are you wanting me to kill your kids so badly, dude? Today's battle is done, Ugh, but tomorrow will bring a new fight. Leave the vampires alone, okay? I want to have a word. If you think those spawn will stay in the Underdark, you're a fool. We'll see them soon. Mark my words. Okay, well, if they actually leave the Underdark and go and attack people, then I guess you're allowed to kill them. But I think they're gonna stay. I'm just surprised you were able to survive, honestly. Thanks, lady. For having such confidence in me. <laughs> <clears throat> you let thousands of vampires spawn go free. How many will die because you could not do what needed to be done? Get off my back, lady. Jeez Louise. I pray the spawn stay low. Otherwise, who knows what terror they will wreak. Yeah, Carol, exactly. They have a choice now. Thousands of vampires spawn on the run. Our own children among them. I only pray something of their innocence remains. Okay. I like this guy's take on things a little better. <sighs> Eternally young children, yeah, that would kind of suck. Thank you for all you have done today. Interview with a vampire. Shite. I don't know what to think. I wanted to see our children again, but not like this. Never like this at least the vampire lord is defeated Kazador will never steal away another innocent life it's on the bright side of things right <laughs> this was the first guy I we met I find my little ones wherever they are hiding Aww. we will see what can be done hopefully you're not talking about murdering them <laughs> at least Kazador Sar is dust that is a blessing, if nothing else. <clears throat> Wait, Chaos, you killed Chessa in the sewers? How can you even... Do you... You can find her again in the sewers? Is that another spoiler? <laughs> At least Casador Sar is dust. That is a blessing, if nothing else. I would think that I couldn't see her again. <clears throat> At least the vampire lord is defeated. Kazador will- Okay, we already asked that that. Wait, so does that mean I can go find them again in the sewers? Today's battle is done. Okay, we've spoken to everybody now. Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, I would still prefer not to know that kind of stuff. I don't want to know. That is, I would consider that still a story spoiler. Um, oh, I didn't talk, did I talk to this guy? 
Anyone capable Let's of killing a vampire as we powerful as Cazador has my respect. But Sparing the spawns was an error. Releasing them was an act of madness. Dude, get off. Why are all these people getting on my back? You can leave. We'll make sure nothing remains but dust and bad memories. Yeah, I, I guess just, yeah, be very careful, guys, about I don't want to know anything that I wouldn't know. <laughs> like, if I don't already know and it's coming, something that I just wouldn't know yet, please don't tell me. Okay, um, should we go back up this way? Because I kind of want to check where that other door would lead me, but maybe I should... I don't know. Which way to exit? Okay, I'm going to save maybe, because I want to see where that other door leads. <clears throat> Did you know a star is a vampire? I did know that. That is something I am aware of. <laughs> yeah, I guess now I know that I can find them in the sewer. Oh, uh, sorry, I'm not going to be able to jump. Oh, okay, but if I go through the door, then I think it just brings my friends with me. Usually, let's go take a little look, see doodle. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's see where this goes. We do have the key. Nice. Gloomy ascent. Hmm. How am I flying while not being ugly? Because I am a sorcerer. Um, I did not accept the tadpole upgrade, but I am a sorcerer. So once I reached, I think, max level, I got the fly, the fly skill. And I love it. <laughs> Through the power of love, indeed. Indeed. Where? Oh. Where are we? Lower City Sewers. I've been here before, apparently. I've looted this stuff. Oh, maybe this is where I find them in the sewers? Should we take a look? See if we can find them? Okay, so this is this side. Oh yeah, this is where that lady was waiting for. That makes sense. <laughs> that she was waiting here, since it's so close. To, oh yeah, I did find the, okay, yeah, yeah. I remember I did check this out earlier. Um, grease ball, grease ball. Okay, um, Minsk is also in here somewhere. Think, but maybe not in this part. Oh, yeah. No, that's another exit. Hmm. Well, now I just kind of want to find where they are in the sewers. The capital G! Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. How you doing? How you doing, friend? Are you a fan of this wonderful game? Thanks for joining us. <laughs> that's you, capital G. Oh, there's some apples here. Maybe for me. I need more pockets. I will take these apples. I already looked at these posters. Apparently, I didn't look in all these crates, though. All these missing posters. These are all stolen by the vampires. The darn vampires. Hmm. <clears throat> I think that the vampire spawn are gonna Anything be wonderful. Use? They're gonna go live a nice, happy life in the Underdark and not kill people. I mean, I have to at least give them the choice. I can't just condemn them before they've done anything wrong. What kind of society would that be? Where we condemn people before they commit a crime. <laughs> oh, is it only draconic ancestry sorcerers? Okay, there you go. I am. Um, I got the dragon in me. I know, I didn't want to be ugly, that's why I didn't use the tadpole power. <laughs> I tried it and I reloaded because I thought I was too ugly. <laughs> but 
But yeah, I don't really use the tadpole powers that much anyways, so... Some of them are okay, but... Let's see if we can find... Some friends in the sewer. I maybe should switch out to Jahar or Jahar, 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 Jahar if we run into mint. That's... I don't know. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just like wondering if we're gonna find them somewhere now. <laughs> Open sesame! I'm just running around town. Running around. Oh, there they are. Okay, we found them. I'm gonna save. Let's see. Hopefully, we're not at mince yet, though. <clears throat> Live on hook horrors until they get control of their hunger. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> eh, do you like the boat ride? It's a small world after all. Okay, so these, he, there, he's here with his daddy-o. Chess, Chess and Cass, I have your practice swords. Would you like them back? Found his kids. My children. My sweet ones. What have they done to you? I'm hungry, father. I'm so hungry. It hurts, father. The hunger. It never stops. Please. Do you know of anything that can be done? Hook horrors. Did I say it too fast? <laughs> Hook horrors, sure. Uh, let them feed on animals. It's the best you can do. I put them out of their misery. Oh no, you're on your own there. Um, let them feed on am 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 animals. <laughs> uh, it's the best you can do. I've been fighting it, but I think you're right. Better that than they start feeding off humans. Yeah, don't let them starve. What up, Cass? Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for everything. At least I'm not alone. I, I could not have borne that eternity. Is this my life now? Darkness and hunger. Yeah, but is that better than being dead, hopefully? I did not expect you to free us. But I am grateful. She's happier about it. I think they can learn to love their lives. It just might take a I little while. I did not while. expect you. <laughs> They'll get used to it, right? Exactly. Is this my life now? Oh, gosh. I do not know if this is more blessing or curse, but it is at least something. Yeah. Thank okay. you, my friend. He said thanks. We're good. We're, we're friends. I do not know if this... Yeah, Thank you, my friend. Yeah, never getting old, though. Staying a child forever. Like, I think I'd be fine with staying this age forever. The age I am now. I could be 30 years old forever. That's fine. I don't know if I'd want to be 10 years old forever. Yeah. Okay, um, so... Cool, cool, cool. We found them. So... I think I want to go maybe back into the city. know where Minsk would be. I think we might have to go down a specific entrance. The one that was pointed out on the map. Oh, search the sewers. Oh, no, apparently he's just anywhere in the sewers? The Stone Lord must be here somewhere. Oh, okay. So he's just somewhere around here. Hmm. Do I want help? help? Definitely not. But thank you for asking. Um, hmm. <clears throat> Back to camp. Yeah, I want to go actually talk to... Uh, yeah, because I have to go get Jahara out of camp. Um, and I want to go talk to everyone else about, about what happened to Astaria. Yes, thank you for bringing that uh, chat to my attention, Scotty. <laughs> um, yeah, we don't want them to be talking about new things before we get to talk to them about uh, everything that went down with Astaria. Was the magic mirror always right here? Why have I like never, is it always been this bright? <laughs> I feel like I've just noticed it way more all of a sudden. Okay, let's talk to everyone else about what happened. A 
Starion showed restraint where most others wouldn't. He might not appreciate the sentiment, but I'm proud of him. Alpha, everyone's like, a Starion would hate if I said it, but I'm proud of him. <laughs> oh, Reaver, no worries. Yeah, uh, if I ever want help, I will for ask for it. Always. I do want help sometimes, but I always ask for it. I'll ask for it help. Ask for it first. Wow, I just struggled to say that. <laughs> uh, sometimes, yeah, sometimes I do ask for help, but I never want, um, no, I always want to try and figure things out for myself if I can. That's part of the fun of the game, right? So, okay, let's um, kiss. My favorite subject. <laughs> can we kiss? Look how cute this is, guys. <laughs> He's very romantic. He's a he's a real um, prince charming. <laughs> hmm. He is my Disney prince. Astarian resisted the allure of Cazador's would-be powers, and I am glad of it. Whatever he would have gained, would have come at a great price. Indeed. Yeah, um, I have the owlbear because uh, I killed his mom and then I told I rescued him from the goblins. So now he hangs out with me <laughs> wherever I go. We got our owlbear, we got Scritchy Scratch, we have a kitty cat, we got all the all the goodies, all the best our best friends in in the camp. <laughs> I know that kiss is so good, right? They say that the only thing a vampire can feel is hunger. Nothing else touches them. Not grief or mercy. Mm. Or any sense of what is just. Who knows? And there is often more ignorance than insight in what they say. That's accurate because Astarian don't can definitely feel grief and he definitely just did the right thing there. Oh, I've never seen the Albert stand up like that before. That was cute. <laughs> That was pretty cute. Oh, you didn't have him. Oh, interesting. Maybe they, maybe they didn't have him in earlier um, versions. Come join you here. Okay, Gil, what have you got to say? We did a good thing back there. I won't dwell on the matter. I know that's not a sentiment you're accustomed to reveling in, but rest assured. Your actions have spoken for themselves. Why is he talking to me like I'm a Starian? <laughs> I will, I do like to revel in the, in the matter. I do like to revel in doing good things. Okay, that's weird. Why did he talk about me and not a Starian? But sure, Gail. By convincing him? Okay. That's it, Gail? Go ahead. Okay. I'm listening. Weird. The Duke's alive. He is. I kept him alive. Okay, I think that... That is it. For who, the, who we can talk to in here about that. Scratch and us are staring at each other. <laughs> like, who is this strange creature? Okay, I think we talked to all the peeps. All the people. Potted people, people, people. I face Gortash? Nope, I have not. I have not fought G Gortash yet. But I did go into the submarine, the Iron Throne. But I still have to do the Steel Watch Foundry and then I'm gonna face Gortash after that. Yeah, just the underwater portion. <clears throat> you can really do everything in crazy different orders with this game, it's nice. Um. Okay, so I guess we need Jahara for the next leg if we're gonna go find Mints next. If that'll be our next thing to tackle. We can do a little swaparoo. Oh, and look at that, Karlak. You conveniently don't have a bunch of random crap in your inventory. That's nice. Enough that Jahara can actually <laughs> hold some of it. What's on your mind? Really? 
Really? Really? Oh, fine. I think I need to add some more options of what people say. She always says she's eating dirt every single time. Like some variety there, maybe. Hi, kitty. You guys hear that cat meow? He was just making himself purred. Yes. Oh, you have your toy? You want me to throw it for you? Okay. Join me. Tahira. As you wish. You heard him? He's so cute. Playing Tekken. I don't know that one. Interesting. Okay. We're feeling good. So wait, the starting just double checking. You don't have anything. Oh, I should do a long rest. Maybe uh, a starting's gonna have a um, something to say. A little cutscene like Shadowheart did after her quest. Oh, someone has something to say to me. Yeah, it is you, Astarian. Okay. Let's see. That's strange. Knowing I'll never hear Cazador's voice again. Knowing it'll never command me to bow against my will. I'm free from him. Forever. And how does it feel? Do you regret turning down all that power? In that ritual chamber, you were someone else, someone unrecognizable. Do you think we did the right thing freeing all those vampires spawn? Um, I think I'm just gonna ask him how it feels, even though I already asked him this. <laughs> I'm gonna avoid the more uh, complicated topics here. How does it feel? Invigorating. Mm. Terrifying. All of the above. <laughs> I'm still trying to understand it, really. I came so close to losing everything back there. Mm. To losing myself. Wow. Back at the ritual, all I could see was the power on offer and the safety it promised. I was so blinded by it. <laughs> Just as Cazador was. But you saw something in me. Someone else I could be. Someone who could break the cycle of power and terror that started <laughs> centuries ago. You saved me back there. I may not have appreciated it at the time, but I do now. Thank you. You saved yourself. I just gave you a push. The ritual would have changed you. I'm glad you resisted it. Yeah, it's interesting that he referred to that as like losing himself. If he would have gone through with it, I'm glad that we we did the right thing. Uh, I did do Shadow Hearts Quest Boo the Poo. Yes, I did. It was good. It made me cry. <laughs> um, I wasn't sure if you'd stop the ritual or not. Honestly, do you think we did the right thing for you all those vampire spawn? I do want to ask this, but I think first I'm going to say you saved yourself. I just gave you a push. <laughs> You did more than that. You believed in me. Believed I was enough. Just the way I am. <laughs> when I look at my future, anything and everything feels possible now. You saved me from myself and let me walk a new path where I can be free. Truly Honestly, free. Yay. This is a gift, you know. Thank you. I won't forget it. Oh, you're welcome, Astorian. I've never seen him so joyous. Oh, so nice. That's it. Well, hello. Okay. What can I do for you? So glad. So glad that we helped him out. Oh wow. Mm. So sweet. That was 
a good one. That was a good quest. <sighs> okay, so the next thing I guess is to look around and try to find dear old Minsky boy. I am I don't know if I thought that maybe that one area would connect through to um, this one right here. This bit here would connect through to the Ballist Cult, but maybe it'll connect to the Stone Lord? I guess we can try and find out. Because I feel like I pretty much explored everywhere else. Are there any other areas that I haven't explored? Is this an area? I don't think so. We'll be able to do some... Oh, what about over here too? This is also an area that I haven't really gone in. Okay, maybe that's something too. Like last time I looked at that, I couldn't even see any way to go through there, but maybe we will have access now. I guess there's one way to, only one way to, to figure it out. Okay, um, hmm, but friends, I think that I'm gonna have to save that for next time, because it is my bedtime. I was there a month ago, yeah. But we'll go back. Oh, good night, Scarlet Moon. It's my bedtime, too. Um, yeah, we're gonna pick up again on Monday, guys. We will, we will resume our journey through the, 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 the sewers, trying to find Minsky Minsk on Monday. So thanks for hanging out guys, that was lots of fun. That was a good quest, I'm glad we got to do that one today. That was lots of fun. And then maybe after that we can try and find a time to go home. <laughs> Yay guys, thank you so much. Um, please stick around for the raid. We'll go try and find someone amazing to raid now. Maybe we can see if someone else is playing Baldur's Gate perhaps. Who's here, daddy? Thanks for hanging out. Welcome in, my friend. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go to the main menu, get some nice background music for us. Thanks, Rasanet. Thanks, Breaver. Appreciate you hanging out. Oh my goodness, guys. That was so much fun. I love this game. I'm gonna be very sad when it's over. <laughs> but we have, like, basically just all fun, exciting quests left for us now. No more really, like, small side quests. It's all, other than finding Dribble's body part, I think all the rest is, like, main quests or, like, fun um, companion quests. Woohoo! Okay, let's go see who is online. We can go say hello to an amazing streamer, perhaps? Let's see. Um, hmm. I don't know who is playing Baldur's Gate right now. We could try and meet someone new. Anyone have any recommendations? Good night, Cloven. Um, Monday, yeah, Monday is the next stream. Thanks for hanging out. Um, hmm. I see uh, someone doing Act Three. She has the tag Milf Hunter, so she's probably lots of fun. <laughs> I'm trying to see what quest she's doing right now. I'm trying to turn. She says she's an Act Three. Uh, uh, Quali. We did raid Quali recently, but I think I want to raid someone playing Baldur's Gate. Okay, this person's also in the sewers right now. Okay, let's go raid. We're gonna go raid Biotic Nova. She is a new friend. We have not met her before. Nayan, thanks for the biddies. <laughs> um, we're gonna go uh, raid Biotic Nova. So let's do it, friends. She is also an Act 3 Baldur's Gate. She's in the sewers right now, so that's exciting. Let's go say hi to her. Uh, looks like she is gonna be a fun time. Uh, oh, have fun. Yeah, everyone enjoy the Super Bowl. Who's watching it tomorrow? I will not be, but I'm curious to see who's gonna win. Um, but yeah, I'll be back on um, Monday for more Baldur's Gate, and we'll go find Minsk, and then maybe we'll see what else we can do after that. I don't know how long the Minsk one will take, so cool. Cool, cool, cool. We got, we got our plans, though. 
the best the best laid plans. Am I right? <laughs> so we'll see we'll see how that goes. But uh, I will start the raid meow. So please come along for the raid. Thanks for staying for the raid, Cloven. I appreciate that. And um, I uh, guys, if you want to use raid one, if you don't have subscriber emotes, and raid two, if you do have subscriber emotes. Then um, I'm gonna copy raid number two there. And give that a little copy copy. Um, I also have my Discord. If anyone wants to join Discord. And then we have uh, my YouTube. And my social media. Uh, YouTube, I'm filming The Last of Us. I'm gonna try and film the next episode tomorrow of The Last of Us. I'm doing that exclusively for YouTube, Last of Us Part 1, if you want to check me out on there. Discord, we share our most uh, in-depth stream updates and life updates, whatever you want to share. Uh, you can share with us on Discord. And uh, yeah, my social media, my Instagram is probably the one I use the most. I just posted a new photo semi-recently on there. And um, let's go say hi to the lovely Biotic Nova, playing some more Baldur's Gate. And I am very excited to continue our journey on Monday, guys. Please take lots of good care of yourself um, until then. And I'll catch you on the flip side. Thank you so much for hanging out, everybody. Good night. Bye, 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 bye.